Blue Planet was attacked by billions of beasts. But the Dragon Kingdom, which is supposed to carry the burden, has abandoned all its carriers and nuclear weapons. It's because modern weapons can't do any harm to the foreigners who only have souls. Just when countless people thought that the Dragon Kingdom was going to fall, a clarion call suddenly sounded through the clouds and fog. One figure after another rushed out from the martyr's garden to stand in front of the foreigners. Countless ancestors used their bones to build a high wall against the evil spirits of all races, and turned their souls into sharp blades to fight again at the gate of the country. During the war, Yan Hua's forefathers fought abroad for seven days. Blood was spread all over the land, even forming a river in the center of the battlefield. But countless soldiers stood by the river of blood and never took a step back. If they didn't retreat in life, how can they retreat in death? Some of them have broken arms, some have lost their eyes. Seven days of battle had left their souls in tatters and their minds blurred. But there was one thing that was engraved in the marrow of their bones that they would never forget. And that was that they had to stay here for the long haul. Someone is still watching us. A soldier with a bloody face looks up at the sky. He's not looking at the blinding sun, he's looking at the millions of future generations far behind. Mom, I'm scared. I don't want to see it. It's scary. It's all being shown on the big screen in Yenhua City. The images were so gory that a child cried out in the street. But her mother, who was always gentle, held her back and roared, you have to see it. You have to remember what they look like. Not far from the mother and the little girl. You're breathing heavily in your hood. Yes, it must be seen. Now that we're weak, the only thing we can do is to look at these ancestors while they're watching over us. Even though you've been traveling for half a month, you can't help but get wet every time you see this scene. After trying all the modern weapons, the only way to resist the invasion is to revive the souls of the heroes of history to guard the gates of the country. But there is a prerequisite for reviving the souls, and that is that the story of the reviver must be true and well known to the people of the country. But the history of mankind was cut off during the invasion of the 10,000 races. Everyone in Yanhua has forgotten the history before the Qing dynasty. All the books and memories no longer exist, and even the only remaining modern history has only a few words. When the heroes finished spilling their blood, there was no one left to take over from Yanhua. Now everyone's heart is in a state of bitterness, as if the end of the country has become certain. Thinking of this, you wiped away your tears and looked firmly at the rainy sky. Yanhua 5000 years have countless elegance, since now no one knows the elegance, then I will tell it again. You go home, sit in front of your computer, open a history discussion forum, and there's a weapon that belongs to you. It's an account with 7 million followers, and that's all you can do. Many of the soldiers on the battlefield that weren't there were awakened by the stories you've told your countrymen through this account. When you close your eyes, countless contents will appear in your mind, this is the strange ability you've acquired since you came to this world. If you close your eyes, you can find out all the history, even the smallest details. But with this additional ability, you have a limitation. You can't tell stories that are too far removed from the time of the Kakusai warriors, and you can't even rely on your original memories to tell those stories in this world. Whenever you do this, you will pass out and sleep for a day. This relay race of historical souls seems to be something you can only tell slowly, without fast-forwarding or stopping. The keyboard and the rain outside the window combine to form an extremely sad symphony. Today, this song is called Yabai. If all the people of our country are like this, how dare the Japanese invaders violate Yenhua? Today's edition, The Four Row Warehouse, 800 Heroes. When you close your eyes and look at history, you will hear many, many voices. Today, you've heard the cries of the 800 heroes countless times. Let's come out. We're needed at the front. Kid, I'm yelling at you. Do you hear me? Let me go. Let's go. What are you doing? Right. I've got my gun up. You've got tears in the corners of your eyes. Okay, okay, don't rush me. Your retelling of history is not just a generalization, but also describes the specifics and details. For example, you start with the Hubei Security Regiment going to Shanghai to support the Battle of Songhu, and end with the retreat of the 524th National Revolutionary Army Regiment into the concession. You tell the story of what the 800 brave men went through. They fought for four days and nights against the Japanese invaders at the Little One Warehouse. The bravery and patriotism of their battle is worth remembering by all the people of China. At the same time, the details of the resistance, but also let a person just listen to the sniveling. An inch of mountain and river, an inch of blood, a cup of yellow soil, a cup of soul. It's raining outside the window, but it's not just the rain, it's also your tears on the desktop. At this time, you have come to a very tragic passage, that is, when the Japanese army used excavation to ram the building of the four-row warehouse with the intention of planting explosives to blow up the load-bearing walls and cause the building to collapse. Our grenades couldn't break through the steel plate formation, and the 800 brave men made the most deafening choice in the face of this scene. Chen Shushan, what are you doing? Give me this? He was covered in explosives and grenades and jumped off the building without hesitation. 
If you can't do it alone, then do it with more than one. If you can't break through, then use flesh and blood. It's human nature to fear death. But here, at the four-row warehouse, death was a welcome sight. Also, Tong Chang, Hubei, Li Monsong. Next, I'm unfilial. Mother, Lu Yang, Hunan, Wang Jindo. I'm Zhao Meng Liang, I'm Lu Beifu, Hubei Tongcheng, Sun Shoutsai. Mother, I'm leaving. There are many other heroic acts like them jumping to their deaths in the four-row warehouse. And every time one of your names is tapped on the computer, a figure comes up behind you. Your room shines with a yellowish light, and the 800 heroes are silently behind you. Waves of people come and go until you have typed all the words. The last 10 people remain in the room. Kid, you're a good writer, you make me look good, I like it very much. They want to talk to you, the kid who brought them back to life. I scored almost perfect in my high school language exams, and you're apologizing and trying to hold on to a smile. One of the leading officers walked up to you and shouted at you so many times, why are you letting us out now? Because I don't want you to die again, you can't stop your lips from trembling as you speak. Now the situation in the dragon country is not optimistic, the country can hold the door is completely with human life in the fill and this is only the initial foreigner's tentative attack, behind the battle will be even more grueling. What a child, is it so terrible to die? Resurrected and then die again, then die again, we a bunch of big men, afraid of pain or what? Seeing this, one of the very tough soldiers wanted to scold you, but was led by the officer glared fiercely. The officer's aura was very strong, but when he turned around, he changed into a gentle smiling face again. Thank you for caring about us, but we were born to guard this country, said the officer as he reached out and touched your head. Likewise, you are born to protect our country forever. All right, let's take the final step. Let's be known again. In the meantime, let's fight again. What you've written hasn't been posted on the internet for the world to see, so these dead souls are only half souls. They're not really revived yet, and they can't go to the battlefield yet. Wiping away your tears, you nodded your head, and then tapped your finger on the enter key. Due to the previous articles, you've already accumulated a large number of fans. So as soon as the new article came out, it instantly caused countless readers to comment on it. Here it comes, the professor of backfield salvation, today's article is here, excited ah. Professor's previous articles have really helped the front line. If it wasn't for the professor, I wouldn't have known that there were still so many soldiers in our country during the war period. As nationals, we couldn't do anything for the front line. Apart from watching the images from that special gate on TV every day, the only thing they can do is to see if they can fill in the missing historical content. Yen Hua, in the center, your articles have attracted the attention of the upper echelons of the country. After reading a bi story, everyone is in a state of shock. It's an honor for every soldier to die on the battlefield. Everyone there envied the 800 heroes, at least they died a meaningful death. Unlike now, as soldiers, they can only sit here and save the country. This is already his first article, how many times he has added troops to the front line. An old man with white hair and a somewhat taller figure inquired, to which a sturdy and serious man responded. Counting this time, the fourth time. We have contacted each other, but the other party only wants to talk to us on the internet, not meet us in reality. He's really good, the old man smiled, I hope he can keep on being good. Hoping that the miracle would continue, the old man went to the window and silently gave an order. Let all the cities prepare to ring the bell to see them off, and then a mournful sound rang throughout Yen Hua. With the sound of the bell, people from all over Yen Hua came out of their houses in unison. Every house is illuminated to send you to the front line. Ever since you first replenished the army, Yen Hua has had this special link. Even though you can't see anything when you come out, and even though the newly revived soldiers won't have to walk on the road, the newly recovered soldiers will be directly on the frontline battlefield, although the number of soldiers this time is not much. Although the number of soldiers this time is not large, and there are only a few hundred of them, what does it matter? If the pioneers come out, then everyone in Yenhua should go to see them. As more people read the article, the 800 warriors were finally able to go to the front. Their bodies are remodeled in the children's cries, their souls are nirvana in the new fire, and you follow them out the door. Next door, a little girl of 7 or 8 runs to your side. She's blind and can't see the mountains and the devastation of the earth, so she always has a smile on her young face. Brother, have the newly awakened soldiers reached us yet? The neighbors were laughing and crying as they listened to the little girl's words. The newly revived soldiers are directly revived on the frontline battlefield. They're only here for a ceremony, how could they come to them? But you smiled and touched his head and said, Oh, they're here, they're right in front of us. The people around you didn't pay much attention to this. They just thought it was a lie you told the children. But they didn't realize that you had called out all these newly revived soldiers, so many of them would come to say goodbye to you before they left. They are just ahead, standing there as half-souls before they are completely revived. Yao Yao, use your special sense to sense what they are doing. The little girl stared blankly, then held her hand as if she could really sense something. 
I can sense that they seem to be waving goodbye to me. That's right, they're waving goodbye to you. You looked ahead, and the spirit soldiers in front of you realized everything. With a laugh, they extend their hands and wave gently. They waved goodbye to you, to the little girl, and to the billions of descendants behind Yen Hua. The wind whipped like a farewell elegy, in front of the soldiers into smoke dissipated, belonging to their next stop as the front line, is still that the terrible smell of blood heavy place. The next stop for them was the front line, a place that still smelled of blood and horror. To live, to fight, to defend, to protect the country. On the front line, along with the new arrivals, there were countless old soldiers. Welcome to death. One old soldier rose to shake hands. He was answered by all the 800 soldiers. Who's afraid of death? When the two met. At the front line, there was only laughter. They had been beaten to death by the 10,000 tribes, but they could still laugh out loud. Then they shouted to the front, I'm still here. In terms of the overall strength of the country, Yenhua during the war period was not the strongest in the world, but in terms of the will to fight, these soldiers in the entire history of human civilization are absolutely deserved the first place. Let's talk about the specific situation here. The biggest officer among the 800 strong soldiers looked at the man in front of him, who looked like the leader of the old army, and said, the man was wearing a green hat with a red star in the center and a broken arm. When a dead soul is revived, the body must be sound. This means that his arm was chopped off again during the battle to protect the country after the resurrection. Where we are now is in front of Yen Hua's national gate, which is actually a huge protective barrier with three layers. The guards in front of us are the later generations, that is, those who have passed away in the Yen Hua army and have been revived. Since Yen Hua is already very powerful now, they get a lot of bonuses. However, due to the fact that they didn't know the information at the beginning, it was very difficult for them to defend the country. Soldiers will be rewarded according to the strength of their country, the stronger the country is, the more they will be rewarded. The officer of the 800 army shook his head and laughed, listening to the one-armed man's narration. It seems that the children and grandchildren of future generations have not failed us. Having said that, the officer of the 800 army inquired, and now, what about this stick of ours? The dead souls of the previous baton, having successfully held out for 30 days, had all dissipated. Then returning to reality, back to this baton, everyone now, what's the status of the battle? The gates of the country are large, and there are many recovered soldiers, now spread all over the place. The location we are at now is the 19th guard station of the national gate. The time that needs to be held is 30 days, the current is the 7th day, and we still need to hold it for 23 more days. The one-armed man laughed, it's thanks to you guys coming, otherwise our 19th station is really a bit dangerous. While saying that, the one-armed man looked around, died old many old many people, after living they all lived for 7 days, not yet enjoying it and then died, the pain suffered again, hey, you say this is all something ah. Then you guys take a rest first, next 19 station this side, we guard. The 800 army officer opened his mouth. The one-armed man froze violently, and afterward, laughed again, and with his only remaining hand, he pointed to the hat on his head. No, new brother, open your eyes and see, on this hat of mine, what is it labeled? Got it, got it, don't show me your red stars again. On the frontline battlefield, the 19th Guardian Station, the 800 Army was officially stationed. After being stationed, the officers of the 800 Army clearly felt the deep malice. A hat, a red star, show off a dozen times, old brother. The two parties fight each other, knowing that in the end you won. But now they have become teammates, we cannot always break the previous things. That can't be done, the good thing is to look at it all the time, this red star, he just looks good. The one-armed man walked around and around and around, literally making people laugh and cry. You know, we still have the modern military folks who guarded the gate last stick when we first recovered. At that time we even handed over and sang the national anthem together. By the way, I sing the national anthem beautifully, do you want to hear it? One forcefully pulled one. In the tragic frontline battlefield, such a joyful atmosphere is not common. The soldiers at station 19, seeing this scene, were all laughing and smiling. Until, roughly another hour had passed. With a foul-smelling wind coming through, it was only then that the soldiers at station 19, their expressions all changed at once. A new round of attack is coming again, these invaders are also not a bunch of oil-saving lights. The one-armed man took one last look at his hat and put it on, newcomers, let me introduce you. The 10,000 races, ah, uh, as the name suggests, are really thousands of messed up races outside of the world. Why are they invading us, we don't know, all we know is that if they come, we have to fight. There are quite a few powerful ones in the 10,000 races, but luckily, they are also restricted, and the strongest ones can't get in right now. The officer of the 800 army coughed, just say, whether the ones attacking us right now are single or mixed, as well as whether the ones coming are powerful or not, and just how powerful they are. Look at you, in a hurry again. The one-armed man bristled, isn't this just briefing you? Through the investigation of the previous Baton soldiers, as well as our Baton soldiers' exploration in these seven days. 
In total, ah, uh, there are seven grades given to the 10,000 races, grades 1 through 7, the higher up the scale, the more terrifying it is. Now then, the extraterrestrial races that can be rated above the third level definitely can't come, but the second level is already rampant. And of the second level, the ones that like to come to our side of Station 19 are mainly the Mantis Tiger race, as well as the Lesser Moon race. A narrative, speaking of the 800 army officer genus is really a headache, three levels cannot enter, how do you know that there are three levels, but also what the so-called level division, and, the Mantis Tiger tribe, the Small Moon tribe, what kind of name is this, you give up? Truth be told, this name is really I give up, that otherwise I also do not know what they are clan well. The one-armed man hemmed and hawed, just look like what, just give them what name. But the rank division is not false, some 10,000 races come with something on their bodies. We found some special book-like things and analyzed them by looking at the patterns on them. The 10,000 races site also brought things with them, and some even brought books, and the officer of the 800 army froze. When we fought the war, we didn't also bring things, food ah weapons ah, heirlooms ah, envelopes ah, it's normal to bring books. The one-armed man carried out the next explanation, and then, looking ahead, realized that the fog had already appeared in front of him. Hey, can't pull it, can't pull it anymore, here it comes, all prepare, fight. Accompanied by the one-armed man's order, on this side of station 19, all the soldiers all mustered up their energy. Staring carefully ahead, in the thick fog, finally, the 800 army officers saw the appearance of the incoming enemy. The body was as huge as a tiger, had the same markings as a tiger, yet it also had twin blades like a praying mantis. No wonder the one-armed man named it the Mantis Tiger Clan, the appearance was indeed a combination of mantis and tiger. What are you gawking at? The one-armed man looked at the 800 army officer. The 800 army officer spoke, nothing, just preparing for battle. The one-armed man was happy as he reached out and patted the 800 army officer on the shoulder, live a little longer. Regardless of what conflicts everyone had back then, whether they were antagonistic or not, there was only one name now. Protect me Yen Hua. The one-armed man shouted, and as one voice fell, 10,000 voices came out, protect me Yen Hua. Everyone in the 800 army, too, was following the one-armed man's outstretched army, shouting with vigor. As for the officer of the 800 army, he shook his head and also opened his mouth with a smile, protect me Yen Hua, the guns carried a greenish light, and now the only thing that greeted the crowd was battle, Yen Hua deep, all the big screens in the plazas, or on the TVs and computers in people's homes, at this moment, all of them were showing images from the front line, the national gate that was a barrier, captured for everyone in real time the images of the battles that belonged to every guardian station in their country, and since the 800 soldiers were just recovering today, so many people watching would also directly tune the screen to the Guardian Station where the 800 heroes were on their computers at home. Found it, today Professor Wynn's newly revived, augmented frontline 800 strongmen went to Guardian Station number 19. After seeing such information on the internet, Winning Sky also adjusted his channel to Station number 19. At this time, the battle was already halfway through. The gory images of the battle could only be said to be extremely unsuitable for children to watch. Protect me Yen Hua, protect me Dasha. Sitting in front of the computer, Winning Sky quietly watched the entire battle of this round. The 10,000 races that launched the attack this round had come to attack for a total of 15 minutes. The deaths and injuries of the Mantis Tiger race and the Lesser Moon race during these 15 minutes were actually not much. However, the deaths and injuries of the recovering soldiers in front of Yen Hua Country's Gate were extremely terrifying. Many more soldiers under the one-armed man died, and many more of the 800 brave men died as well. No matter which way they looked at it, this battle was theirs to lose. But, after the battle ended, the one-armed man was directly laughing out loud. A victory, a great victory. Obviously, his own family had such serious deaths and injuries, yet he said that it was a great victory. This could only mean that the deaths and injuries on this side before were even more terrifying. It was so horrifying that even the death of so many people could now be counted as a victory. Looking at the situation on the 19th Guardian Station's side, Yen Hua's deeper layers, countless people, all shed tears. The current Yan Hua National Gate was really the soldiers guarding it with their lives. I really didn't expect that there aren't many of you, but you fight quite fiercely. At the front line, the one-armed man looked at the officer of the 800 army. The 800 army officer was silent for two seconds and smiled as well, that's natural. At the end of the first battle, looking at the dead and wounded, the 800 army officer was also a bit sad. But on second thought, it was meant to come back to die again, deaths and injuries, what was there to be sentimental about? As long as it wasn't completely wiped out, as long as it could still continue to defend, then, indeed, it was a great victory. We have to thank that little guy for this, we couldn't have come without him. After every round of attack by the 10,000 races, there would be a rest period for a certain amount of time. Or rather, it was that special restriction that was currently fending off the high-grade 10,000 races. 
While fending off the high-grade 10,000, it was also limiting the 10,000 in many other ways. For example, the number of monsters that could be sent out in each round, and how long the interval must be after each round. Regardless, anyway, after this round of battle, everyone on the front line was finally able to catch their breath again. Thus, as they sat down to rest, the officers of the 800 army finally had the time to mention Win Tian who had called them out. The kid surnamed Win? The one-armed man snapped. The 800 army officer froze, you know him? How can I not know him? The front line has increased its troops several times, basically because this kid called them. The one-armed man laughed loudly, one to say one, that kid shouting is really a hand, shouted to the powerful, the 7th guardian station side, before almost lost, thanks to that kid increased a little bit of troops, and now continue to defend down. Now this side of the front line ah, station to station, who all know the main for our front line to increase the troops, is such a winning professor. The 800 army officer froze for a moment, then shook his head with a smile, in a way, he is more important than us. Isn't that nonsense? The one-armed man was particularly open-minded, we came out, and were only guarding for 30 days. That kid is different, the relay of baton after baton of Yen Hua's national gate can all depend on him. The officer of the 800 army raised his head to the sky, he felt that winning sky should be looking at him right now. He wanted to say something to winning sky, such as cheer up, work hard and so on. But in the end, all the words were all swallowed back into his stomach. He didn't say anything, he just smiled. After that, he quietly waited, waiting for the next round of attack by the 10,000 clans. Why the 10,000 races came, just like when the 10,000 races would leave, no one knew. The revived undead warriors in front of the gates of each country could only do what they were supposed to do. That is, keep defending and keep fighting until the next baton of the relay race arrived. In the next few days, Winning Sky didn't add any more troops to the front line. Like he said before, every time he increased his army, he needed something like divine sense. So he rested for a few days until, four days later. That is, the morning of the 11th day of the resistance period dead soldiers, guarding the national gate. The 27th guarding station of Yen Hua's national gate, all the ancestors who recovered and came out, all died in battle. When this news was sent back, the entire Yen Hua deep, was in a state of shock. Of course, if it was just this, it wouldn't be enough to make everyone scared like this. This was because when one guardian station ran out of people, the other guardian stations would then split up and send over some soldiers. What really made everyone lose their minds was that the attack on the other guardian battles from the 10,000 races side also became more violent. This made it extremely difficult for the military dead of the other stations to just guard the station they were at, let alone dividing their troops. Did the 10,000 races take gunpowder this wave, how come all of a sudden, the attack has gotten so much fiercer? Don't you know that, after 30 days of defending the battle, every 10 days, the 10,000 tribes offense will be a bit more fierce. Yen Hua's side is a bit miserable, other stations are having a hard time guarding, and one station is even directly out of soldiers. To this, I can only say, fortunately our forefathers, our previous generation, were graceful enough. The invasion of the 10,000 races, the people of the various countries were not all just concerned about their own countries. Certain countries that had fought well on the front lines were now eager to watch the war from all over the world. When they saw that the situation on the Yen Hua side was so bleak, many people from various countries started chatting. The pretty country, the Sakura country, the chariot country, and the woolly bear country were the first to bear the brunt. Of the four countries that were more comfortable at the current stage, the deeper populations of the Mawat and chariot countries were fine. Either because of their own character, or because of the modern era, they didn't have much verbal mockery. But the pretty country and the Sakura country were different, and now their deep populations had mouths that were grinning up to the sky. Yen Hua looks like it's going to be over, the gates of the country will soon, be broken. My suggestion is for Yen Hua to hurry up and announce its dissolution now, and then defect to our pretty country. Dissolving one's own country and defecting to another country will also be attributed to another country, so in a way it is also a way to survive, don't worry, our pretty country side of the undead soul soldiers are very powerful, is sure to be able to guard everyone. Or it's not bad to come to our cherry blossom country side, has anyone from Yen Hua's side watched us yet, we beat the 10,000 races that came to invade in the last round, and there weren't many deaths and injuries. Due to the fact that the two countries were more powerful during the war, the soldiers of the two countries were extremely additive at the moment. Of course, it wasn't as exaggerated as their own bragging about being able to beat the 10,000 races to death was. However, no matter what, they were indeed able to carry out such words now. These people, they really are too arrogant. Who let the people frontline be so fierce, they have arrogant capital. Pity me Yen Hua, is it really going to end here? Even if it doesn't end, so what? Don't forget, after this, we still have the Qing dynasty to pull down. Those dogs of the Qing dynasty won't be able to hold on for long. Yes, the most important thing is, before the Qing dynasty, we even lost our history. Looking at the various discussions of foreign people, Yen Hua's side of the people are also sad. 
The atmosphere of sadness once again filled the country, for a time, everyone is somewhat do not know what to do. When the dead ancestors couldn't defend the country, the country's gate would be broken, and once the country's gate was broken, Yan Hua's side would surely be annihilated. Unless, it was really like what some people abroad were saying now, the country was dissolved on the spot and then merged into another country. In that case, the other country's barrier would also cover over and form a new national gate. Then the soldiers of the other country would also be teleported over to perform a share of guarding. Could it be that the final result of our Yen Hua is really just a country without a country? This day, such a heavy question was added to the hearts of many Yen Hua people. In Elm City, at this time, the discussions of the people abroad on the internet were all watched by Winning Sky as well. His fists were clenched extremely tightly, if it wasn't for the fact that the deeper levels of the countries were also separated by barriers right now. He was really wanting to find a pretty country or Sakura country's countrymen to fight. A country with only 200 years of history, a country that was once affiliated with my Yenhua. It's just more powerful in this current stick, how can it be so arrogant? At this moment, for the populace of these two countries, there was only one word to evaluate in Winning Sky's mind, and that was villainous. However, he could also understand this, after all, a lot of the existing history of this world relies on the literature to fill in the blanks. Or the documents are fake, or the upper level wants to fake, anyway, in the eyes of the lower level people of the pretty country, the history of their pretty country is very long, even if other countries find out the documents about their 200 years of history, they don't believe in it at all, they only believe in the fake documents there, as well as the upper level's subsequent fabrication of all kinds. And the Sakura country, it is similar, the documents to complete the history itself is not always completely true. On their side, it was also the upper echelons and some fake documents, as well as mental entrapment, that made them think that their historical position further up the line was also extremely high. The current military people who have taken over the Baton are extremely powerful, and their historical position further up the line is not bad, which has led them to this villainous appearance now. Only these two sides were arrogant, while at least this Baton that their country was now taking over was indeed powerful, and was swimming in the front line. What made Win Tianji speechless was that in the various chit-chat on the internet, he even saw some of the people of the kimchi country talking. Incorporated into our kimchi country can also be, Yu Yen Hua Ching is very poor, above the Qing is the history of the fault, but think no fault recovery out is not a powerful soldier, but our kimchi country is different, the more we kimchi country up, the more magnificent, the more powerful. You guys stepped on the horse, is it the upper echelons of the country deceiving you deceiving you too hard, or is it you yourselves deceiving yourselves deceiving you too hard that you can end up getting high on yourselves like this? Well, there is also a possibility that the literature left behind by your forefathers was also nothing but bragging and reading fake literature, and this is what caused you to be so brainless now. Yes, 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 the higher up you go in history, the more magnificent you are, just, can you relay this baton? Why do I feel that before our Yen Hua is finished, your kimchi country will be finished first? If Yen Hua was in a dangerous situation, then kimchi country was being beaten to a dog on the front line right now. In this situation, even have the mind to fantasize after. Winning Sky could only say, please, pay attention to your current. What's more, the history of your kimchi country further up is really not strong ah. Uh. After hitting the keyboard and disliking a kimchi country netizen with a small number, Wintry took a deep breath. Winning Sky took a deep breath, and turned back to his big number. There was one more thing to mention here. That was the absolute security of Winning Sky's privacy. This thing was also something he checked after closing his eyes. Although he didn't know why the history library had this. But since it was there, then he naturally used it straight away. The front line now, is it already critical? Sitting in front of the computer, Winning Sky knew that he had to strike again. There was actually not much he could do to help in the current guarding of the country's gate segment. Because his divine sense was limited, the number of soldiers he called out each time was also limited. Moreover, after calling out a wave each time, he would have to rest for a wave. The only way to bring down the impact of this drawback was to wait. As the length of time the frontline generals guarded the national gate grew, Winning Sky's divine sense threshold as well as his recovery speed would also increase. According to his estimation, around the time of the Great Ming, he would basically be able to call on the army on a daily basis and in large quantities. The current me can only help the frontline a little bit, but even if it's just a little bit, I have to help a little bit more. Winning Sky felt that he had recovered almost as much as he could over the past few days. Thus, both hands were placed on the keyboard. A new round of calling for troops on Yen Hua's side officially began. Die where you are, be buried where you are, the world is the same as the Green Mountains. Today's edition, the mainstay, the Dongjiang Column. Dongjiang Column, all known as the Guangdong People's Anti-Japanese Guerrilla Army Dongjiang Column, is in the Anti-Japanese War Period. Our party created and led a People's Anti-Japanese Army in the Dongjiang area of Guangdong Province, with the Changya Column, the 8th Root Army, the new 4th Army, and is known as the mainstay of China's War of Resistance. 
Today, it is such a huge army that Win Tian wants to call for recovery. His total number of people, totaling more than 11,000 people, was more than all the armies that Winning Sky had called on before. This was also the reason why the resistance seniors had guarded the country's gates for a long time, giving Winning Sky's divine sense threshold enough time to grow. Otherwise, before that, it would have been impossible for Winning Sky to conjure this army. With this army in place, the situation on the front line should be able to get a lot better. Winning Sky took a deep breath. As a matter of fact, this army, the Dongjiang Column, should be very famous. With such a large number of people, there shouldn't be no documentation. However, in this side of the world, there were certain documents that he just couldn't find in an extremely outrageous manner. According to Winning Sky's speculation, this matter should still be related to the historical amnesia event of the entire human race a few decades ago. The 10,000 races knew that humans could rely on historical dead souls to guard the country's gates, so they carried out a special operation in advance for the current invasion. This operation not only made everyone's certain memories dissipate and they could only rely on documents to restore history, but also destroyed some documents. Documents about the Dongjiang column should also be missing at that time. Otherwise, the war period belonged to the post-Qing dynasty. There is no such selfishness as the Qing dynasty willfully destroyed all the literature operation. After that some big army should not have no literature records only right. One can only be thankful that that operation of the 10,000 races only destroyed a tiny bit of the subsequent literature. Otherwise, if the literature about those of the 8th root army were to be destroyed as well, then Yan Hua would really be finished. Those before the Qing dynasty were destroyed by the Qing dynasty, and those after the Qing dynasty were destroyed by the 10,000 races. I'm the only one, and I'm also the one with limited divine sense who needs time to increase his threshold and recover. I'm afraid that my head will be used to blow up, and in the end, I won't be able to guard that front line layer by layer of the country's gates. Thoughts drifted away for a short while, and soon, Winning Sky returned to the main line of summoning soldiers. On the one hand was that the front line was in a real crisis right now, and he had to hurry. On the other hand was that in the back of his mind, these soldiers from the Dongjiang column also really couldn't wait. Alright, alright, I'll let you guys out now. Focusing his attention completely, tapping the keyboard with both hands, Winning Sky began his play. He tapped the keyboard extremely fast. However, the depiction of the Dongjiang column did not become rough because of this. When evoking an army, detailing the army was also a very important step. Otherwise, simply describing it roughly in one or two sentences would not be able to revive this army at all. On this side, Winning Sky was frantically accelerating his speed without affecting the quality. On the other hand, at the same time, a new round of invasion from the 10,000 races had come to the frontline battlefield. Damn, can't these bastards be killed enough? Why are there more and more of them? This time it's more fierce than all the previous ones, all cheer up and fight to the death. If the battalion commander dies, the company commander goes, if the company commander dies, the platoon commander goes, if the platoon commander dies, the squad leader goes. The increasingly ferocious attacks of the 10,000 races hit the generals on the front line of Yen Huan killed and wounded them like crazy. But this wasn't the most crucial, the most crucial, was still the 27th station that was no longer occupied. Because all of the soldiers who were guarding the town were dead, so that place had already become unguarded at this time. Has the 27th guard station already suffered an invasion by the 10,000 races attacking the gate? In the midst of this 100,000 fire, in the end, the Yenhua seniors made their choice. Each station was splitting up their troops, and the pressure that arose from the splitting up of their troops, they then put up another share of their lives to fight it. Yenhua soldiers, they are worthy of honor. Deep in the chariot country, many of the people of the chariot country were also looking at the situation on Yenhua's side. After seeing the Yenhua soldiers will to fight like this, they all admired them to the extreme. Similarly, it was the same on the Mawat kingdom's side, dear Dewari clan, go for it, hold on. Under the attention of countless people, time just passed by bit by bit. Twenty minutes later, this round of the 10,000 races invasion finally came to an end. Compared to the various invasions in front of them, this round of the 10,000 races attack, the casualties inflicted on the front lines of the various countries should be the greatest. The pretty country, the woolly bear country, the chariot country and these were okay. Because the country's status was extremely high during the resistance period in the first place. So the additions they were getting now were also extremely high. Even if they were to face the 10,000 races in this round, they would be able to do so with ease. But, the front lines of the other countries, under the ravages of this round of the 10,000 races, would be miserable. That blown up to the point of outrageousness, more than 10 guardian stations of the pickle country were already directly beaten to no one. And after being hit to no one, their first barrier, the National Gate, had also been hit to the point of shattering. On the side of the Elephant Country, it wasn't too good either, although it wasn't as bad as the Pickle Country, it was also already in danger. In the end, what makes people extremely surprised is still Yen Hua. 
Before this round of invasion by the 10,000 races, everyone thought that the one in the most dire straits was Yan Hua, but unbelievably, relying on extremely strong willpower, Yan Hua was able to block this round of attacks after all. Every guardian battle was defended despite heavy deaths and injuries. And what about the 27th station's side? Because of the support from multiple parties, the final barrier national gate was also without a single crack. When such a result appeared, Yan Hua deep down, countless Yan Hua people cried out. When Winning Sky finished writing a new call to arms text, it was just about the time when the round of battles ended. He had a small window open and was similarly watching the battle at the front line. Originally, he thought that this time, no matter what, he would be able to control his emotions. But in the end, he still did not control it. Because in that image, he saw two people. One was the officer of the 800 army that he had conjured up. One was the one-armed man wearing a green-red star hat. In this round of fighting, both of them were seriously injured and could not survive. And before they died, the last thing they did was lie on the ground and look at the sky. Or rather, they were looking at Winning Sky, who was far away in Elm City and was also looking at them. Kid, I'm sorry, my guarding didn't last long. The officer of the 800 army had an extremely self-condemning look on his face. As for the one-armed man, he was still wearing a smile at the corner of his mouth. Even though I haven't met that kid, I also have something I want to say to him. Well, kid, next, can all rely on you, we do believe in you. But also pay attention to ah, when it is time to rest, rest, do not try to be strong. Otherwise, it'll be like the two of us. Really, the fall is also too fast. The one-armed man coughed up some blood. And then, his eyelids suddenly became extremely heavy. He didn't want to sleep, but he really couldn't carry on. Arise, people who don't want to be slaves. He took the hat with the red star into his hands again. Form our flesh and blood into our new great wall. He tried to finish the song, but in the end, he ran out of energy. It was just a matter of opening his eyes at last and seeing the world again. The sun has risen ah. Did the sun rise? Actually, no. It was cloudy today, and dark clouds covered the sky. Besides, even if the sun had risen, so what? Ever since the invasion of the 10,000 races the sun had become tremendously poisonous, especially on the front lines. That rising sun was even more harmful. Is this veteran of Yen Hua hallucinating before he dies? Some of the foreign people saw the scene and asked questions. The people of Yen Hua did not know how to answer their question. However, Winning Sky knew, it's not an illusion, but the sun has really appeared. The sun here was not the sun in the sky that had been subjected to a mutation and had become extremely bad. Rather, it is the light that can truly save the world, that is, I. Yen Hua will not die, the great summer's gates will not be broken, I said it, I said it. At this moment, if someone was beside Winning Sky, they would have noticed that Winning Sky's eyes had turned golden. The obsession of wanting to protect the country's gates, so that the soldiers on the front line who had passed away one after another could sleep at ease once again. The whole person suddenly entered an extremely crazy and wrong state. And this state of affairs produced the effect, that is to win the sky has just finished writing a call to arms new article. The next moment, he immediately opened a new document and started a new writing, a new summoning. The divine sense in his body began to surge, if before was a drop of water into the body, then now is to open the faucet gushing out, although I do not know exactly what this is because of, and there will be no side effects, but it does not matter, all does not matter. Side effects or not, other also be, at this moment the winning day mind only left a thought, that is, this Yen Hua's country door, he must keep. The keyboard sound crackled, non-stop, and at this new writing, the article about the Dong Zhang column that Win Tian had written before was also finally successfully uploaded. Quickly look online, prof. Win has increased troops for the front line again, this time, it's the Dong Zhang column. Dong Zhang column, wait, how many people are in this army, 11,000? In the past when prof. Win increased his troops for the front line, has he ever increased it by this much? That certainly did not ah, 11,000 soldiers, is very difficult to be missed by the literature, and therefore do not need to make up will also appear directly on the battlefield, and if it did not appear, really was missed, that means that it certainly in decades ago amnesia events associated with the literature was destroyed at that time, the literature was destroyed, prof. When are able to restore it out? Maybe there are still some special hidden documents, it's really unlikely that they can still be recovered after being completely destroyed. No matter what, these 11,000 soldiers are really going to bring big help to the front line. The 10,000 races kept invading, and at this moment, Yen Hua could be said to be in the most difficult time. They had just fended off one of the craziest attacks of the 10,000 races in a while. But after fending it off, the next attack from the 10,000 races was something they would have a hard time fending off. But now, now that Winning Sky's call to arms text was out, everything was going to be different. A whole 11,000 soldiers, though not to say that the Yen Hua Kingdom Gate would be 100% defended. But the next wave of attacks from the 10,000 races will definitely be able to be held off. 
Yenhua, Yat Province, Hiluo City. Zhang Hanan was at the first moment that Winning Sky released the article. Then he also started reading the new article. Time passed bit by bit. When everything about the Dongzhang column was understood, Zhang Hanan's eyes were also moist and he nodded his head in excitement. Yen Hua could still continue to move forward. The Yen Hua National Gate can still continue to be guarded. Professor Win, what exactly are you? At this moment, Zhang Hanan's curiosity towards Win Tian rose to an unprecedented level. If she could, she was truly eager to take a look at this man who kept creating miracles. In the entire Yen Hua Deep Layer, there were at least 10 million other people who shared the same thoughts as Zhang Hanan at this moment. Winning Sky's one operation had really reshaped everyone's worldview and made everyone feel crazy. After the article was hot enough, the Dong Zhang column also finally had a chance to recover as well as head to the front lines. As always, Yen Hua's side still sounded the send a tweet. All the people in Yen Hua's hierarchy went out to see them off. However, this time, Winning Sky did not go out. Mom, where's brother Winning Sky? The little girl next door was a bit lost. Every time, she could hear Winning Sky's footsteps. But this time, she didn't feel anything. Maybe brother Winning Sky is sick. The little girl's mom replied like this. It wasn't good for her to say anything else. After all, sending an ancestor. It was a very important matter. Unless one is sick and doesn't go out. Otherwise it would be disrespectful anyway. Well, it turns out. Besides being sick, not seeing each other off for another reason. It's also perfectly fine. For example, the real reason why Winning Sky didn't go out right now. At this moment, within Winning Sky's room, there were five or six soldiers. These were the leaders of the Dongzhang column. Winning Sky was continuing to pound on the keyboard like crazy. They, on the other hand, were standing behind Winning Sky, looking at him. This little guy, he didn't even bother us for a second after calling us out. Understandable, after all, he has more important things to do. I don't blame him, I'm just, a little worried about him. Maybe we should talk to him. Persuade him how, by asking him to give up guarding the country's gates? In front of all the tribes, we, as well as he, seem to have no choice. Like them who were willing to go to their deaths once again in order to defend the nation's gate. The current winning sky was also already left with only defending the nation's gates in his heart. No one could stop him who was now disregarding his personal safety. Just as no one could stop the Yenhua soldiers who wanted to go to the front line. All we can do now is to live up to him. Go to the front line and resist for a little longer, and a little longer, until the country's gates are defended. The crowd from the Dongzhang column had finally left. With the billions of people of Yen Hua seeing them off, they headed to the front line to protect the country's gates. 11,000 people, so many have come this time. It's the Dongzhang column, they've come out too. This is great, with them we can hold out for a long time again. At least Station 27 won't be empty anymore. The old soldiers at the front line were all excited when they learned that there were new recruits arriving. These days, they too had been living a very hard life, and they had a lot of worries. But what they were worried about was not the war, but the fear of not being able to successfully defend the country's gates. Now, another reinforcement from Winning Sky made them all feel much better. Dongjiang Column, ah, old friends. Some of the old soldier officers, their mouths were tinged with smiles. As a matter of fact, quite a lot of soldiers that were left out or had their literature destroyed they were aware of. But being on the front line, they couldn't reveal a single point of these contents and the back. Before the rear did not have their own complete restoration of the historical content. Everything they said about restoration would be blocked. In order to invade the earth, the 10,000 races really did a lot of preliminary preparations. But fortunately, at the back of Yen Hua, there is still someone like Win Tian. The 10,000 races thought they were fully prepared. However, they didn't want to miss the biggest variable, winning sky. There's no need to split up your troops, guard your own stations well. Station 27 will be guarded by our Dongzhang column. After arriving at the frontline battlefield, the Dongzhang column directly took root at station 27. The once weakest station 27 had instead become the most reassuring. In that case, then we are also finally able to guard our own side with peace of mind. Ah. In front of the Yenhua Kingdom's gate, the generals of the other guardian stations all let out a sigh of relief. They all looked ahead, towards the 10,000 races that would come again in a short while. It was raining in the sky again, and unlike before, there was constant thunder today. That thunder shook people a bit. Well, it would be nothing if it was just thunder. But when thunder comes out, it must be accompanied by lightning. These strange lightning on the front line, they don't attack the 10,000 races, they only attack the generals of various countries. If I'm not wrong, it's 9 times out of 10 that the 10,000 races also relied on special means to make it whole. It's not easy to defend your own side either. Yen Hua's soldiers were all a bit bitter for a moment. They looked at the time, counting today, there are still a full 20 more days to defend. Defending for only 10 days was extremely difficult for everyone. 
The next step was to defend for another 20 days, and the invasion of the 10,000 races would be even more violent during these 20 days. Under the constant thunder, the hearts of the Yan Hua frontline soldiers that had just loosened up a bit could be said to have been lifted up again. At this moment, there was not much they could do, and the only thing they could do was to try to defend as much as possible. As for the end, whether or not they could carry through these 20 days, they really couldn't do anything about it. Time passed for roughly another hour, and an hour later, a new round of invasion from the 10,000 races came. This time, it wasn't as fierce as the last round, but it was really too much stronger than the very first few days. At the end of the round of fighting, on Yen Hua's side, the casualties of the soldiers had increased quite a bit more. There were even some guard stations that were starting to be particularly, particularly short of people. And contrary to before, the one that held the most stable guard this time was instead the 27th Guardian Station. The ones that were once going to be divided and guarded stood still, and the ones that were once given a division instead were all unsteady. This kind of scene, no matter who watched it, was afraid that they would all have to sigh with emotion or really damn dramatic. On the side of the 10,000 races, they also seemed to have realized the reversal of the situation on Yen Hua's side. Thus, in the next round of attack, they also adopted a special strategy. On the 27th station side, the number of invading races directly decreased by half. And the lesser ones? They all went to other guardian stations. Even if the 10,000 races are powerful, some of them are also intelligent. This is the most difficult point in guarding the country's gates, ah. After the 10,000 races main attacked the other stations, the soldiers of the Dongzhang column also immediately went out to support them. But what happened after the support? And then after that, the 10,000 would again main attack the 27th station. This kind of crazy fighting back and forth caused Yen Hua's side to suffer a lot. But in the end, the main reason it could be so was because Yen Hua's side was too weak. If the number of soldiers was large enough, the base strength of the soldiers received enough bonus. The various schemes of the 10,000 races, simply, could have been cracked. The 10,000 clans, this is a young scheme. Looking at everything on the frontline battlefield, the people of Yen Hua's deeper layers were extremely stifled. Zheng Hanan was the same, and a strong sense of despair struck her once again, causing her to somewhat not dare to look at it anymore. Thus, she turned off the live window of the frontline battlefield and began to look at the rest of the content on the internet. Nowadays, there was nothing related to entertainment on the internet. The news, videos, and people's talk were basically related to the frontline or history. Hawk Jam, Harry Bear, Chariot, and the people of Sakura are still watching steadily from their high platforms. Pickles, where are the elephants, being beaten beyond recognition, and their populace are all extremely hard to take right now. Well, in addition to being hard to bear, the Pickles side was making a special point of continuing to associate them with their history before. The attention kept shifting, and finally, Zhang Hanan looked to the history discussion group in her university. I just went to the village, my grandfather said that there are some old books, but unfortunately, none of them have anything to do with history ah. Me too, I searched a whole lot of it and posted it online, but it turned out that none of them could successfully summon soldiers, they were all fake. With the Dongzhang column on the frontline battlefield, things are a bit better, but only a bit better, we're still doomed at this rate. Everyone was running around, looking for ways to see if they could help the frontline a little. But unfortunately, it was really too hard to check and fill in the gaps, and all of these people ended up with no results. In this world, after all, not everyone can be like Prof. Win, able to constantly create miracles. Zhang Hanan shook her head, opened the history forum again, and clicked into Winning Sky's homepage. She wanted to read the article on the Dongzhang column again to see if she could find some inspiration. However, what Zhang Hanan didn't expect in any way was. With this wave of tapping, the East River column's article wasn't seen first. When the homepage lit up, the first thing that came into view was actually another, new article on troop reinforcement. This, am I reading it wrong? Zhang Hanan was dumbfounded. She rubbed her eyes and went to look again. However everything in front of her was still how it should be. Winning Sky had really posted a new article again. But, how was this possible? If she remembered correctly, Winning Sky had just posted a new article this morning, right? And it was also a great article about the Dongzhang column, designing a super troop increase of a full 11,000 people. Zhang Hanan was so frantic that she couldn't even breathe. Her heart pounded non-stop, holding her breath, Zhang Hanan clicked on Winning Sky's new article. The familiar opening, the familiar four big words, today's editions. It's really another augmentation text, prof. Win, prof. When, is he still human? How can other people not be able to dig up something, he has just finished writing one, and here it comes again. Zhang Hanan began to read carefully, and after reading, she realized that the army that Wing Tian had increased this time was a unit in the Sichuan army. The number of this troop is not as horrible as the last wave of the Dongzhang column, but it is still a thousand people. 
Moreover, the most important thing was that this additional subordinate unit of the Sichuan army this time was particularly strong and fierce in combat. Professor Wynn sent out an article, that means he has already confirmed that this must be the real historical army. So that, so quickly, Prof. Wynn then also really is another additional army for the front line. The eyes could not help but moisten, this time. Zhang Hanan was not only crying for the military seniors in the article, but also for Wen Tian. This crying carried excitement, gratitude, and endless admiration as well as incredulity. Sure enough, there were only wrong names, no wrong nicknames, the savior of the backfield he was really saving the world ah. In the entire backfield, there is no one comparable to Professor Wen. Just after adding an army, immediately another army comes, this speed, I just want to ask, who else? With the addition of this army, the front line will be able to support it again, prof. Wynn is really participating in the war as well. If, in the end, our national gate can be defended, prof. Wynn will definitely be able to claim a big share of the credit. After the article fermented, for a while, people's discussion about winning Sky on the internet reached another climax. Yen Hua, the center department. Looking at winning Sky's new article, the old man's eyes also opened to a great extent at this moment. This time, how come it's so fast? The old man inhaled and exhaled deeply. To the side, the robust and serious man spoke, it might be that two pieces of information happened to be unearthed at the same time. But these two pieces of information are really not very related, one is the Dongzhang column and the other is the Sichuan army. The old man was incredulous, this guy, he really carries too many unknowns with him. Yes, he's too powerful. The robust and serious man nodded. The old man smiled, so, what are you waiting for? Start sending the chimes to add more troops to my front line, with the old man's order. The entire Yanhua once again resounded with the sound of the sound sending. As usual, everyone went out to send off each other. As for Winning Sky, he still didn't go out. Mom, why didn't Brother Winning Sky come out again? The little girl somewhat missed Winning Sky. Didn't I tell you, Brother Winning Sky is sick? It hasn't even been a day yet, how can he be sick? The little girl's mom looked into the distance. The rain kept falling, and there was another thunderclap. With the crowd seeing them off, the new troop headed for the front line. This thousand-man troop should be able to share a lot for the front line again. It's just a pity that our Yenhua, ah, the general environment right now is too bad. The additional troops can share some of the burden, but in the end, it won't change the current direction of the story. Yenhua, center sector. The old man looked out the window with an extremely complicated mood. Having new reinforcements made him happy. However, when he thought about the general environment of the front line, it would be extremely difficult again. The backfield, after all, cannot help the front line too much. The old man looked at the window for a long time. In the end, leaning on his crutches, he prepared to leave. However, the door to this center sector had only just opened. The robust and serious man who had left for a while then also came back. Didn't I tell you to take care of something, why are you here again? The old man frowned, slightly puzzled. The robust man was very hurried, chief, I've already arranged for those matters to be dealt with. Coming over now, there is also a big reason, look at this. The robust man took out two pieces of a four paper printed full of text. The old man took them and began to read. Today's supplement. The document had just read the beginning, and the old man was dumbfounded. This familiar text, familiar style. Professor Wynn? The old man snapped. The robust man nodded, yes, it's Professor Wynn. He's released a new augmentation text, this is what I printed off from the internet. The old man's breathing became rapid, he, didn't he just release two texts? This is today's third article, it's an omitted unit in the Dian army, 7,000 men. A dizziness, the old man almost didn't stand still, thanks to the robust man's quick eyes and hands, holding him up. This Professor Win, this Professor Win. The entire Yen Hua, billions of subjects, must be grateful to him. The old man's eyes were moist, he was too excited. The speed of this troop increase, made his entire person, follow some boiling. Three texts in one day, increasing troops by almost 20,000, good, good. Originally, the old man was ready to go back to rest. Now look, what else to rest? He wants to watch the live broadcast. He wants to see the battle on the front line. It's still the sending Ming sending army. It's still winning the sky before it arrives. In the blink of an eye, the front line was very different. Good lord, the speed at which these new recruits are coming is a bit excessive, isn't it? It's that Professor Win again, this guy, he can do it. Guawazi, aren't you the Sichuan army, your folks are here. Originally, I thought it was going to be over in the next few days, but now I see that I can hold it for many more days. Is this Wynn family's little brat still a human being, is it really powerful to this extent? Three troop increases in one day. It shocked the entire Yen Hua deep. It also shocked all the soldiers at the front line. Before, the soldiers at the front line were already interested in winning Sky. Now with this kind of sensation, that curiosity was naturally even more pressed. 
To the new recruits who came to support them, the old soldiers were asking all sorts of questions. In the face of these inquiries, the new recruits' answers were also very uniform. No matter what the question was, there was only one final answer. That was, that kid, he really has given too much for Yen Hua. Yes, he really has helped Yen Hua too much. The old soldiers at the front line and the people at the back nodded their heads. However, the new recruits were aware that these old soldiers and the people in the rear. Obviously, they were unable to understand the true meaning of the word pay. After hearing their words, those people would only think that the word pay here means contribute. But they didn't know that the word pay here referred to winning Sky himself, the whole person. Writing to increase troops requires the use of divine sense. Ignoring everything and forcibly writing non-stop, there is only one final result. That is, winning Sky's body will keep getting hurt, and his consciousness will be constantly impacted. For example, right now, after increasing this third wave of soldiers, Winning Sky was already unable to carry on. His face was terrifyingly white, his head was covered in sweat, and his body was still shaking constantly. It was like he was being roasted by fire at one time, and like he was in an ice cellar at another time. Chest, also like there are countless silver needles, stabbing from the inside out. Today's supplement. Hands were placed on the keyboard. At this moment, Winning Sky even wanted to come up with another text. But his body. It was already seriously not allowing him to continue. He couldn't even knock out a single word anymore. With all his strength, he could no longer press a single key. This was his current state. Three texts a day, this was already winning sky's limit. Next, he would need at least 10 days to recover. And what was being recovered here was only the divine sense, not his body. I hope that these three texts can help Yan Hua. Winning sky raised his head and looked out the window. At the same time, on the front line, those soldiers that he had called out. At this moment, all of them were also raising their heads to the sky, looking at him from afar. Protect me Yen Hua. A new soldier suddenly shouted, startling the old soldiers on the front line. Everyone looked at me and I looked at you, none of them really understanding. But regardless of understanding or not, in the end, the result was always the same. Protect me Yen Hua. One voice led to 10,000 voices, and then, one station led to all stations. The phrase protect me Yen Hua became the only voice on the front line at this moment. Time rushed by, another half hour. Half an hour later, a new round of invasion by the 10,000 races arrived. They were still applying their previous method of attacking back and forth. But this time, what greeted them were De Xia's uninterrupted soldiers. A supplement of 20,000 men. It was already enough to make the 10,000 races young tactics, no longer good enough. On my command, all, bayonets. Played us back and forth before, didn't you? Come on, do it again. Mantis Tiger, what I'm going to do today is Wusong fights the tiger. Due to not knowing the changes on Yen Hua's side, the 10,000 races that came to Dasha's side this time suffered a big loss. Great Xia, on the other hand, had finally and truly ushered in a great victory. The moment they saw the defeat of the 10,000 races, the populace behind Yen Hua's side went crazy with excitement. When will there be such a battle battle on my Yen Hua's front line? It's so cool, the resistance seniors, it's really so cool. And Prof. Win, this is all thanks to Prof. Win. I don't fan anyone but Prof. Win in my life, he's a hero to all of us. Thank you to all the anti-war seniors on the front line, and thank you to Prof. Win in the back, who constantly expends his efforts. On this day in Dasha, every house was lit up like it was the new year. As for the side of the 10,000 races, they were dead and gloomy to the extreme. How could they not expect that their side would fall so hard? Obviously there aren't many soldiers left guarding the gate, and soon we're going to succeed in breaking through the gate. But why, would the military personnel on this side suddenly and drastically increase again? 10,000 races to Xiao's country gate subbase. In charge of Yen Hua's side of the country gate, a woman with eight arms frowned tightly. In the past, every battle had gone well, but today, they were beaten to a pulp. This strong sense of frustration caused this woman with eight arms to be extremely irritated. Soon, calm down. On the side, a man with the same eight arms used their exclusive language to pacify. Calm down, how do you expect me to calm down, I've decided to just attack and break the door multiple times today. The woman known as Hoon's fire was deep, and in a little while, those guys from level 3 will be able to come in. When they come, what do you think we'll end up with in the end? We'll have wasted our efforts and gotten nothing. The eight-armed woman and the man were both extraterrestrial level 2 creatures that belonged to the Heaven's Eye eight-armed clan. Of the level 2 creatures that came to invade this time, it was the Heaven's Eye eight-armed clan that was at the head of Yen Hua's side. Zay, our offense has to be a bit more fierce. Sun stretched out her three hands and rubbed the three eyes on her face. On its opposite side, the eight-armed man known as Zay was slightly helpless, Hoon, you know, this world has restrictions on us. Not to mention the fact that it is now restricting tertiary creatures, even for us, there is a restriction on the time between attacks as well as the number of people sent out. 
But this restriction is also slowly unraveled with time again, isn't it? Sun took a deep breath, and although our Heaven's Eyes 8-armed clan is not of a high rank, it is one that has a special ability that is extremely rare and extremely valuable amongst the 10,000 clans. Zay was silent for a few seconds and said, do we really have to do this, in fact, if we continue round by round, their gates won't be able to hold, they won't be able to hold out until the 30th day. Zay, you don't know, today the opposite side is too fishy, I'm really scared, I'm afraid that when the time comes, after the creatures of the third level can come in, we haven't broken through their national gate either. I'm very afraid that we can't get anything in the end, so it's better to use that ability, it's time for you to take the field, Zay. The 10,000 races was a generalized term for the endless extraterritorial races. Every race outside the domain was different, some of them were like beasts and some were like people. As the human-like heavens I ate armed race, Sun and Zay's combat abilities weren't really that strong. However, at this moment, the ones who were not strong in combat were the ones who managed to become the leaders of the second tier clans who were able to unify the battle in front of Yen Hua's country's gates. The reason for this was mainly just one thing, and that was that the head characters of the Heaven's Eyes 8 Arms clan all possessed a very powerful and peculiar ability. They could double the number of low-ranked soldiers under their command. Hoon can do this, and so can Zay. The rules of the world did limit the level of them, the invaders. It was also true that the time between their invasions and the maximum number of soldiers that could be sent in each round were also limited. However, Hoon and Zay were able to remotely double those soldiers after sending the required number of soldiers. Humans only felt that the 10,000 races were terrifying, but never thought that the 10,000 races hadn't actually shown their strength until now. Of course, this ability of the Heavenly Eyes 8 Arms Clan is powerful, but it is not something that can be used casually. Every time they used this ability, it was also something that would cause great damage to their bodies. This was also the reason why they hadn't utilized this ability before. Before the arrival of the tertiary creatures, they felt that they were able to securely attack. They felt that they were able to securely take down the gates of Yen Hua. But now, Yen Hua's increasing troops over and over again was causing them to feel uneasy. Alright, I'll make my move. Strange patterns appeared on Zay's eight arms at the same time. Seeing this pattern, Sun understood that in the next round, the soldiers on Yen Hua's side would definitely not be able to resist well. And it was true, the next day, after the world's restriction had passed, the invasion of the 10,000 races began once again. This time, on Yen Hua's frontline side, the number of 10,000 races that came to attack directly doubled. After that, within a day's time, Yen Hua's frontline had suffered six rounds of attacks from the 10,000 races. Although in the end, Yen Hua still managed to hold out. However, the situation had also become a hundred thousand times more urgent all of a sudden. Zay, hard work. Inside the 10,000 clan's large base, Sun smiled as he looked at Zay on the opposite side. At this moment, Zay had an arm that looked like it had been gouged of its flesh, and it was extremely shriveled. As for his head, it was also sweating a lot. Tomorrow, I'll use my ability once, and the opposite side shouldn't be able to carry it. We'll make it. Hoon and Zay were not amplifying their words at the moment. Although Yen Hua did add a lot of new soldiers yesterday. However, the soldiers they had at the moment were much more. Even if the opposite side adds more troops tomorrow, there's not much point to it. Today was considered a battle of attrition. Tomorrow would be their final end against Yen Hua. Unless Yen Hua's reinforcement tomorrow is another outrageous 20,000 or more. But, how could that be possible? 20,000 soldiers were not a good call. Time ticked by. Soon, the next day arrived. A new day. Early on, the frontline soldiers woke up. Also waking up were all the people of Yen Hua. The mood of the people of Yen Hua in these two days could be described as a roller coaster ride. The day before yesterday, they were overjoyed when Yen Hua's troops increased. As a result, yesterday, the soldiers on the side of the 10,000 clans also strangely became more numerous. And the scale is still the kind that has directly doubled. After looking at yesterday, all the battle situation on the front line. Everyone only got one summary. That is, next, Yen Hua might really be finished. Although he was midway, bubbling up with hope again and again. But in the end, it was still destined to perish in the endless darkness. On the side of the 10,000 races, why did they suddenly add so many invaders? Shouldn't the front line have great restrictions on them? This time, our Yen Hua might really be finished. Actually, we should have been finished a few days ago, we can only say, thanks to Prof. Win. Yes, Prof. Win let us live for a few more days, and now we're just going to face what we should have faced all over again. Looking at the big screen and watching the computerized television, the people at the back of Yen Hua Dasha were engaged in all sorts of discussions. They had all changed into their best clothes today, and what about the food they ate, it was all what they considered to be the best. Zhang Hanan was also like that, when people were counting down to a crisis, they would panic. But at the end of the day, he was somewhat relieved. Well, not everyone can be relieved, there are still a lot of people are very desperate and scared, they are crying, making a scene. 
Others had even gone to the location of Yen Hua's center department, crying out and demanding that Yen Hua announce its dissolution and merge into another country. Incorporate into another country? Yen Hua's center department, the old man seemed to have aged a lot more. As the story developed to the end, it must have been impossible for him to let billions of people die together. However, the decision to merge into another country was really hard for him to make. It would be too humiliating. Look again, look again. The old man looked at the big screen in front of him, longing for a miracle. This miracle could give Yen Hua hope, and it could also save him from having to make that disgusting choice. It was just that the story had developed to such an extent, that so-called miracle, could it still appear? Unless Professor Winside, on today, was able to increase the troops for the front line again, and, by a full tens of thousands. But it's extremely difficult to make up just a little bit, so how can he possibly call out tens of thousands of troops at once? Early in the morning, Winning Sky woke up under a cat's cry. Meow Kitten All Black, looks very cute. It was the one he picked up on the side of the road when he went out to buy food yesterday. Hungry? Winning Sky stroked Yearning's head. Yearning Moon, was the name he had given to this kitten. It was because Yearning was often forgotten, just like Yearning. But no matter what, he existed. Knock knock. Just after washing up, there was a knock on the door. Being an orphan, no one would normally knock on Winning Sky's door. With disbelief, Winning Sky walked to the door. A glance in the cat's eye. It turned out to be the little girl next door, Yao Yao. Yao Yao, what's the matter? Winning Sky snapped. Yao Yao looked happy, brother Winning Sky. Mom called you to come to my house for dinner. There are small fishes and chickens, it's sumptuous. Winning Sky froze, uh, isn't it just morning? In the past, the next door had also called out to Winning Sky for dinner. But that was all at noon. What was this situation now? Whose family ate so sumptuously in the morning? Dad said that today is a big day. Lunch might not be eaten because of something. So just eat in the morning. And you have to call brother Wing Tian to eat with you. Hearing this answer from Yao Yao, Winning Sky was silent. He seemed to understand why the other party ate so well in the morning. Lunch, maybe he didn't eat because of something? It was because he was afraid that he would never have the chance to eat it again after the country's gate was shattered, right? Let's go then. Winning Sky followed Yao Yao. The family next door was very nice, dad, mom, Yao Yao. A very happy meal was eaten and after the meal Winning Sky helped clean up. Before leaving, Yao Yao pulled Winning Sky, brother Winning Sky, here's this for you. It was a decal, a small red flag, and Yao Yao pasted it onto Winning Sky's face. Mom said that next, our national gate is going to be broken. But no matter what happens in the end, we have to remember that we are Dixia people. Listening to Yao Yao's words, Winning Sky couldn't help but smile, yeah, that's something we have to remember. And then, while saying that, he stroked up Yao Yao's head, but there are some things that Mom said that are not right oh. That is, our Dasha's national gate is still far, far away from the word broken. A meal didn't take long. Eventually, bidding farewell to Yao Yao's family, Winning Sky returned to his rental house. Great Xiao will not perish on this. Yen Hua's national gate will also not come to the end that belongs to him at the beginning of this story. Winning Sky looked out the window, shaking his head and laughing. If the 10,000 races increased their troops, then the Great Xia, next, would follow suit and increase their troops again. If one article wasn't enough, then two, if two wasn't enough, then three. Until, when the sky completely die in his rental house. As a matter of fact, Winning Sky has always felt that his life is quite valuable. But it wasn't that he was afraid of dying, but he was afraid that there would be no one to tell history afterward. He was afraid of dying himself. After the Qing dynasty, no one to recount the splendor of the great Ming. To show people the great Han, so that people can understand the great Qin. However, now is not the time to be able to tell those or not. Rather, Winning Sky must stand here, with his life, to continue the story of this section first. If one can't even hold on to it now, then what is it even if one lives? Keep the present moment, only then can we talk about the future. So, this time, it's a real fight for my life, and if I don't hold Yen Hua until I die, please don't blame me for it, all the ancestors. Listening to his words, all the soldiers who hadn't been called out in the history of Yen Hua's resistance were flooded with bitter smiles. How could one possibly blame? In order to guard Yen Hua Wen Tian really had already worked hard enough and fought hard enough. Countless burdens were pressed on his body and he hadn't complained a single point, the current front line was bitter, yet he was extremely bitter as well. The military people in the history library who were originally clamoring to all come out were all silent at this moment. And Winning Sky also stopped talking to them and directly smiled as he sat down in front of the computer. The eagle strikes the sky, our body, is the last shell. Today's edition, the sector was left out, the anti-war Yen Hua Air Force. Let's begin, a new round of confrontation with the 10,000 races. This time, until death do us part. This time, tapping on the keyboard hadn't even struck out a few words. 
all over winning Sky's body, he was already sensing pain. Obviously, this was a result of the damage sustained in the previous round that hadn't yet recovered. The divine sense, the body, all of them were already not very good. However, even with a broken body, winning Sky had to continue. The body was in pain, then he gritted his teeth, his consciousness was blurred, then he took a needle and stabbed it into his body. The pain was getting deeper and deeper, but the speed of tapping the keyboard was getting faster and faster. 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes? I don't know how long it took, but another new recruitment article appeared. By the time this article was finished, Winning Sky's entire body was already extremely tired. Tough. Behind Winning Sky, many air forces appeared. In response, Winning Sky only smiled. I've shouted so many times before, can I keep you guys from coming out? The air forces were silent for a few seconds. Eventually an air force opened up to Winning Sky very seriously. When we get to the front line, we will definitely work hard and never let you down. This person's name was also known to Win Tian, his name was Xin Changji. Mr. Shin, don't say fail me. There's no one between us who's failing or not failing anyone. It's all just working hard for our Yen Hua, nodding at these people. Winning Sky posted the article about them online. At this moment, the front line was already under attack again and was in an extremely critical situation. At the back of Yen Hua, basically all of them were looking at the images of the front line. Yen Hua's deep, central sector. Looking at the large screen, the old man's hands were trembling. He even felt that the time had come to make that choice. Chief, Prof. Win, Prof. Win has come up with a new article on troop reinforcement. Until, the next moment, such words appeared in his ears. Prof. Win, sure enough, he still hasn't given up? The robust and serious man was standing across from him at the moment. Looking at the other party, the old man was in a trance for a moment. And then, after only a second, rolling tears fell. Where's the article, did you bring it? The robust man had long since printed out Winning Sky's new article. At this moment when the old man spoke, he directly handed it over with both hands. Receiving the article, the old man proceeded to watch it in detail. And then, when the entire article ended, the old man's body directly could not stop trembling. Although the soldiers this time are not many, they are all strong. The resurrection of the dead souls was self-contained with their weapons. The weapons would also be enchanted by the world plus. The Air Force naturally brought their warplanes with them as well. Of course, that wasn't really the point. The real focus was that at the end of this article today, Winning Sky also wrote down a sentence. Words that could make the current billions of people in the great summer Yen Hua tremble. The story of Yen Hua will not end here. What kind of self-confidence was this? And what kind of hegemony and bravado? Looking at this last sentence in Winning Sky's article, somehow, the old man suddenly felt, today is really not the so-called last moment. Although it was said that the Air Force and Winning Sky's new article at the moment didn't have any way to really change the battle situation. However, at this moment, this person, Winning Sky, was just already able to make everyone believe in him unconditionally. Maybe, I mean maybe, my old man, you can really save our Desia, Yen Hua? Like the old man, at the same time, many, many people in the depths of Yen Hua had also noticed Winning Sky's new article. When they saw that at a time like this, Winning Sky was still increasing his troops, some small light couldn't help but emerge again in everyone's darkened hearts. Although this light was extremely small in front of the unseen darkness, it was finally bright. This man was still working hard, in this almost certain doom situation, he was still fighting for Yen Hua. On the front line, the newly revived countless air forces arrived with their warplanes. Seeing this scene, the hearts of countless old soldiers also rippled. It's come to this point, but there's still another wave of reinforcements, we can hold out a little longer. Under the mighty strength of the enemy, the soldiers on the Yen Hua front line were already no longer thinking about whether or not they could support them until the end. They only thought about whether or not they could hold out for one more day, one more hour, or even ten more minutes. Countless fighters flew in the sky. Under the world's power, cannonballs with a greenish glow exploded into the attacking 10,000 races. Seeing this scene, within the 10,000 races base camp, both Hoon and Zay's expressions changed in an instant. Across the way, did they increase their troops again? Hoon's expression was serious. Zay, on the other hand, didn't have any nonsense and directly wasted another one of his arms. Countless patterns appeared, and one of the arms on the right side also instantly, became dry. There's no harm in it, if he increases his troops on his side, we'll increase ours as well. Although it was impossible to make a wave of soldiers double several times in a row, the base soldiers could be doubled every round. Zay was convinced that as long as there were a few more rounds of attacks, Yen Hua's national gate, when it was time to break, would still break. The battle at the front line was extremely fierce, and Yen Hua managed to withstand this round of attacks from the 10,000 races. After about two hours, a new round of attacks came from the Wan tribe. They still had twice as many troops as they usually did in a round. 
What the 10,000 clan was fighting for was a consuming one. Let's see if you guys will consume me or I will consume you in the end. Inside the Yen Hua Deep, inside the rented house, a bitter smile appeared on the corner of Winning Sky's mouth. Afterwards, no more words were spoken. Lowering his head, he then also continued with his new writing in earnest. Just as he said, the story of Yen Hua will not end here. Winning Skya would not be a person who didn't keep his words. Time quietly continued to go down. A new round of attacks from the 10,000 races caused the damage to the various guardian stations in front of Yen Hua's gate to be much greater again. And with every further casualty on the frontline side, the hearts of the people at the back of Yen Hua were torn apart for another minute. When the number of dead and wounded soldiers in front of Yen Hua's gate was once again too large, the people at the back of Yen Hua's country had their hearts clenched. The people at the back of Yen Hua, the faint light that had just risen in their hearts before was about to be extinguished. However, this light was not extinguished after all, instead, it was brighter again. And the reason, also very simple. Gentlemen, and listen to this dragon chant. Winning Sky's second article of today's military reinforcement came out. And listen to this dragon's roar? At the center of Yen Hua, the old man stood up violently. Another article, another big few thousand? In River Luo City, Zheng Hanan instantly whitened his eyes. Professor Win, another new article. Finally, what about the rest of the populace behind Yen Hua? Shocked, dumbfounded, and excited. Their eyes were moist, their breathing was tight, and their faces were red. At this moment, they regarded Winning Sky as if they were gods. Yen Hua's story won't end here. The story of Yen Hua will not end here. Winning Sky never spoke empty words. He was truly going to create a miracle. In the rear, with one man, he saved Hua Xia. Perhaps, our Yen Hua really won't be finished? Maybe, we can really live past today again? Maybe, we can continue to defend the country's gates. Early in the morning, everyone thought that today was the end of Yen Hua. But now, Winning Sky was giving everyone an endless amount of light. A little leads to a little, and a star's fire can start a prairie fire. With the fall of the two texts, the entire Yen Hua, billions of people rose with the hope of life. I don't know from when. The picture on people's screens has been completely transformed. Previously, it was the main screen that showed the battles on the front line. Then people occasionally cut out to look at the history forum to see if Winning Sky had posted any more articles. Now, the distribution of the screen had changed, and the content on everyone's screens had become two halves. One half held the front line battles. And the other half was hanging directly on the history forum, always showing if Winning Sky had any new movements again. This kind of operation was not just on people's own computers, but even on the big screens of many squares behind Yen Hua had become like this. With this, it was also possible to see just how inspiring Winning Sky's further troop reinforcements were on what everyone thought was the last day of Yen Hua. Can it come, can it come some more? All the people in the back of Yen Hua were expecting it. And Winning Sky, too, did not fail to live up to their expectations, and after the two texts, there was a third one since. War is survival, sacrifice is mine, the country is dying, the mountains and rivers are unharmed. The moment when Winning Sky sent out that third piece of text, regardless of whether it was the front line or the rear, the entire Yenhua was abuzz. The third text is really here, Professor Win, killing like crazy. Last time it was three texts in one day, and this time it is again. How can I put this feeling? It's like you're about to die. And then a doctor comes out, and he slaps the Grim Reaper in the face. Then, it wasn't over, he had to slap a second time and a third time. If Yen Hua holds on this time, all cities must erect statues for Professor Win. In the center department, the old man's body was trembling with excitement as he looked at Winning Sky's article. He was truly surprised that this fellow, Winning Sky, could really bring another miracle. And this miracle wasn't a flash in the pan, but a direct and wild explosion as soon as it came out. Another day three articles, these three articles once. Not to say that ultimately, at least today, Yen Hua's national gate is definitely defended ah. In this world, I only obey prof. Win, prof. Win, he is my god. Can someone slap me, I really feel like I'm dreaming. I feel like I'm dreaming too, this is too unbelievable, can I say I'm ready to die? My mom said, Professor Win, he's the one god sent down to save our Yen Hua. At the back of Yen Hua, all the people were agitated. The emotional ones even directly shed tears. Damn it, the opposite side is increasing their troops, is this an endless increase? The 10,000 clan's main camp. Zay and Sun's plan was finally dashed. The moment this third text from Winning Sky appeared, they understood that today, they couldn't attack Yen Hua. Originally, the world had multiple restrictions on them, the invaders. Restrictions on the number of rounds of attack per day, the number of people per round, and the time between rounds. Now Yen Hua was even outrageous enough to add another wave of troops after another. That group of lunatic-like soldiers on the other side is already annoying enough. Now there's another one that's just as crazy like troop increasers. 
Whoever said that the gates of this piece of country were good for attacking is truly abominable. Zephyr and Hoon had picked down Dasha in the first place because they had heard that it was a good place to attack. But now, both Yen Hua's front line and rear were giving them an extreme headache. Hoon, we can no longer move today. Zay opened his mouth. Hoon was very lost, I know. Zay was silent for a few seconds and said, but we can come back tomorrow, and if we can't tomorrow, there's still then after that. Yen Hua can carry through today, but every other day that follows, I am the one who doesn't believe they can still carry it. Don't worry, Hoon, before the current time period passes and the third level 10,000 clans come to fight over the objects, we will definitely be able to take them down. Zay's consolation was very much on point, and with this consolation from Zay, Hoon's mood also improved. Yes, Yen Hua's side could carry through today, but tomorrow, the day after tomorrow, was not necessarily. Let's battle then, let's see if our power runs out first, or if his side's luck runs out first. You and I plus Tao, 3 alpha levels, 24 arms, 24 reinforcements. If this is how they can still resist, then it doesn't matter if we lose. A country that could resist an attack like theirs. In a sense, they were able to accept a counterpart defeat. No matter what, the 10,000 races aggression today had finally stopped. After the 10,000 races stopped their attack, the entire Yen Hua rear was like a new year. Every household was celebrating, and every household was cheering. Professor Wen, our savior. The story of Yen Hua will not end here. Winning Sky had really fulfilled his promise. He forcibly renewed the afterword that belonged to Yen Hua. This kid is really good. At the front line, the soldier gates were all looking at the sky at this moment. Whether they were new recruits or old soldiers, everyone agreed with Winning Sky. Defending down. At the end of the day, Winning Sky also revealed a smile. And then, thinking of something, before finally leaving the computer. He sent out a new piece of article, not an article to be exact. Because this time, the new content was only a short sentence. I will protect Yen Hua, please also rest assured. If Yen Hua's story won't end here. Winning Sky has reassured all of Yen Hua today. Then this sentence is what Winning Sky has given to everyone. Not just for today, but for the rest of the day, please don't worry. I will protect Yen Hua, so we don't have to think about death and doom. Surprisingly, can it continue any further? Upon seeing this last sentence sent out by Winning Sky on today, whether it was the front line or the rear, all of Yen Hua's people were incredulous to the extreme. In fact, being able to defend today, everyone already felt it was a miracle. As a result, Winning Sky was now giving everyone such a sentence. If Prof. Win says it can be defended, then it can definitely be defended. Yes, Professor Win has never let anyone down. So it's true that we don't have to be afraid for every single day that follows? The follow-up is unknown, but it seems that this current time period is indeed like this. Time and time again, everyone already had a blind trust in Winning Sky. Thus, after his words appeared, all of Yen Hua also instantly boiled over again. Even that old man from the center department was the same at this moment. If Prof. Win said it would work, then it would definitely work, Prof. Win, he wasn't a human, he was a god. The next day, it was still early morning. Early in the morning, the 10,000 races side launched another invasion. Zay didn't waste any time, the first round of attacks utilized the ability. Double the number of troops and attacked Yen Hua like a madman. On the other hand, Yen Hua's side was once again defending itself. At the back, everyone was still getting up early to watch the images of the front line. But unlike yesterday, today everyone is no longer panicked. No longer feeling hopelessly pessimistic that the country's gates were going to be untenable. Because Professor Win said that he would protect Yen Hua. The current winning sky was the god in everyone's heart. God's words could not be wrong. If God wanted to save the world, then he would definitely be able to save the world. Niao the black kitten walked over to the bedside. Little years, is it hungry? At this time, winning sky had just woken up. He stroked the yearling's head. And then, got the cat food for the yearling. Brother, come eat. It was still Yao Yao who came knocking on the door and shouted for dinner. It was still an extremely sumptuous breakfast. Only. This time it wasn't the last meal before the end of the day. And this time there was an extra person in the neighbor's house. Xiao Tian, let me introduce you, this is Hanan. It's my sister, Yao Yao's sister-in-law. Well, you two are of average age. Winning Sky looked around and realized that the other party was really extremely good looking. It wasn't the kind of beauty that was gaudy, but a beauty that was very soothing and relaxing. Hello, I'm Zhang Hanan. You're Winning Sky, aren't you? I've heard my sister talk about you. My sister and I's parents also passed away very early. In a way, the two of us are really alike then. Zhang Hanan was a very cheerful girl. Or rather, it was because of certain things that made her extremely cheerful now. When she thought about Professor Wynn's words last night, she couldn't stop being happy. Yeah, speaking of which, you and Professor Wynn still have the same surname. At the dinner table, Zhang Hanan looked at Winning Sky slightly shocked. 
Outside sister is not assured, forcibly called himself back to live, but did not want to come back to actually still encounter a Professor Wynn's family. Indeed, a surname. Winning Sky cried and laughed a little. Did you see Professor Wynn's text yesterday? He really is too good. Zhang Hanan was an avid fan of Professor Wynn. During a meal, basically all the time was spent with Zhang Hanan bragging about Winning Sky. At the end of the day, Winning Sky himself was a bit embarrassed, so he hurriedly left after finishing his meal. Well, in fact, the reason why he rushed to leave was not because of any embarrassment. Rather, physically, there was some pain that he really couldn't hold back. He couldn't control his expression and pretend to be normal. This person is really a bit strange. As a matter of fact, before she finally left, Zhang Hanan could already tell that there was something abnormal about Winning Sky's expression. However, she didn't think much about it, and only thought that Winning Sky might have an upset stomach, or was suffering from some other illness. After eating, Zhang Hanan went into the study, and then opened the computer and clicked on the forum to wait. Professor Win said that he would protect Yen Hua, so today, he would definitely still have a new article. Zhang Hanan was looking forward to Prof. Win's article, looking forward to Yen Hua's new salvation as a god. Time ticked by, about an hour. Under the anticipation of Zhang Hanan and the countless people of Yen Hua Dashia, Winning Sky's new article on troop reinforcement appeared. The mountains and rivers are still there, the country is at peace. Another few thousand troop reinforcements. The moment Winning Sky's new text appeared today, a large smile appeared directly on Zhang Hanan's face. Initially, when Winning Sky posted an article, she would still think a lot. For example, thinking about how exactly Winning Sky had unearthed so many hidden secrets. After all, how could those of them who studied history not be able to explore a bit? But now, she was already not thinking about that. Winning heaven was God. It would have been easy for a god to dig up what they couldn't dig up. With God's shelter, our Yenhua will definitely be safe. Zhang Hanan's thoughts at this moment were the thoughts of the various other people behind Yenhua. After the extreme despair, the current Yenhua people had already fallen into another state. That is, extremely confident, they treated Winning Sky as a god who could easily save the world if he stepped forward. However, they didn't know that the god they thought of as Winning Sky was actually using his life to hold on every time. New articles appeared, new soldiers appeared, and Dasha, once again, held on. At the headquarters of the 10,000 races, Zay and Sun both had complicated feelings. But there really wasn't much they could do. And so, could only continue to repeat. And they repeated. Winning Sky then followed suit and repeated. A new day, another three texts. Then another day, another three texts. Just like that, a few more days passed in continuity. After a few days, the secondary 10,000 races on the opposite side had already collapsed. As for Yen Hua's rear, they were all beginning to have some joy. Of course, the joy here was only for the winning sky side. In the face of the front line, everyone's mood was still very heavy. After all, no matter what, the front line battlefield was still a very sad battle. Yen Hua's soldiers still kept fighting with their lives. Only, what everyone doesn't know is that the front line at the moment was constantly fighting with their lives. Winning day here, but is also in has been forcibly loss of life. Sitting in front of the computer, coughing non-stop, even coughing up blood. At this time, the winning day has become somewhat unlike people. A few days time, hair all white. In person, it was as if he had aged more than 20 years all of a sudden. I won't send you guys off. Looking at the several representatives from the newly summoned troops who had come to show their faces at the side. Winning Sky was extremely vicissitudes, and opened his mouth with a smile. Seeing this appearance of Winning Sky, the newly called out troops all had tears in their eyes. But they, really, couldn't say anything. So they could only nod heavily. And then left just like that. Inside the room, there were no lights on. Only the computer was flooded with light. Winning Sky was sitting alone in front of the computer, slightly lonely. But luckily, there was a cat named Age beside him. The next day, it was a new day. As usual, Winning Sky got up early. He hadn't gone to Yao Yao's house for dinner for many days. Although Yao Yao would still come to call him. Even yesterday, Yao Yao's sister-in-law Zhang Hanan came. His appearance changed too much, especially this head of white hair, he was afraid to scare everyone. After casually making himself some food at home, Winning Sky came in front of the mirror. It was clear that only a few days had passed, but it was like a full 20 years older. A bitter smile spread across the corner of Winning Sky's mouth, a bit sentimental, but, not regretful. Alright, it's time to start today's mission of guarding the country's gates. Winning Sky once again came to the computer. This time, just as he sat down, Little Ears rushed in. Little Ears grabbed Winning Sky's pants leg. It was as if he wanted to yank Winning Sky out of the computer chair. As a kitten, he didn't understand anything. It only knew that it would be painful for Winning Sky to sit here. Be good age, don't make a fuss. Winning Sky stroked Yearning Moon from top to bottom. 
With that, it continued to turn its gaze to the computer. Counting today. There were only 10 days left until the current baton was over. As long as he persevered through these 10 days, he would be able to take a break. Knock knock knock. Just when Winning Sky was about to start another new writing, suddenly, another knock came from outside. Was it Yao Yao, or Zhang Hanan who came to call himself for dinner again? Obviously, he had refused many times, and yesterday, he had also explicitly said that he had recently caught a cold and wanted to be alone, and that there was food in the house. Winning Sky got up and came to the living room, ready to make another refusal through the door, but this time, before he could refuse, the opposite side was already the one who spoke first. Winning Sky, are you there, Yao can't be found. The one who spoke was Zhang Hanan, and from what I could hear, she was very anxious at this moment. Yao Yao is lost? This time, Winning Sky wasn't calm anymore either, but he still didn't open the door directly. Instead, he first found a hat to put on, and also wore a mask. What exactly is the situation? After the door opened, seeing this appearance of Winning Sky, Zhang Hanan was a bit confused, but she didn't ponder much here. My sister and the others went shopping and asked me to keep an eye on Yao Yao, I went to the toilet and when I came out, I realized I couldn't find Yao Yao. Did she come looking for you? Zhang Hanan snapped, I looked all over on my side and couldn't find her. Winning Sky shook his head, and then without much ado, he directly conducted a new round of searching with Zhang Hanan. The two of them searched for about half an hour, and in the end, it was in a small alley that they found Yao Yao. Yao Yao, where have you been, do you know how worried we were about you? Zhang Hanan hugged Yao Yao. Yao Yao however smiled, I heard brother Winchen's footsteps, is it brother Win Tian who came out? It's me. Winning Sky was first stunned, then, he couldn't help but smile as well, Yao Yao is always able to spot brother. That's natural, after all, Yao Yao has superpowers. Yao Yao smiled proudly, then came to Winning Sky's side and took out a small box from her pocket. Brother Winning Sky, Yao Yao bought medicine for brother Winning Sky, this is for colds, after eating it brother Winning Sky won't feel bad anymore. Time seemed to stop at this moment, looking at the medicine that Yao Yao handed over, Winning Sky's entire body, fell into a deep silence. So, Yao Yao had gone to buy medicine for herself? She lied about catching a cold when she didn't go out, so she bought cold medicine for herself. And candies. Yao Yao brought another box of candies to Winning Sky, when it's hard to feel good, eating a candy will make you feel much better. Winning Sky took a closer look at Yao Yao and realized that her body was dirty, and if he wasn't wrong, she should have fallen on the road. A blind little girl, running out to buy medicine for herself. He touched Yao Yao's head and said, Thank you Yao Yao, but in the future, don't run outside by yourself. Yao Yao nodded, then, without stopping any longer, the three of them began to return the same way. Going upstairs, Winning Sky took the medicine and candy and returned to his home. This part of the story could only be counted as an interlude in Winning Sky's life. After the interlude, his main story was to sit in front of the computer and continue writing. Fingers on the keyboard, just knocked out the first word, it was already extremely painful. So, opening the candy box, Winning Sky ate a candy. Sure enough, eating candy can make one a lot more comfortable. Shaking his head and smiling, Winning Sky continued to start his work. In fact, the candy itself didn't do much. The only thing that could make him keep continuing was the 5,000 years of Yanhua, as well as the ones he wanted to go and guard, those people in the deeper layers of Yanhua. One text was quickly written, and after that, it would be the second text as well, while writing the second article of the day. Winning Sky's violent dizziness appeared five or six times, but even so, in the end, he managed to write out this second text. With the current situation on the front line, at least 10,000 additional troops were needed in a day, and these two texts now were not enough. Is there one more piece left? Winning Sky's eyes turned golden once again. Just like the first time, this was a symbol of him entering a state of madness. It was just that even if he wanted to go crazy now, his body wouldn't allow him to do so. It only lasted for 5 or 6 minutes before Winning Sky turned back to normal, and then the entire person became even more vicissitudes. The dizziness was getting worse, and the sweat on his head was also increasing. But, still, it has to go on ah, uh, it has to go on ah. Uh. Today's third augmentation article is out. The sun set. Such a message came from behind Yan Hua. However, what everyone did not expect was. This time, the one who made up the article on troop reinforcement was not their Professor Win. Rather, it is another old professor from the History Institute of Yan Hua. Yes, writing a text on troop reinforcement is a process of checking and filling in the gaps. At this moment, other than Win Tian, other people can also step forward. Although it certainly couldn't be as horrible and perverted as Prof. Win. Although this wave of this old professor's troop increase for the front line was really a bit low, but in the end, he made up some more. And since it was replenished, it was a good thing. After this old professor's article appeared, Yan Hua's deeper layers boiled again. Everyone was cheering, everyone was happy. Suddenly it feels like our Yan Hua's hope of holding on is getting bigger and bigger. 
Such delight lasted for an hour and 14 minutes. As for why it was so accurate, it was because, it was also at this point in time. This old man who had been the first to add out the missing history for Yen Hua after the invasion of the 10,000 races outside of the winning heavens, passed away. Yes, the news just came so suddenly, leaving everyone in the depths of Yen Hua dumbfounded in an instant. This, how could this happen, wasn't it only an hour ago that this old professor added a new text for our Hua Xia? What happened, I really want to know what this old professor passed away because of. Was it old age, or illness, or the unfortunate fact that he was involved in a car accident or something right after he finished writing his article? Under the netizens' frantic questioning, eventually, on the side of the old professor's family, the old professor's cause of death was reported. My father was already very old and had serious illnesses on his body itself, his death was partly due to old illnesses and age. As one would have guessed, the cause of the old professor's death was indeed related to age and injury. But, those who are attentive here realize that in the words of the old professor's family, one word was mentioned, partly. Since there is a part, that means, there are other parts. My father's death may also have something to do with that military surge article he added. When the old professor's family said this sentence in the interviewed live, Yen Hua Deep, all the people, all froze. Related to the troop increase article, what does that mean? I understand both, but linked together, how come I don't understand? Can someone come and explain to me what it is to be related to the troop increase article? Under the audience's confusion, the old professor's family members told all the specifics. My father, in the course of his work, through various contacts restored some of the soldiers that had been omitted from the history of the war. Thus, he began to record like Professor Wynn, but while recording, he was the one who realized that such recording was very wasteful. Obviously in the past, when memories dissipated people restored history to write essays it wouldn't be anything, why would this happen now? After my father's exploration, he eventually realized that it would be like this when he went back to add restoring history after the invasion of the 10,000 races. Just replenishing the new text after the invasion of the 10,000 clans will consume essence, and essence here is not just a general description. He is something that really affects one's state, when writing a text, for every bit he writes, my father has to take a break. Otherwise, he would be affected in various ways by the lack of essence, either by trembling, sweating, or even a bloody nose. My father has also asked me to make notes for him, and he says that I keep them, but it has been proved that the mental exertion that is due will come anyhow. By the time the last paragraph of the augmented article was recorded, my father was already consumed. And then, coupled with his own age and suffering from old illnesses, so an hour passed after the final article was written, and then he left as well. After the invasion of the 10,000 races, going back to supplement and restore history was going to consume divine sense. Previously, because only winning heaven had replenished after the invasion of the 10,000 races. So not a single person in the entire world knew this. But now, because of an old man who happened to be looking for a way to restore some history. After the invasion of the 10,000 races, the point that replenishing and restoring history consumed essence was known to everyone in the world. I never thought that there was an obstacle to this aspect of restoring and replenishing history in the rear. Not only is it hard to find and restore, but it's surprisingly hard to recount it as well. It turns out that it's not just the front line that suffers physically, but also the heroes who saved the world in the backfield. The people of Yen Hua paid deep respect to the old man who passed away in order to reinforce the front line. And after paying homage to the old man, almost the entire rear, all of them then also put their eyes on winning sky. Reducing and supplementing history requires the consumption of essence, does this mean that Prof. Wen has also been fighting hard against the consumption in writing the text? Although Elder Wang's passing away was unrelated to his own age and old illnesses, through the descriptions of his family members, the exertion brought about by writing the text must have been enormous as well. Wang Lao was like this with only one text and thousands of soldiers, wouldn't it be even more damaging for Prof. Wen to write three texts a day these days with tens of thousands of soldiers and no breaks? Upon realizing this, the entire Yin Hua Deep, all of them began to tremble. In these recent days, they had begun to be blindly arrogant. It was because Winning Sky could always produce a text. So they had even stopped worrying a little bit more about this place. But, now what is this ah? It turns out that writing a troop reinforcement text for the front line is going to damage oneself? In other words, Prof. Win has been writing for us at the cost of his life? It's even possible that Prof. Win has just vomited blood because of this? The damage of just one text had caused an old professor to die. The damage that Winning Sky had suffered from being so frantic in these days would only be even greater. The old professor died of exhaustion, doesn't this mean that Professor Wynn might also die of exhaustion? Even if Professor Wynn did not suffer from an old disease like the old professor. Even so, it was assumed that Professor Wynn was younger than that, much younger. With that horrifying amount of texts he was producing now would also be enough to bring him to the brink of death, right? Or not to say death, 
just to say that the old professor's family mentioned the various symptoms that would appear when writing the augmentation essay, trembling, sweating, nose bleeding, skin cracking, and possibly more and more physical abnormalities. Prof. Win, he must also be, at this moment, already tortured beyond recognition. In front of the computer, Jung Hanan's eyes moistened in an instant. She didn't even dare to imagine what this prof. Win looked like right now. Yen Hua, the center department, and the country's executives were all in tears at this moment. Previously, they only thought that Win Tian was a savior, a hero flying in the sky. Now, after learning about the damage, they realized that. Winning the sky has never been flying in the sky, he has always been standing there. He was just a man with white hair, spitting out blood, carrying Huaxia little by little. Quickly look at the forum, Professor Win has posted another article, the third article from his side today. Not long after the old professor's article passed, Winning Sky's third article on today's side also finally appeared. In the past, everyone is always happy to see a new article, but now everyone is not happy. Only because, this new out of each article, each soldier, our Professor Win carry torture spell out ah. Don't write, don't write, prof. Win, take a break. Now when I see a new article, the first thing that comes to my mind is Professor Win's trembling and sweating. In the past, I used to have tears in my eyes halfway through an article, but now they're already flowing before I even start reading it. Yeah, just like what this online comment above said, this time, people really started crying from the moment they saw the article. The reason for this was probably that, this time, people weren't crying for those soldiers of Huaxia who were about to go to the front line, but rather, they were moved by Winning Sky, who was carrying all the hardships on the battlefield in the rear and constantly forcibly pulling Huaxia forward. What was on the internet, Winning Sky also saw after posting his third article. Therefore, there were some words that people online had for him. For example, words like letting him rest and take a break, he also saw them. Rest, at a time like now, how can I rest? Although many, many more soldiers had been added for the front line these days. However, on the side of the 10,000 races, they were also increasing their attacks every single day. It was true that Winning Sky needed to rest, but it was also true that he could not rest. I promised to protect you all for at least this period of time. Shaking his head, Winning Sky smiled, and with that, he turned off his computer. As he got up, a wave of dizziness hit him, causing him to almost fall. But he eventually managed to stabilize himself. He went to the shelf where he had placed various medical supplies, grabbing some fresh gauze and such to bandage himself up. Only just now, this last text had caused him to have quite a few more wounds on his body. Was it his body that couldn't handle the pressure and was also informing him that he had to stop now? Can't stop ah. Within the small house, Winning Sky bandaged his wounds alone. And then, after feeding the cat and lying down on the bed, Winning Sky ended his day. Or more accurately here, it should be called collapsing on the bed. Just walking to the edge of the bed and fainting down and falling, what can this be if not falling on the bed? Time passed slowly, and in a trance, Winning Sky had a fantastic dream. He dreamed that the words he wrote appeared in the sky. Every time he finished writing a word, a word would also appear in the sky. Everyone was watching in real time. And the moment the article was finally written, there was no need for him to publish it. It was because everyone had already read it. So those soldiers in the article directly then also all appeared on the battlefield at the front line. What a strange dream. The next day, Winning Sky woke up entirely by an obsession that had developed to the point of distortion. This obsession caused him to forcefully wake up on time even if he was unconscious. After waking up, do not carry out anything else. Sitting in front of the computer, Winning Sky directly began a new day of writing as well. On the front line, the 10,000 races were still continuing their troop reinforcement routine. As they continued, Winning Sky naturally had to continue. Even though at this moment, his hair was already white and he was tired of injuries. Even if at this moment, every time he typed out a word, his body would ache violently. Professor Wynn's new article on troop reinforcement, it's out again. Frontline. Many, many soldiers looked up at the same time. They realized something, and sighed silently afterward. It's still that we are too useless. Otherwise there would be no need for a child to suffer so much. In order to guard China, the Yenhua soldiers had worked hard enough. With the least amount of additions to withstand the enemy's craziest offense. They were already impressive enough, and worthy of self-praise. But at this moment, they were still extremely guilty. Guilt that they, themselves, were unable to make the children behind them, suffer less injuries. On this day, after Winning Sky's new article was released online. Soon after, it was also another contribution to the front line as usual. With Winning Sky's new soldiers, the battle situation on the front line quickly became better. But at this time, the better the situation became. All the people, on the contrary, became sadder and sadder. Because every bit of the front line became better. It was all exchanged for every little bit of deterioration in Winning Sky's personal life. Or vomiting, or having a bloody nose, or feeling like needles all over their body. 
Obviously, the family of the deceased old professor hadn't mentioned that there were other effects such as these types before. But before and after Yan Hua, everyone at this moment was just able to collectively have these contents in their minds. Perhaps the heavens had moved for Winning Sky? Wanting everyone to know what Winning Sky was going through right now for everyone's sake? Did something appear in your minds, a little Muppet man? He was coughing, coughing up blood, and then the skin on his arms started to rot away a little bit. And then, then his ears started bleeding too. A lot of needles suddenly appeared in the air and started stabbing towards his body. Hammer, now it's a hammer, a huge hammer is coming from his back. On the internet, a post like this appeared amongst the many cluttered posts. And within a few minutes after it appeared, it was directly topped on the hot search. There was no other reason. It was only because at this time, almost everyone's mind had this image in it. Such an image also appeared in my mind. Me too, it just appeared all of a sudden, this Muppet man is too pitiful. It appeared in everyone's mind, what does this? Mean? Is it possible that this Muppet Man is the current Professor Win? After the constant exchanges eventually linked it to Winning Sky. Throughout Yan Hua, everyone's heart could not help but be gripped. Sure enough, did Professor Win have to be hurt even when he wrote the augmentation article? How much pain must he be in? Staring tightly at the Muppet Man in his mind, Zhang Hanan shuddered and sent out such a reply. And the moment this reply of hers appeared, all the people who saw this reply of hers, a hard, heartbreaking feeling in their hearts was also, all of a sudden, even more intense. Yes, suffered so many special impact. Professor Win at this moment, how much pain must he have ah? Why does Professor Win appear in our minds at this moment? A person carried up such a question on the internet. And the netizens kept answering in. In the end, this question also came up with a most reasonable answer. That was what it said, at this moment, even the heavens are moved by winning sky. Or rather, it wasn't the heavens, it was Huaxia, it was our Huaxia that was moved by it. Therefore, it was at this moment that such an image appeared in everyone's mind at the same time. Yan Hua, center department, sitting on the chair, feeling everything in his mind. The old man trembled and looked out the window. He wanted to say something. However, nothing could be said. Letting winning sky stop? But the current frontline battlefield really needed him. If he really stopped, China would really be finished. The old man himself was not afraid of death but he needed to consider the country of China. After a long time of silence, the old man slowly stood up. Then, looking out the window, the old man bowed deeply with his old body. As usual, after the first one there is a second one, and a third one. Only the difference was that this time, everyone was finally getting to know the winning sky at the time of the writing. By the time winning sky's three articles for today were written, the rear of Huaxia had already collapsed in tears again. Ring out, send off the soldiers who are about to go to the front line. The usual send off. The usual everyone to the street to see each other off. Holding Zhang Hanan's hand, Yao Yao came downstairs. Afterwards, for some reason. Suddenly, Yao Yao burst into tears. Zhang Hanan and Yao Yao's parents were shocked. Everyone rushed to comfort and asked Yao Yao what happened. However, Yao Yao was unable to answer any specific reason. After that, she cried for a few minutes. Only then did Yao Yao open her mouth and gave an extremely outrageous answer. I want to win brother Tian. Upon hearing Yao Yao's answer, both of her parents laughed and laughed. The only one who was left was Zhang Hanan, who stood in place and suddenly followed suit with heartache. However, no matter how much one pondered, one could not ponder what was wrong. So this Muppet man is the country in front of us. The one who has been constantly working against us in these days? At the great base of the 10,000 clans, the three leaders of the Heaven's I-8 Arms clan were gathered together at this moment. The reason for this was also because of the bizarre Muppet man that suddenly appeared in their minds. Yes. That's the one. Opposite Hun and Zay, stood another man. He was Tao, the third leader sent by the eight armed clan when they came to invade Yan Hua this time. Remember? For the sake of this invasion, Lord 10,000 Tricks had united more than a dozen seventh level races to listen to the E people. As early as a few decades ago, they carried out a memory attack on Earth and either hid or destroyed a large amount of their literature. And after we officially launched the attack, it even directly blocked all of Earth's history. If anyone wants to rely on all kinds of research and exploration to add to the restoration, they will definitely be subjected to a huge impact. Tao was clearly the one with the highest intelligence among the three leaders of the eight arms clan. The fact that that Muppet man is suffering from all sorts of attacks at the moment must symbolize that person from Yan Hua who has been obstructing us is suffering divine punishment. As for why such images are appearing in our minds, my guess is that it's this national consciousness in front of us acting. He's scattering this kind of image to the people in his country, so that those people will remember the contribution of the one who was obstructing us. It's just that he's missing so much power under the god's suppression that he can't even choose his own people specifically anymore, so in the end, he can only choose his country directly, and that's what's making us, who are also in his country at the moment, have such images in our minds as well. 
After listening to Tao's explanation, both Hoon and Zay were pondering. Afterwards, Hoon couldn't help but get agitated, that Muppet Man is in a very bad state, and the god's attacks are particularly numerous and fierce, so it looks like he won't be able to hold out for long. Right now, this country across the street is basically relying on him to increase his troops to resist us, once he falls, we will definitely be able to take down this country across the street as well. Zay nodded his head, that's true, so what we need to do next is to continue with our previous maneuvers, in this protracted battle, he will definitely be the one to fall first. Looking at that ragdoll man's current state as well as God's current offense then, it is indeed the case that he won't be able to hold out much longer. The corners of Tao's mouth also spread into a smile. In the end, the three of them directly all started laughing. They were laughing at the fact that they themselves would soon be able to attack Yen Hua, and then seize those things that even a 7th level race would want. And after seizing it, they could still reasonably own it, without any possibility of it being seized again. At the same time, it was also laughing at the national consciousness of Yen Hua as a country. In order to let his people know that winning Sky's contribution had gone so far as to make such an operation. Thus, in the end, allowing their side to see winning Sky's state in real time as well. This country, it's too stupid. At the end of the meeting, the three of them, San Zetao, made such a comment for Yen Hua. However, not knowing enough about winning Sky, how could they truly understand Yen Hua Dasha at this moment? The power was suppressed, and spreading out the image might allow the 10,000 races to see it as well, as the national consciousness could not be clear about that? It's just that compared to all the other things, Yen Hua's national consciousness understands winning sky better and trusts winning sky more. Turns out, I'm not alone in writing the text either. The hotspot of the Muppet Man on the internet was something that winning sky also saw when he was getting ready to go to sleep. He looked to the sky and realized that the original country, Yen Hua itself, had been accompanying him. Don't worry, I'll hold on. Endless exhaustion caused Winning Sky to immediately enter Dreamland again after saying these words. And after he entered Dreamland, a clear light also fell directly onto his body. The great power of the 10,000 races suppressed the entire earth and also suppressed the national consciousness of Yen Hua as a country. In the suppressed state, the power of Yen Hua's national consciousness became extremely weak. However, it was still possible to slightly heal Winning Heaven some after Winning Heaven slept each time. Although, such a healing was still too much worse than the damage it had suffered. Thank you, it's already enough. Under the illumination of light, Winning Sky suddenly opened his mouth. And hearing this sudden sentence from Winning Sky, Yen Hua's national consciousness was also directly frozen. The person who could make even the national consciousness freeze. Winning Sky was definitely the first one. And after a moment of silence, eventually, Yen Hua's national consciousness, it was also only able to carry down such an emotion. What an interesting and special person. Brother Win Tian, is your cold ready? Mom and Dad asked me to come and shout for you to eat together. The next morning, Win Tian was woken up by Yao Yao. I'm sorry, Yao Yao, brother's cold hasn't gotten better yet. And recently brother may have to go to the countryside for a few days. When you come back brother will have dinner with Yao Yao again, okay? Through the door, Winning Sky made this response. Hearing Winning Sky's words, Yao Yao stalled in place. And then, a full few seconds passed before it opened its mouth again. Mom said that children who cheat don't have candy to eat. Brother Win Tian can't cheat. Yao Yao will always wait for Brother Winning Sky at home. Yao Yao's words caused Winning Sky to be a little silent as well. Still, he quickly nodded his head and smiled in response. Good, the child who cheats has no candy to eat. A conversation quickly ended. After the conversation ended, Winning Sky started his work for this new day immediately afterward. As for Yao Yao, she also returned home under Zhang Hanan's leadership. Yes, Zhang Hanan was also there, it was just that she hadn't said anything just now. Yao Yao, why did you say those words just now? Zhang Hanan didn't quite understand. The original reason why Yao Yao just said so many more words. Although it was normal for a small child to say those words. However, Zhang Hanan always felt that there was some special meaning contained inside. Anti Hanan. Yao Yao raised her head and looked towards Zhang Hanan. It was only then that Zhang Hanan suddenly realized that Yao Yao already had a face full of tears. How? What happened Yao Yao? Zhang Hanan was startled. Yao Yao's tears kept flowing down. A few seconds later, only then did she open her mouth and utter another sentence. She had already said the words once before. I want to win brother Tian. The moment Yao Yao uttered these words, a flash of lightning struck outside the window. Immediately after that, rain started to fall like a basin shower. Zhang Hanan couldn't understand anything, couldn't understand Yao Yao's crying, nor could she understand the sudden rain. She looked in a trance in the direction of Winchen's house. When the cold gets better and comes back from the countryside, Brother Win Tian will be able to eat with you again, right? The rain, it was getting heavier and heavier. And the new text made by Winning Sky on today also gradually took shape. 
Perhaps it was because he had been alone for too long. Winning Sky especially wanted to listen to music today. So before formally writing the text, he also turned on a random song. The sound of rain, the sound of the keyboard, the sound of music, and the sound of countless needles sticking into the body. It was the sound of a knife cutting across the ear, a heavy hammer hitting the back, countless bugs gnawing on the ten fingers of the keyboard, and a time bomb hidden at the heart, tick, tick. The little Muppet Man is suffering again. Who is paying attention to the little Muppet Man? Tiny Muppet Man, can he continue to hold out? Click. The bone is broken, luckily, it's the leg ah. Listen, this is our voice. Is everyone's fate predestined? No matter how long the road ahead. No matter how imitation now. The light will spread over you and me. Stand beside me. Even though, I may sleep long. I will go in the most dangerous direction. With my chest. By coincidence, the music that was turned on at random was extremely appropriate. Listening to the song sung by this child, the corner of Winning Sky's mouth also hung a smile. He did just that, one piece, two pieces, three pieces, as usual. With my waves, I'll build the country's giant waves. With a thousand years of greatness in your chest, it's just a hundred years of splendor. If the ending is not what you wish, please fight before the dust settles. And behind him, the batch after batch of military people, as usual. Kids, thank you. The souls of the dead recovered to guard the country's gates, who said that I have no one in Dasha. At this time, the struggle between Yen Hua and the 10,000 races. Battle in the front line, but then in the back field. The whole Yen Hua, all the people are watching the ragdoll win day. And the 10,000 races base camp, Winning Sky has also been turned into the sole focus. Everyone was watching to see how long Winning Sky could last. With this, the consumption of three texts a day. Time was slow yet rapid. When this new day passed, the people of Yen Hua Deep were all relieved. The army of 10,000 clans, on the other hand, were slightly disdainful. After that, it was the second day of a new round. Although it was tough, Winning Sky still managed to pull through. Looking at the torn and already extremely tattered ragdoll. The hearts of the people of Yen Hua Deep were all extremely hard. As for the armies of the 10,000 clans, their faces were also slightly surprised. After that, the third day, as well as the fourth day. By this time, the shock that Right One had received was already so great that it was terrifying. Winning Sky's entire body could no longer be considered a human being, and there was not even a single part of his body that was intact. But, even so, even so, he finally, finally held on. When Winning Sky trembled and uploaded the third article of this fourth day with great difficulty, the entire Yen Hua was already sobbing uncontrollably, deep down, on the front lines, everyone was crying. And what about the 10,000 races base camp, all three of the Sun Zetao people were also all already in silence. Although the enemy, but his willpower conquered me. Tattered rag doll, intact country. These days, the story of Winning Sky was not only spreading in China. Ragdolls the entire world also knew that in this world, there was him. The people abroad were unable to view the rag doll specifically in their minds though, but just listening to the descriptions as well as viewing the current situation of Yen Hua's front line that had been intact, they could also clearly learn just how great winning Sky's contribution was. The pickle country has announced that it has been disbanded and merged into the pretty country. The elephant country's multiple station military personnel were completely wiped out, the three layers of barriers were broken, and the population has begun to be slaughtered. The rest of the small countries who have been completely exterminated have been even more completely counted. Every single country suffered from the attacks of the 10,000 races. As the current existence of a weak stick, kimchi and other countries had already all fallen and retreated. Only Huaxia, from the beginning to the end although only a weak grass, but always stand. In this way, day after day, finally, the time to change the baton of the relay race has come. This is the 30th day of Yen Hua's resistance period pioneer resuscitation guarding the national gate. As long as we finish today, this baton, Yen Hua will also be considered to be guarded. The front line, at this moment standing is not all soldiers. The war is at a late stage. Even winning heaven can't call up any more soldiers. But fortunately, during the war period, all the people in Yen Hua were soldiers. Workers, peasants, merchants, students, gangsters, and even Chengling. In order to protect Yen Hua, these people who were once on the front line. At this moment, they all stood in front of the enemy army as the people once again. A new round of attacks from the 10,000 races is about to begin, get ready, it's on. With a call, people in all colors of clothing all made preparations for battle. Everything that the soldiers who died on the frontline battlefield carried with them when they died would also dissipate. This made it impossible to leave their weapons for these people who came after them. But, it didn't matter, it didn't matter at all, whether it was a big knife or even just a shovel. The people of Yenhua have never relied on external objects, but rather on their resolute hearts to overcome all powerful enemies. Just as they did when they drove the little devils away, they gritted their teeth and continued to move forward and forward. Protect me Yen Hua. 
At this moment, the one who shouted out this cry was a farmer holding a hammer. Along with his shout, thousands of protect me, Yenhua came out. As the last group of defenders of the country, they valiantly fought against all races. In the end, they succeeded in fending off the first invasion attack by the 10,000 races on the last day. But alas, it was not enough, far from it. The attacks of the 10,000 races could never be just one wave. Not to mention, today was still the last day of the relay race in the current time period. So, it's still necessary to continue relying on winning professors. Yen Hua Backfield. All the people closed their eyes together at this moment. They looked towards the already tattered Muppeteer. Just as they had guessed, at this time, that Muppet Man had indeed begun to suffer again. Only when it was writing an augmentation article would it suffer a special attack from the 10,000 clans from afar. So this also meant that at this moment, Professor Wynne had indeed started to do it again. Mom, I'm scared, I don't want to see it, it's so scary. A little boy hurriedly opened his eyes after closing them for a while. However, the child's mother was forcing him to close his eyes again, only saying, must see. Yes, it must be seen. Now weak and powerless, the only thing we can do. The only thing we can do now is to remember what Professor Wynne has suffered while he guards us. Donate your life to the nation's cause and die as if you were returning home. After countless impacts, Winning Sky's new article was released on the internet. The moment the article appeared, the people of Yen Hua's deeper layers immediately watched it. For one article, there were a full 5,000 people again. Although they were all the people, they were extremely useful to the front line at this moment. However, after this one article, Winning Sky still wasn't finished. Almost the instant he finished writing the first article, he then immediately proceeded to write the second article of the day as well. Prof. Win, there's no need to be in such a hurry. You can. You can take a break first. Looking at the tortured Muppeteer within his mind once again, the people of Yen Hua once again collectively shed tears, even the adults. At this moment, they were all somewhat unable to bear to watch anymore. They longed for winning heaven to rest and rest. They longed for winning heaven to see more of himself. They even longed for the winning heaven to be a bit more selfish at this moment. Lift up the country, all the people, I'm here with us. But unfortunately, winning sky he never listened. He just carried Yen Hua and kept walking again and again, moving forward. Like I said, at least this stick I will protect our country. Sitting in front of the computer. Exhausted to the extreme, the corner of Winning Sky's mouth spread into a smile. But, very soon, the smile of his stopped as well. His expression became distorted, and he began to become extremely sad. His tears began to flow downward uncontrollably like falling water. Was it because of the pain? At this moment, he had indeed suffered another extremely strong shock. From the beginning to the end, it was also true that he was a person who was very afraid of pain very afraid of pain. But, not ah. At this moment, he is crying but not because of pain ah. Why if it is now? It's just one step, just one step ah. Sitting on the chair, winning sky broke down. He was like a child. Opening his mouth was bawling. Just a moment ago, his arm was also injured by the impact. And that meant, there was no way for him to play the keyboard anymore. He couldn't even manipulate the computer anymore. At this moment, Winning Sky's limbs had all been wasted. Both legs were wasted. He could still rely on lying down to maintain his daily life. But with his hands ruined, what should he do? This is the last day ah, he still have to continue to increase troops for the front line ah. Just one more to go, as long as this one is well written, this stick will be held ah. I, I still have my mouth, my head can still move, I can figure it out. I can voice, or, live, yes, I can start a live stream. Live streaming or voice transmission of text to reinforce the front line. The impacts and injuries received were fully several times more than normal writing. But the current winning sky really couldn't be bothered to worry about that. He had to continue ah, the current him was only one more text away ah. It'll hold, Yen Hua will be fine. With a big smile, winning sky surged forward. However, it was fine if he didn't surge. As soon as he surged forward, there was a fluttering sound. His entire person directly then also fell from the chair. At this moment, he no longer had the ability to get up. Is there anyone who can help me ah? Within the small room, Winning Sky stayed there alone, helpless to the extreme. The kitten yearning heard Winning Sky's cries and hurriedly ran over. But he was just a cat, and he couldn't help Winning Sky in the slightest. Professor Win, Professor Win his arms are broken. In Yen Hua Deep, all the populace was sensing the ragdoll named Professor Win at this moment. Therefore, at this moment, everything that happened to Winning Sky, they also saw through the ragdoll. The ragdoll that had suffered so much, at this moment, both of its arms were directly and viciously ripped off. Seeing this scene, almost all of Yen Hua's people all shuddered. And then, they saw that the rag doll shed tears and began to cry bitterly. These days, Winning Sky had suffered too much, but he had never cried. But today, he cried all of a sudden, and he cried very miserably. 
Everyone knew that winning Sky wasn't crying because of pain. He was crying because he couldn't continue to reinforce the front line. With his eyes closed, Zhang Hanan kept her eyes on the broken rag doll. She saw the rag doll begin to struggle. Subsequently, it was also straightforward to see the rag doll fall from midair. It wasn't hard to understand. Almost instantly, Zhang Hanan guessed what happened to Winning Sky in reality. He was probably trying to write the text in some other way. But unfortunately, he did not succeed and instead, he even fell to the ground. Professor Win has fallen down. After Winning Sky fell to the ground, the rag doll in everyone's heart also disappeared. Yen Hua, the center department. The old man's tears were already flowing down from his eyes involuntarily. His voice was extremely trembling, old buddy, old buddy. No one responded, and there was only silence around them. Is Winning Sky dead? Or other? Regardless of what exactly, at this moment, the outcome of Yen Hua seemed to be doomed. Without Winning Sky's third text, today's Yen Hua would definitely fall. Even if the defenders of the country were all wiped out, the 10,000 races would have to break through three of Yen Hua's gates. But, wasn't that just a matter of time? It's still coming to an end ah. Thank you, Professor Win, for letting us live for so many more days. Thank you, Professor Win, you've done more than enough. It was clear that winter was still far away. But today, the entire Yenhua was actually all snowed in. On the front line, a new round of attacks from the 10,000 races had come. They all knew about winning Sky's fall. So without hesitation, they increased their attacks. Round after round of attacks, round after round of madness. Under the final firefighting attack of the 10,000 races, Yenhua's front line, the ancestors guarding the country's gates gradually fell. It seemed that the story of Yenhua was really coming to an end here. Shall we announce the dissolution of self and merge into another country? In the center sector, the old man was once again confronted with this question. And it seemed to be the very thing that scared him to think about this question. The inferno deep. All of the populace had actually all come out onto the streets at this very moment. If all the people of the country are like this, how dare the Japanese invaders violate Yenhua? Today's edition, the four-row warehouse, 800 strong soldiers. Where we die, where we are buried, the world is the same as the green hills. Today's edition, the Dongjiang column is the mainstay of the war. All the people of Yenhua, at this moment, shouting, is to win the day these days to an article title. Perhaps before this, there were still some populace who were afraid, afraid to die, and thus made some twisted and cowardly choices. But now, under winning Sky's constant influence, there was no one in the entire Yenhua who was afraid anymore. I'd rather die than be humiliated. This was the answer of all the people of Yenhua at this moment. Dissolve themselves and merge into another country? And then be sheltered by the dead souls and spirits of other countries? Forget it, we don't care. Live with your country. Deep down, the front line. At this moment all but one voice remained. And listening to this voice. Center sector. The old man also went straight from crying to letting out a loud laugh. Yes, with the country. What we want can only be coexistence with the country. The destruction of the country is not scary. The terrible loss of the soul of being a human being. Standing on the street. Zhang Hanan followed the crowd. At this moment, she was also ready to die. But, still puzzled. Somehow, she was still very puzzled. She had too many unexplained confusions. It always felt like there was something that should have gone to her attention. And yet, ultimately, it never, ever went unnoticed. What is it? Zhang Hanan carefully thought about it. However, no matter how he thought, he could not think. What is it that I should pay attention to? Thinking about it, Zhang Hanan suddenly closed her eyes. She didn't know why she closed her eyes at this moment. But, after closing her eyes, she did see the answer. The rag doll that had disappeared in everyone's hearts. At this moment, it actually appeared in her mind again. Rag doll, injured, disappeared. The brain rapidly began to operate. Looking at the rag doll, Zhang Hanan made all sorts of associations. And at the end of the associations, only one sentence appeared in Zhang Hanan's mind. A sentence that Yao Yao had said at first. I want to win brother Tian. No way, it couldn't be. Zhang Hanan's body trembled. She then broke away from the crowd. She started running home like crazy. She returned to the neighborhood and she went upstairs. But she didn't go back to her sister's house. Instead, she came to the door of Winning Sky's house. I'm sorry, Yao Yao, brother's cold hasn't gotten better yet. And recently, brother might have to stay in the countryside for a few days. The two words that Winning Sky had said before surfaced in his mind. Zhang Hanan's hand that knocked on the door stopped. She didn't know whether or not Winning Sky was still in this home at this moment. Just like this, one minute, two minutes, three minutes. Until, the sound of constant banging on the door came from within the house. As well as, one cat cry after another. The cat was banging on the door? Zhang Hanan was violently stunned. At this moment, she knew that Winning Sky was definitely at home. Only, the door was locked, 
so how was she supposed to get in? Gotta get help. Quickly running downstairs, Zhang Hanan wanted to find someone, but it was at this moment that a pouncing sound. A kitten jumped down directly from the upstairs window opening with agility. The place where it jumped out, where else could it be if not Winning Sky's home? You're a cat raised by Winning Sky. Zhang Hanan was startled. Yearning was also covered in injuries at this time, seemingly from banging on the door. However, at this moment, it had no intention of letting Zhang Hanan focus on himself, only to see it stagger to Zhang Hanan. Afterward, it opened its mouth and directly placed a key it was holding on the ground. The moment he saw this key, Zhang Hanan's tears then flowed down. However, her emotions did not linger too long here. Instead, she picked up the key. Immediately, she returned with yearning and went home. Because of the key, this time Zhang Hanan managed to open the door to Winning Sky's home. At this time, the living room was already cluttered beyond recognition, and whatever was there was scattered on the floor. Winning Sky was not here. However, Zhang Hanan had already thought of how Winning Sky had been here in the past few days. Unable to stop her body from trembling, Zhang Hanan covered her mouth and tried her best not to let herself cry out. Afterward, she trembled as she arrived at Winning Sky's bedroom. Winning Sky's bedroom wasn't big and was still very empty. There was just one bed. And then there was a table placed next to it with a computer on it. At this time, the computer was still on, and on it hung the words that hadn't been written. Well, to be precise, it was the third augmentation article that hadn't officially started yet. There was no one in the chair in front of the computer, but to the side of him, there was a person lying on the ground. At this time, the man had a head of hair that was already completely white, and this hair was as messy as his beard. His eyes were a deep blood red color, and his face had many small wounds that looked painful. His limbs could not be moved, and he could no longer do anything but lie there helplessly waiting for someone to help him. Like a river that had broken the dike, Zhang Hanan's tears no longer appeared to be falling. Instead, they slid across his face and directly became a long, unstoppable stream of threads. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Zhang Hanan kept on apologizing. She regretted to the extreme. Repentance for obviously having so many clues in front of her. Yet she hadn't learned earlier that Winning Sky was the Professor Win that she respected the most. Lying on the ground, Win Tian had already despaired. But he didn't want to think that at this time, another light appeared unbelievably in front of his eyes. He looked toward that light, looked toward Zhang Hanan in the light, leaked out a smile, thank you. Thank you, why say thank you? Obviously it's me who should say thank you, it's all of us in Yanhua. Professor Win, I'm. I'll take you to the hospital now. Zhang Hanan wanted to pull up Win Tian. But in the next second, it was directly stopped by Win Tian. I. Still have some things that I haven't finished. Zhang Hanan naturally knew what it was that Winning Sky still had to go and do at this moment. However, he was already like this now. I'll say it, you write it. After a few seconds of silence, Winning Sky opened his mouth again. Originally, he had wanted Zhang Hanan to open the live stream for himself while directly engaging in a speech. However, using this way to directly address all of Yen Hua was too much damage to himself. He was afraid that at this rate of damage, he wouldn't last long enough to finish speaking a text. So, in the end, he decided to use the way of writing a text to tell everyone the stories of the ancestors. He said, Zhang Hanan to write, so it is also considered writing. Although unlike just writing, this would definitely add some more damage. But compared to talking to a bunch of people, this kind of talking to one person, the damage is already much smaller. As for whether Zhang Hanan's side would be affected by this, Winning Sky's answer was that it would not. Writing an augmentation text for the front line, forever and ever, it would only be that first person who told it who would be affected. Can it really continue? Zhang Hanan cried so hard that he almost fainted. A smile appeared on Winning Sky's face, it's possible, believe me, it's possible. Under this insistence from Winning Sky, Zhang Hanan could only sit in front of the computer in the end. Let's start, this time. Let's continue to talk about those great people of Yenhua during the War of Resistance. At this moment, Winning Sky had already been carried to the bed by Zhang Hanan with his full strength. Listening to Winning Sky's words, Zhang Hanan nodded his head, and with that, he also started writing straight away. Long live the People's Republic of China. This was the title that Winning Sky contained on the current baton, the last day, the last text. It was simpler than the previous titles, but it was even more shocking than before. Afterwards, it was also when the two people were carrying out this new round of writing for the guardianship of Yen Hua. A clear wind blew through the entire Yen Hua, the entire Grand Xia. That wind blew away all the bad weather and blew out a clear sky. Professor Win, I'll take you to the hospital now. I still have some things that aren't done. Can it really still go on? It can, trust me, it can. Line after line of text rose up in the sky. And above the text, what rang out was one conversation after another. This dialogue, if it wasn't from Winning Sky and Zhang Hanan, whose could it be? Hearing this dialogue, throughout Yen Hua, almost everyone instantly ran out from their homes. 
I'll say it, you write it. Let's start, this time. Let's continue with those great people of Yanhua during the War of Resistance. Long live the People's Republic of China. A conversation ended. How could everyone still not be clear about what's going on right now? Professor Wynn had encountered a problem on his side. And now, the problem was solved. In a situation where he could no longer write at all. Prof. Wynn still forced himself to finish his last article for today. And then, the words in the sky, if not wrong, were the exact words of that article. Yenhua's national consciousness had not only released the Muppet Man named Professor Wynn in the hearts of the people. At this time, he also helped Professor Wynn to have this last article of his synchronized directly in the sky. Paragraph after paragraph of text. It eventually converged into an article. It was the first summer of the invasion of the 10,000 races. It was the second month when the dead souls of various countries revived to guard the country's gates. It was the 30th day of the dead battle of Yen Hua's forefathers during the War of Resistance. Yen Hua, Dasha, defended. The moment the new batch of warriors arrived at the front line. At the back, the hearts of all Yen Hua's people were all set free. As for the base camp of the 10,000 races, the evil monsters responsible for attacking Yen Hua, they all instantly realized that they had lost this battle. This guy, he's really tenacious. Zay looked towards Sun and Tao. Tao revealed a helpless expression. His perseverance surpasses all creatures I've ever seen. Who nodded, so it really can't be helped either. The three of them glanced at each other, and then, all of them sighed. Who would have thought it? Not having fought for what they wanted, after losing the battle. Everyone was actually in such a state of conviction. It's not just him ah, this country of theirs is also outrageous. Obviously the number of people is so small, and the bonus is so small. But in the end, they froze and relied on their strong will to last until now. Hoon looked towards the front line and spoke, even if the positions are different. I must say it now, this race, this country, is truly incomparably strong. Tao took a deep breath, so what are we waiting for? Let's go, we are already losers. Somewhat unfortunately, the next two rods of this country were not strong, and after that, it was a direct cultural break. Can't seem to see any more excitement on its side. Z shook his head and said, let's just say that man saved his country for a while, but not for a lifetime. Yeah, and he himself is already wasted now, isn't he, which makes it even less useful for his country afterward. The two of them, Hoon and Zay, were concerned about the country before them that they had been fighting for so long. The next thing was that it might easily be crushed. However, under this discussion between the two, on the side, Tao had a different thought. Who said that, I do think that this country can continue to hold on and for a long time. Cultural faults and all that, that man can add to the history of now, can't he add to the history of then? By that time, he should be able to recover as well, right? Listening to Tao's words, Zay froze, it's useless to recover, right? Who knows if this country will have a weaker history above it again, while the 10,000 races that we can subsequently invade in are definitely getting stronger. Tao suddenly became serious, do any of you know? Why Lord 10,000 Tricks is erasing the memories of the people of this world? If it can be taken down by simply attacking, why would Lord Wanji do that? He clearly could have let the historical dead of this world revive and then let us strike. But he's still united with more than a dozen rank 7 10,000 hearing intentions to perform the ritual of erasing memories and wiping out documents. This can only mean that the long scrolls of history in this side of the world must have a group of people that even he is afraid of. Raising his head, Tal looked into the distance, and now, having witnessed the will of this country in front of me, I feel that it is very likely that an existence as powerful as that is present in this country. An analysis that was extremely reasonable. After hearing Tao's analysis, both Sun and Zay froze. But such a freeze only lasted for a while. Soon Zay then also had a new question. Now then, even if everything you said is right, Godsama also has something he fears. And the things that are feared are most likely in this country. But all of those things, at least, have to be at least two more rods before they appear. The weakness of the next two bats that this country has shown so far is confirmed. And that man is even seriously injured, and will never be able to play much of a role in his country's next two bats. So they're going to be unable to hold out for these two bats, even if there's a strong presence behind them? Zay still insisted on what he thought. Yen Hua's next step was already a point of view that was bound to end quickly. Listening to Zay's narration, Tao was silent for a few seconds, then slowly raised his head. There will be a guardian settlement after each round of the relay race, right? What do you guys think, this country in front of us, how did this baton perform? When Tao's words appeared, the two of them, Hun and Zay, directly froze. Right, according to the Huan Yu rules. Earth's dead souls revive to take over guarding the country's gates. After each baton of the national gate guarding, each country was going to be given new blessings again by the Huan Yue. With each new baton, the way of the universe will give a new bonus according to the current splendor of the country in the new baton era. And in addition to this basic bonus change, 
The way of the universe will also give special benefits to each country according to the performance of all the country guardians in the previous baton. For example, at the very beginning of the country guarding, the best performer was the pretty country. So they were in this period of World War II. The bonuses they received were not just the one for the times of splendor. Now this second stick. Yen Hua was still not as easy as pretty country in defending the country though. However, the performance of the defender that the way of the universe looks at. However, the way of the world is not only looking at the performance of the defender of the country, but also not only looking at which side is defending the country with ease. The Yen Hua of this bat was really cool in a way. With a weak position, he defeated a powerful enemy. This is already more than the guard's easy is also considered wonderful. So, this time the baton. Yen Hua's next round of picking up the dead souls. The great probability was that it would still be able to get another big bonus. In that case, it seems like this country on the opposite side does have a greater chance of winning. Zhe and Hun looked at Tao. In the end, however, they still denied Tao as well. But, even with this kind of re-addition, we also still don't think that Dasha's next two bats can successfully survive. The next bat was okay. It wasn't too bad in itself, and with the just mentioned additive there might actually be a chance. But this country's next next bat, if I remember correctly, was called Di Qing, right? Yen Hua's side of the Great Qing has long been restored by various documents. Lord Wan Ji's side is even more rare that even a tiny bit of literature about it is too lazy to shield. You know, even the stick of Yen Hua now. Lord 10,000 Secret's side also went out and shielded a lot of literature to prevent Earth humans from restoring it. Zhe and Sun have also both read the Qing content that has been completely restored by De Xia's side. To be honest, besides being ridiculous, the two of them really couldn't think of any more words to describe this era of the great Xia Qing dynasty. That's true. So in the end, the specific result then also falls back on that man. Tao looked into the distance. For some reason, he always had a feeling. It felt like winning Sky was still able to keep Yan Hua going even in this situation. Forget it, no matter what, it has nothing to do with us anymore. As losers, all we can do now is leave. The various countries of Earth prepared to pick up the next baton, and on their side. It was time for the next baton relay as well. The relentless rain fell again. And at this time, Earth. The front of each country was also finally quiet. Holding down. On the front line of Yen Hua, there were countless, variously dressed people standing at this moment. They were holding weak weapons to forcefully help Yen Hua guard this last stick. Guarding down. A man, who couldn't help it, started laughing. Immediately after that, the entire front line, all the dead souls that were still survivors all couldn't help but start laughing. Along with their laughter, the rear, the people of Yen Hua's descendants all couldn't help but start laughing as well. Who could have thought before this? Who could have thought that Yen Hua Dasha would be able to defend this current stick as well? Thank you to all the brave and fearless forefathers on the front line who swore to defend Yen Hua to the death, ignoring the rain that was getting heavier and heavier outside. The people at the back of Yen Hua all came out onto the streets and began to pay their respects. They began to pay detailed tribute to all the soldiers who appeared on the front line. The new 4th army, the 8th root army, the 800 strong men, the Dongjiang column, the Sichuan army, the Jin army, all kinds of armies, and all kinds of people. And then, finally, all of the Yen Hua populace all looked up to the sky. In addition to all the forefathers on the front line. At this moment, they also want to pay tribute to the backfield savior who was at the back but fought at the front line. I wonder how Prof. Win is doing now. All the people of Yen Hua were thinking about this at the moment. Yen Hua, the center department. The old man as well as a group of senior staff were all thinking about this at this moment as well. They desperately wanted to find Winning Sky and thank him. On top of that, they also desperately wanted to perform a special treatment for Winning Sky. If they weren't wrong, right now, Winning Sky should already be injured beyond recognition. Where is it? Where can he be? The old man was anxious to the extreme. And then, that was when he was even about to run out to look for someone himself. A phone call from a distant city was sent up the chain to reach him. Good, good, I know. After receiving the call, the old man's face was red with excitement. Thereupon, a full five seconds passed. Only then did he ease up and look at all the executives present in an extremely serious manner. Professor Wynn has found a girl who will be sent to the hospital. But the medical conditions in their city are average. The good thing is that the mayor over there has already utilized the strongest means to begin transferring him towards our side. Prepare, integrate the best medical team from our side, if anything goes wrong with Prof. When, we, one of us, all of us will be guilty. Hearing the old man's words, the other executives present were all agitated as well. Professor Wynn had been found. This was the best news that Dasha wanted to receive right now. As for a cure or something? Just one sentence, if Winning Sky didn't survive, none of them would either. Anyway, without Winning Sky, the next few rods themselves would just be the end. 
All right, let's go make preparations immediately. The news that winning Sky had been found and had been sent to Kyoto for treatment traveled fast. In almost half an hour, all the people in the entire Yen Hua knew exactly. For a time, everyone began to make prayers, or prayer lamps, or something else. In short, at this moment, all the hearts of the entire Yen Hua were tied together. Are we, holding down the fort? On the airplane heading to Kyoto, Winning Sky was in a trance to the extreme, listening to such a question from Winning Sky. On the side, Zhang Hanan tightly grabbed his hand. Guarding down. Professor Win, we've kept this bat. After having a concrete response, only then did a smile hang on Win Tian's face. The ancestors are so strong. There was also the mayor of Winning Sky City on the airplane at this time. Upon hearing Winning Sky utter these words, tears instantly appeared on his face as well. The forefathers of the Yenhua frontline were indeed strong. But it was not only the forefathers who were strong at this moment. The dead souls relayed to guard the country's gates. There will be a handover period when the baton is handed over to the other baton. During the transition period, there will be no invasion by the 10,000 races. The last handover period was relatively short. Only two days. This time, it was five days. After making sure that Dashiao would be safe for a few days. On the airplane, Winning Sky finally closed his eyes. He was too tired, he really needed a good sleep. Soon after closing his eyes, he entered dreamland. It was a very strange dream. In the dream, he dreamed of a girl who always wore a smile. Little Winning Sky, growing taller again. Little Wintian, still can't hear? Little Wintian, can you really not talk anymore? Winning Sky couldn't understand what the other party was saying. He spoke to the girl, I can hear, I can talk. The girl visibly froze for a moment, then a smile appeared on her face once again. Little Winning Sky, I'm going to die. When those words disappeared, all that remained of Winning Sky's dream was darkness again. When he opened his eyes again, he was already lying in the topmost hospital in Dashia. Zhang Hanan was lying on the side of the bed taking a nap, and on her side, age was curled up there as well. Meow. As a cat, Yearning Moon quickly noticed the waking Winning Sky. It was so excited that it rushed up and was about to bite Winning Sky's oxygen tube. Hey wait, why get excited and rush up to bite the oxygen tube? Crap, you crazy cat. Meow. As it turned out, Age was not a crazy cat, it was just pure skin. When it was about to bite the oxygen tube, it quickly stopped. Then it directly put its butt and pouted into Winning Sky's face. Well, this might as well be crazy. Age's movement woke up Zhang Hanan who was lying down for a nap. Upon looking up and seeing Winning Sky open his eyes. Zhang Hanan's large eyes that were instantly filled with tears again. Professor Win, I'm sorry. It's all my fault, I'm such a fool. You were right beside me, and I couldn't find you all alone. The next second, Zhang Hanan opened his mouth and cried out, and yearning puckered her but even more. One cat and one person, all of them could not be stopped. This caused Winning Sky to be instantly numb from head to toe. That, can you take Yearning Moon away from my face? Winning Sky could only move his head right now, and after he opened his mouth, only then did Zhang Hanan realize the problem. He hurriedly held the Yearning Moon down. Yearning Moon, it just misses you too much. Zhang Hanan sat and lowered his head. A smile appeared on Winning Sky's face, I think it's taking revenge on me. Revenge on me for not listening to it and not letting it continue to write the text in favor of continuing to write the text. Zhang Hanan didn't know there was such a story and a faint smile appeared on his face. Age is a good cat, it was its banging on the door that made me discover you. The key was also given to me in its mouth. It jumped right out of the upstairs window at the time. The matter of age finding himself a helper. Winning Sky knew a little bit about it. So at this moment, he was also touched. That can only mean that it will be hard to not give it extra meals in the future. With the sentence of adding food uttered, the yearning moon on the ground immediately meowed several times in joy. And with this cry, it also caused both Winning Sky and Zhang Hanan to laugh right away. After laughing like this for a few seconds, the atmosphere once again became subtle. Zhang Hanan coughed several times. Only then did he open his mouth again, I really didn't expect that Professor Win would be so young. If I'm not young, I really can't carry this non-stop writing. I'm afraid that I'll die violently after writing a few articles. Winning Sky sighed with emotion, then said, however, I'm not really young now, am I? Not resting at all and excessively damaging his life writing articles had already caused Winning Sky to not know how many years old he was. Not to mention anything else, just talking about the hair, that head full of gray hair was a cause for great emotion. Really, I haven't even found a girlfriend yet, so I've directly become an old man. Winning Sky grinned and made a joke. However, he did not want Zhang Hanan to take it seriously. Even if he's an old man, prof, Win will definitely still be able to find a girlfriend. This sentence Zhang Hanan said with incomparable seriousness, clearly wanting to comfort Winning Sky. But, Winning Sky really didn't need such comfort, he just joked ah. I'm just an old man now. Doesn't mean I can't recover. 
Winning Sky was telling the truth. As the biggest contributor to guarding down Dasha, the backfield, Yen Hua consciousness had always helped Winning Sky with special conditioning. It was just that the previous days were too livered. If the next few days could be completely rested, regaining his original appearance would not be a problem at all. Ah, yes, the doctor. The doctor's side did also say, Professor Win you have a special power in you that is conditioning you. As long as you rest well, you can recover. It was only then that Zhang Hanan also finally was recalling something. Right, I forgot about them. Stupidly, he stood up. Zhang Hanan trotted out like he had just learned to walk. And then, in no time at all, Winning Sky's hospital room was full. There was the team of Disya's top doctors who were responsible for treating Winning Sky. There were the most centralized bigwigs of the current Dashia hierarchy. There was also, that old man who wanted to see Winning Sky who had been seeing him for a long time. The injuries are still too severe, even with the help of that special force, as well as various means from our side. In the end, one and a half months of good rest will be needed to recover. What is being said here is still Win. Well, Professor Win is no longer writing new articles during this period of time. The doctors once again helped Win Tian do a checkup. Then a series of new arrangements were made. In reality, they had already done everything that needed to be done when Win Tian was unconscious. The next various ones were merely for a better recovery at a later stage. Thank you. After everything was done, to the doctors who were busy for him, Winning Sky said thank you. However, it was fine if he didn't say thank you, but as soon as he did, the doctors couldn't handle it. Professor Win, don't be like this, you're the hero who saved Great Xia, it's our honor to help treat you instead. Looking at the doctor's shocked looks, Win Tian was also in tears, but he still insisted on his thanks. Then, the doctors left, and even Zhang Hanan and the Yearning Moon left, leaving only the executives of Dasha in the ward. I thought it was an old friend, but I didn't expect it to be a young friend. The old man in Winning Sky, finally met. The old man had come to see Win Tian when he was in a coma, but that could only be considered one-sided. And now, the two of them could finally look at me as you looked at me, and me as you looked at me, and then literally sit and laugh and chat like close friends who had already been friends for many years. It seems that my age really is extremely groovy, if this is to be placed in a novel, where everyone comes to lament, I'm afraid that the readers will be cursing the watery word count. Maybe it's because I've experienced too much after crossing over. Or perhaps it was because the modern era of this side of the world had finally demonstrated some of the differences that parallel worlds should have. Certain people are not the ones originally known, but the characters that parallel worlds have. At this moment, facing this old man who was currently the highest position in Disya, winning Sky was not much more formal. What does slot mean? As for the old man, he was also very happy that Winning Sky was able to be this natural. After learning of Winning Sky's age, he was truly afraid that Winning Sky wouldn't like interacting with an old man like him too much. Some popular words among young people, well, they don't have much meaning, you don't have to look into them. Winning Sky and the old man smiled at the same time. A few moments later, the old man brewed up his emotions and began the content that followed. The specifics of the content wasn't really hard to guess, it was just expressing gratitude and such. But Winning Sky personally really couldn't stand these. He loved thanking people, but he didn't love being thanked by others, it was easy to get goosebumps. The most important thing to thank is still those ancestors on our frontline battlefield. The forefathers are naturally to be thanked, but you, little friend, also deserve to be thanked. The meaning of the crowd's thanks was too full. It was definitely impossible for Winning Sky not to bear it. Just, what made Winning Sky not expect in any way was, this wave ah. What he should think about was not originally the problem of whether to bear it or not. Rather, it was him bearing it, and exactly how long he had to bear it before the opposite side would stop. 10 minutes. In the end, Winning Sky came to a conclusion. Inside the hospital room, after giving thanks and being true to his nature for more than 10 minutes, only then did the old man and the Dasha executives present slowly stop. How in the world did little friend fill in so many gaps? And then, the thanks passage passed. The old man was also finally, asking the doubts in his heart. Global amnesia, people recovered history based on various documents. With the nation's research basically all the documents were searched out and studied. Winning the heavens to check for leaks and fill in the gaps, that is to find various documents that have never been found again. But everyone is very difficult to find out the literature again, how exactly did he manage to frantically find out so many every day, and still have time to specifically research him and completely restore it? Finding literature? Perhaps all of China itself doesn't have that much literature that exists but hasn't been identified anymore. Winning Sky shook his head and smiled, the invasion of the 10,000 races dissipated people's memories, and at the same time directly wiped out a lot of literature. There aren't many leaks per se, most of them have been erased already, and it's definitely difficult to find out what's missing. Winning Sky's words said a lot, but the old man didn't quite understand. 
Seeing this, Winning Sky also directly stated the specifics, what I've been doing actually hasn't been considered checking for leaks, well, it actually counts. But the point is, most of these that I have written out have actually been the part that the 10,000 races have erased. Other people checking for leaks were really looking for literature that was still in the world but hadn't been discovered. Winning Sky, on the other hand, was directly forcing the literature that had already been erased by the 10,000 races to be retrieved. This was the reason why Winning Sky, writing augmentation articles could be much easier than others. Wait, it seems like this is rather more difficult, isn't it? The DCA executives present all widened their eyes. The literature that the 10,000 races had erased could be restored. Was Winning Sky still human? Then, Professor Wynn can say something about it. Those histories that have all been erased, how did you find them again? Breathing became rapid, and everyone was very curious about this question. And the answer to this question, to be honest, there was nothing that Winning Sky couldn't say. The matter of crossing over can be put aside for now. But the library in your head, this kind of contraption that benefits everyone but tortures you, but really is not something to cover up the treasure. Even after experiencing all the pain of writing the text in front of him, Winning Sky wanted to directly transfer him to someone else. The position of savior, if you can do without it, really don't want to do it ah. Because in my mind, there is a library. It holds everything about Dashia. Under everyone's confusion, Winning Sky revealed an evil smile. There was no surprise. This reply of his directly caused the air in the ward to instantly stop. Obviously, this reply was really a bit of a stonewall. This, was sure that it wasn't that Winning Sky had a humorous personality and was now joking with them? The people present were all silent for a long time. Is it hard to accept? Winning Sky inquired. The old man nodded, it is indeed difficult. The library in his mind, this simply should not be too outrageous. However, there were many things in this world that were hard to accept ultimately but could only be accepted. After all, other than that, it was also true that everyone did not have any better other original reasons. No wonder you can be so powerful, little friend. A full three minutes had passed, as well as repeatedly asking again to make sure several times. Only then did the old man take a deep breath and open his mouth again, before, everyone thought that you were a god and then realized that you weren't a god, but now that I look at it again, you look like a god again. Would a god have broken bones all over his body and labored to the point of vomiting blood like crazy? Winning Sky shook his head and smiled. The old man froze slightly, then smiled as well. All right, but even if it's still a human being, little friend, you're still a person who possesses the power to change the world and has a noble and holy will. Winning day helpless, in fact, I prefer to be an ordinary person, or you engage in some black technology, to dig out my brain to study it, writing articles really quite painful. This words uttered, the ward of Dasha's executives suddenly do not know how to answer. But what they know is that no matter how to answer at this moment, can never be to support this kind of idea of the winning day is. Digging up brains and conducting research? Winning Sky had just saved the Grand Sia. Digging out the brain of a hero who saved the Great Sia. If this was done, not to mention the people of Grand Sia, I'm afraid that even the Great Sia's consciousness would directly fuck them up. The various visions within Grand Xia a few days ago proved the existence of Grand Xia's consciousness. Then, even if the people of De Xia, De Xia consciousness does not make a move. Their side also really acted only because Winning Sky was too painful and its own request was made. Turning their heads, they don't have that kind of technology ah. Uh. And if nothing else, even if they did have the technology to extract other people's memories. The so-called library in Winning Sky's mind, they also had a high probability that they wouldn't be able to bring it up. After all, even the contents of the 10,000 races shield could still be stored again as a magical object. Its own power would definitely exceed everyone's imagination. More importantly, if something happened during the process, that's like gambling. One shot, and it could really be the end of everything. We, aren't very good. The old man was slightly embarrassed. Winning Sky smiled and sighed, pity pity pity. Then, after two seconds, Winning Sky's eyes narrowed slightly. By the way, Aren't you guys curious about the history before the Qing dynasty of our Grand Xia? History before the Qing dynasty? The people in the ward all froze at once. It was because Winning Sky had just been talking about the 10,000 races erasing the literature on Earth. Therefore, they only assumed that it could restore those contents that the 10,000 races had erased. However, they didn't want to realize that the ones before the Qing dynasty could also be. Compared to other countries, our De Xia's situation is really a bit special. That is, the erasure of documents before the Qing dynasty on our side was not because of the 10,000 races. Rather, it was the result of the dictatorship of those in power during the Qing dynasty. Historical documents erased by our own people. That library within your mind. Also has it? The old man's breathing became rapid. The corner of Winning Sky's mouth curled up, actually, it's not just our own people who are doing it, the 10,000 races have still moved some. 
The Qing dynasty in this world was certainly more detestable, and the historical documents before him were all destroyed by him. However, even if he destroyed them again and went on to stop people from re-recording them, eventually there would definitely still be some people who would secretly record some things down in the form of documents. So just like the erasure of some of Di Xia's recent literature, the disappearance of all kinds of historical records and literature of the De Ming dynasty and then above it must still have the handiwork of the 10,000 clans in it as well. But it's not important. What's important is that the library in my mind does have everything. Winning Sky narrowed his eyes once again, how about it, interested in studying my brain. Little friend don't say you're laughing, we really don't have that kind of ability. The old man shook his head, then spoke curiously, so little friend, what was it like before our Dasha Qing dynasty? Why are the people of Dasha Yanhua desperate now? The fact that the 10,000 races were powerful and the current succeeding forces were difficult to resist was one aspect. But a bigger aspect is still because the additions to the strength of the resuscitated dead souls are calculated according to the degree of their era's splendor in the world. On the other hand, there is a Qing dynasty which is a laughing stock in the world, and it is not even known what can come out of the Qing dynasty after it is a laughing stock. Well, here accurately, should not be do not know what can come out again. According to the rule of resurrection of dead souls, people will not be resurrected if they don't know their ancestors. So if the story continues, there should be no one left after Dasha. It's a pity that the library on my side has some restrictions on me. Only after the corresponding era starts taking over the baton guarding the country will I be able to tell their stories. Under the curiosity of the crowd in the ward. In the end, Winning Sky gave the crowd a disappointing answer. Upon hearing this answer from him, everyone's expression instantly fell. And seeing how the atmosphere became like this, Winning Sky also cried and laughed all of a sudden. I haven't finished yet. Although that said, there is no way for me to tell you the specifics of the Great Xia before the Qing Dynasty right now. But I am the one who can tell you guys an approximate degree of splendor of those histories. As soon as this follow-up came out, within the ward, everyone was instantly energized again. And along with the spirit of everyone. After a few breaths, Winning Sky was also extremely proud and finally opened his mouth. Just four words, crown the world. As he uttered these four words, everyone was visibly frozen. Until the next time Winning Sky again repeated very seriously many times. Only then did everyone receive the message completely. And then after that, there was one that counted, and directly all of them rushed up to their heads with excitement. Before the Qing dynasty, the world does not know the historical style of Dasha is actually positive. And, even the existence of the top of the world? The despair dissipated. All of a sudden, the whole body is filled with anticipation ah, if it's possible. Afterward, I will let them reappear in the world. Winning Sky's eyes seem to be hiding stars. Hearing these words from him. At once, everyone's excitement increased. Although it was still impossible to imagine exactly. However, being able to have a thought right now was already very emotional. Just like this, the crowd was excited for a long time. But before that the first thing we have to consider is to hold out until then. Only after a long time had passed did the old man take the lead, bringing everyone back to the present. Yes, have to hold out until then first ah. The return of the present moment instantly brought everyone's emotions back to the beginning. It was a confusion that was deep to the extreme. The last stick, Desya, was about to be unable to carry on, and it was all thanks to winning Sky's power to save the day. And the next. Winning the Sky side but also a month and a half cannot write the article to increase troops again. Without the help of winning Sky, how long can the front line hold out? Right. The last round of defending Ardasha was rated as the best. Choices should have appeared on your side, little friend. Thinking, the old man suddenly thought of something else. He curiously looked towards Winning Sky and inquired at him. Upon hearing this inquiry from him, Winning Sky similarly thought of that point. The historical dead soul relay guarding the country gate would recalculate a wave of bonuses every time a baton passed. In addition to looking at the specific elegance of the country's baton dynasty in the world at the time, the bonus also depends on the country's previous baton guard. It also depends on the scoring performance of its country during the previous baton guarding battle. The pioneers of the Great Summer Resistance fought for the best result with less, fighting in desperation. It was instantly rated as the best of that round when it ended without any surprises. It's just that, can the additions be chosen as well? Winning Sky inquired. The old man nodded his head, yes, the baton catcher's own style bonus is not selectable, and no one knows what the exact rules are, but the bonus given to the best of the previous round is selectable. The pretty countryside is then faced with three choices. 1. In all subsequent defensive battles, the dead souls of the readers and the history of all countries can also be revived and given the power of literary warfare to guard the gates of each country. 2. In the subsequent four rounds of defense battles, the dead souls of the defense battles in each round on the front line of the pretty countries will not dissipate in the baton picking up session, but will stay cumulatively until those five rounds are over and then return to normal. 
3. In all subsequent defensive battles, the dead souls of the pretty country front's defensive battles will receive an additional 200% power bonus in addition to the wind elegance bonus. Three choices, representing three directions. One was to help the globe. One was briefly powerful to help itself. And one was a permanent moderate help to itself. Of the three choices, pretty country chose the second. They were the best to gain from the first round of the war of keeping. So the calculation would begin with the dead souls of the second round of the war of keeping. The second round was during World War II, those deceased World War II soldiers left on their front line in the second round should still be quite a lot, with such an accumulation, I think the next round will be easier. Turning to winning sky, the old man told all he knew about the pretty country's situation, but they appeared option was appearing in front of everyone in pretty country at that time, whereas in our case, the option didn't appear in front of everyone after the settlement was over. So what we're thinking is that maybe the bonus option was only given to you this time. After listening to the old man's words, Winning Sky also began to fumble. Not to mention, with a thought, that option was really groped out by him. It was a greenish-blue insubstantial scroll floating in the air. It was the same as Pretty Country's best performance plus option sheet from last time. It's this time also had three bonuses available for the best performance nation to choose from. Winning Sky fixed his eyes and realized that the three choices he had here were. 1. In all subsequent defensive battles, the dead souls of the readers in the history of all countries can also be revived and gain the power of literary warfare to guard the gates of each country. 2. In the subsequent two rounds of defense battles, the defense dead souls on the front line of Great Sia doubled their style bonus. 3. In all subsequent defensive battles, the defending fallen souls of the Great Sia front line will receive an additional 300% power bonus in addition to the grace bonus. Except for the first choice. The remaining two choices were both different from pretty countries. This choice was visible to everyone else in the ward besides winning sky. After reading through everything, the old man sighed with some regret. It's a pity that there's no cumulative power. The different editions all had a simple name in addition to the basic introduction. The three from pretty country were called, the power of literary warfare, the cumulative power, and the powerful power. And the ones that winning sky had drawn were, the power of literary battle, the power of style, and the powerful power. To say what was the best performance bonus that Dasha wanted the most right now, it was definitely the cumulative power. Because of all the choices that had appeared so far, cumulative power was undoubtedly the strongest. Moreover, Dasha has Qing Dynasty on its side. If you don't accumulate a few battle guard dead souls in the early stages to help out in the aftermath, when the time came to rely only on the Qing Dynasty and dead souls to defend the battle, the result was feared to really be 10 deaths. But the powerful force is not bad and our choice of powerful force is stronger than the pretty country one. This one of ours can additionally add 300% power to all subsequent battle guarding souls. Inside the ward, the old man as well as all the top brass of Great Xia finally unanimously supported winning Sky's choice of the powerful force. As for the power of style and the power of civil war, both were all directly passed over by them after taking a glance at the contents. Doubling the grace bonus. One must have a lot of elegance bonus to earn. Otherwise, there wasn't really much difference between one becoming two. The specific historical time of the next stick has already been set. The corresponding era on Dasha's side was probably the Republic of China. The elegance of Dasha during the Republic of China was obviously still not qualified in the world during the same period. So there wasn't much significance in picking the next power of elegance now. On the other hand, the power of civil war, let alone. The object targeted by the bonus was actually the global war defenders, so fraternal? Although it was said that before the invasion of the 10,000 races, the modern Dixia was indeed quite fraternal in the international arena. But now that all the races have invaded, if you only target yourself with better bonus options, then it must be a better option for itself. And, fundamentally speaking Dasha also really doesn't need the power of civil war too much. Not to mention other things, at least the following two stick Republic of China as well as the Qing Dynasty. Dasha's side certainly has not produced any bullish readers. The Qing Dynasty is not to mention. The Republic of China. What a chaotic time it was. The warlords were in chaos, and the warlords were the main force in the next baton. The power of civil war definitely won't play much of a role in the next bat. Winning Sky, the choice appears in front of you, and this is for you to choose. The old man and all the executives in the ward looked at Winning Sky, although there was no recommendation. But they were already all defaulting to the fact that Winning Sky would also choose the powerful force. Just, the next second. Winning Sky's real choice was what made them freeze, only to see that Winning Sky looked at the three choices after pondering for a moment. In the end, he directly and firmly chose the first choice, the power of win battle. This, the old men froze. They didn't understand why Winning Sky chose this. Could it be that Winning Sky really had a fraternal heart? 
He was able to damage himself to that extent for the people of Grand Xia, so it was really possible to say that he had a fraternal heart. However, if he still showed love to his country at the time of this choice, wasn't it a bit too much of an inside job? Inside the hospital room, the crowd wanted to say something, but they didn't know what to say. This choice of winning Sky made them very uncomfortable. But without winning Sky, they wouldn't even have the chance to choose. So the words of accusation, they really couldn't say either. That's it then. Maybe a special effect will appear at that time. The old man coughed, wanting to regulate the atmosphere. Where could winning Sky not know what they were thinking? So in the next second, it's also straightforward to laugh. Everyone. I never chose this because of any fraternity. Rather, it's both in the near and long term. The power of civil war for our great Xia, are incomparably powerful. Winning Sky's words, it made everyone instantly freeze again. And then, they only saw Winning Sky begin to speak again. Let's talk about the long term first, you all don't know the history before the great Xia Qing dynasty. But what I can tell you guys is that at that time, the elegance of our de Xia's literati had really reached a realm that could be called strange. So the benefits that the power of literary warfare can bring to our grand Xia in the long run are definitely much more than the other two options. And then after that, it's the near future. Winning Sky took a deep breath. The near future, that is, the next stick of the Republic of China. It's true that it was a time of warlords at that time, but that doesn't mean that the reading people at that time were chicken shit. On the contrary, the reading people back then. In some aspects, the elegance was even far beyond the warlords. Regarding the questioning of the De Xia executives in the ward, Winning Sky could actually understand. This was because, as stated before, the 10,000 races had not only targeted everyone for memory erasure, it had also directly erased many of the documents that should be in the world, not allowing everyone to specifically restore history again afterward. And about the history of the Republic of China, almost all the stories of the literati became the victims of this time. At present, the world feels that the Dacia Republican period is only the era of warlords. That was because they all simply didn't have literature that could restore the content of specific literati anymore. The literature of the literati of the Republic of China has all been erased. You guys haven't really completely restored everything about the Republic of China, that's why you think that Dasha's literary power doesn't work. Winning Sky looked at the old man, but now, what I can determine with you guys is, if the readers can all gain power as well, in the next baton, the role they play will definitely be much, much more than simply having the other dead souls add some power. Saying that, Winning Sky looked to the side. It seemed that many Republic of China readers had appeared by his side. That being said, the readers of the Republic of China were still slightly different from all the other eras of the Grand Xia. They were organized together and had another name. That name was called Revolutionaries. It seems like there are things we've forgotten. There really are too many. When Winning Sky finished these words, the crowd present finally understood all. However, understanding was understanding. After understanding, the melancholy that everyone should have felt still did not dissipate. Because, even if Dashia is really a brilliant literati, that also has to be useful only if these literati can be reproduced. And nowadays, the only one who can reproduce their stories is Winning Sky. Yet, he was extremely injured in the last round of the guard battle. He needed to recuperate properly next, and could no longer write literature. Well, there's no need to think anymore. The moment the library appeared in my head, I wouldn't really be qualified to recuperate comfortably. Winning Sky was flooded with a bitter smile. He did not say much. Yet, he had already finished what he was going to say. And on the opposite side, after hearing this response from Winning Sky, the old man's heart also instantly had a lot of sourness rise up again. In fact, at this time, he really wanted to domineeringly come up with a sentence, I don't need you next, you have a good rest. But the mighty 10,000 races as well as the burden of the country's hundreds of millions of subjects ultimately pressured him to not be able to say so. Until the last resort, it's better to rest. The old man uttered such a sentence with difficulty. Following that, they sat and chatted about many other things for roughly 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, the old man, as well as the top echelons of Dixia, then all left in droves. Today's meeting with Winning Sky had allowed them to learn too much new information. And whether it was this new information or Winning Sky's specific choice on the best performance plus, all of them required these Dixia executives to follow up with many new arrangements. For example, the first thing to do was to inform the public. Perhaps in the past, many information countries would not directly inform the people. However, now that the 10,000 races had invaded and despair was spreading throughout the entire Grand Xia, if information was no longer circulated, then it would really be an external chaos as well as an internal one. Winning the sky's safety is now the most important concern of the people in the rear of the entire Grand Xia, so this is basically a quick and timely update announcement. 
After that, there is also the specific choice of winning Sky in the plus, and most importantly, winning Sky can restore the history before the Qing dynasty of Dasha, and the history before the Qing dynasty of Dasha in the same period of time, but also the world's best information. These are not bad, even excellent news. Report out can stabilize the people, let the people in despair and then rise out of hope. Now the great Xia is urgent need to have such a hope. Therefore, the top management of Dixia did not think of concealing this point at this time. It can be said that, in addition to the library thing. Next the Dasha officials basically reported everything about today on the internet. All the latest news about Prof. Win. What was sent out on the official side of Dasha was an announcement. The content of the announcement was rather cumbersome. So it was left to the major media outlets to divide it into many more specific news. Professor Win has come to his senses, meditating and recuperating, he can recover. Plus choice for the best performance of the last bat, the power of the civil war. Prof. Win knows the history of Dasha before the Qing dynasty. Dasha's history before the Qing dynasty was the best in the world at the same time. And then, when in detail, every piece of news was read through. Not to mention Dasha, even the entire world was sensationalized in an instant. Surprisingly choosing the power of civil war, is this backfield savior of Dixia so fraternal? Although this backfield savior has indeed helped Dixia extremely much, I don't feel that he would be making the right choice. The history of Dixia's faults is known to him, and he's the best in the world? Why do I feel like I'm talking nonsense? Dixia once had a history of being the best in the world, this is the funniest joke I've heard this year. A fantasy belonging to the people of Dixia, this Professor Wynn may indeed be legendary in the past, but right now, he has undoubtedly injured his brain. The people of various countries outside of Dasha. After reading this recent announcement from the Dasha officials the evaluations were basically all negative, or questioned, or despised, or ridiculed. All in all, whether it was winning Sky's choice of best performance plus or winning Sky's claim of the Qing dynasty's global history, they all ended up responding with words like ridiculous, wrong, and so on. On the other hand, on the other hand, the people of Dixia had a very different mood after this announcement. As people who had truly been saved by Winning Sky, as well as people who had truly seen Winning Sky suffer in various ways in order to save everyone, their trust in Winning Sky had already reached a point where no explanation was needed. Although Winning Sky was still just a human being, but he could already be considered as their god. When Winning Heaven said that he could protect them, he had really protected them. Now Winning Heaven said that he could restore the history before the Qing dynasty, then he can really restore it. If he said that the Great Summer was the greatest in the world, then it really was. If he said that the power of literary warfare was the most useful to the Grand Xia, then it really was the most useful. Prof. Win, take a good rest, your body is the most important thing. The power of win battle? I'm looking forward to what this power of addition will do for us. We have a chance to recreate the history before the Qing dynasty, and it's also the history of the same period of time, which was the best in the world. This. Good news came so suddenly, can anyone tell me, am I dreaming? From today onwards those foreigners no longer have the qualification to say that there is no one in our Dasha's ancestry, because our backyard salvation prof, Win has said that he will bring our Dasha's history back to life once again, on the feedback of the announcement. Domestic and foreign countries presented two completely opposite attitudes, and specifically whose insistence was the right one. This mere discussion and argument didn't make sense. It could only be said to argue on and on. In the end, we still wait for the specific development of the plot. However, lively is true. Over the next few days, the internet, the number of various posts ushered in a new peak. The reason for the spike in the number of posts. On the one hand, it was naturally because of this particular announcement from Winning Sky and Dasha, and on the other hand, it was also due to the fact that the next baton of battle-guarded dead souls from various countries had finally begun to revive. On the battlefield of the Grand Xia frontline, countless new undead souls that possessed another kind of essence appeared. And after appearing, they also quickly understood everything. Guarding the descendants? The Republic of Dashia was an era of warlords and warlords. So 90% of those who appeared on the battlefield at this time were also warlords of all kinds. Warlords were not a product unique to the Republic of China. They have already appeared in the early history of Dashia. Only the synonym given to them then was clans and towns. Regarding the literature on the warlords of the Republic of China, the All Nations side didn't spend any power to erase it. So even with global amnesia, Dasha's side has basically kept the story intact. The story was basically restored in its entirety. There are many reasons for the rise of the warlords in the Republic of China. The disintegration of the imperial system, the weakening of the central power, the strengthening of the local power, as well as internal contradictions, geographic factors and the support of the great powers. But no matter what the reason was, after their rise, the disadvantages they brought to the people of Dasha far outweighed the benefits as iron nails and rivets. 
Though it is true that some progress and changes were made in the modernization of Dacia when they flourished, the warlord's lack of a strong ideology allowed for freedom of cultural activity and successfully led to the rise of the new culture movement. But the endless civil war, economic stagnation and social unrest brought too much and too great a disaster to Dacia at that time after all. Warlords, the rear of Dacia, the center point sector. The old man had also seen the contents of the front line at the moment. Before this, he had been confused about exactly what kind of attitude he should take to face these people. But now, really seeing the revival of these people and reappearing on the battlefield, all of those superfluous thoughts dissipated in just a moment. No matter what happened in the past, now they are the frontline soldiers ah. So if you look at them now, you can't dwell on the past, can you? I've come back to life with you, you dog. Guarding the gates of the country? Put it aside, I have to talk to you first. Uh, wait. How is this frontline screen? The two roads happen to fall in one place of the warlords only three minutes to fight? Feelings of these warlords themselves, each other are now still entangled in the past ah? This is not pitiful? Inside the ward. Winning Sky was also looking at the front line at this time. Upon seeing the next second, after certain warlord troops at the front line just came out and directly fought, his face reddened to the extreme. Countless expletives literally all appeared in Winning Sky's mind in an instant. This is the result of the Age of Chaos, unlike the first two rods which were both united as a whole. Nowadays, the warlord forces in this third stick are really too chaotic. You have a grudge against me, I have a grudge against you and each one of them is still independent and egotistical to a fault. This special meow, won't 10,000 races didn't fight, the self family will fight the self family all lost, right? Okay, mom's ass, all died once, still don't understand things? At the time when the scene was at its most dramatic, eventually, a raspy voice appeared leveling down everything on the front line, and afterward, upon seeing the exact appearance of the person who issued that raspy voice, at once, the Dasha subjects at the back were all instantly revitalized as well. This classic mantra, the head of the phone system of the Northern Warlords, Zhang Zuolin, Marshal Zhang, to say who was the most legendary character during the Warlord Chaos? That would undoubtedly be this king of the Northeast, Marshal Zhang. The battle power of the Feng Tian system led by him was outrageously strong. But in addition to his more popular is the person himself, brave and resourceful and righteous, and most importantly, also tart. Taking the money of the ghosts do not give the ghosts to do things, crazy fishing. After that, he froze the ghosts to force the ghosts to have no way out, and blew up the car to kill him. When Winning Day first looked at the Republic of China, he was extremely appreciative of this person. I didn't expect that nowadays, when there was a problem on the front line, it was also this one who came forward and strongly solved things. One by one, they only care about their own grudges. Nor are they afraid of making the juniors at the back laugh. Is the point now to look back to the past? How long have you been dead, and you're still looking at the past? The 10,000 races, that's the enemy we have to face now. Guarding the country and guarding our descendants is what we should be doing now. Can't tell anything apart. What's the point of resurrection? Is it worthy of a horse's resurrection? Zhang Zuolin's resurrection was at Guardian Station No. 8. However, his voice was like a huge bell directly spreading throughout the entire front line of Dasha. Under his loud curses, those warlords who came out in chaos only then stopped one by one. Afterwards, what to do what to do. In short, a certain number of warlords that were in turmoil temporarily stopped moving because of his scolding. You guys have worked hard. Let us guard our country next. When the chaos in itself was temporarily resolved, Zhang Zuolin also directly walked to the other side of the 8th station he was at. At this moment, the remaining battlefield fighters on the 2nd stick had yet to dissipate. Therefore, Zhang Zuolin conducted a handover ceremony with them. In fact, a handover ceremony was optional. However, Marshal Zhang still felt that he should conduct it. There were actually very few soldiers standing opposite him. More of them were ordinary people. They were covered in blood. The ones with broken arms and legs were too numerous to count. Right away, fear was written all over their faces. Zheng Zuolin thought that this was because these people had just finished fighting. The aftermath of their fear of the battlefield. However, he did not want to think that the fear of these people at this time was the fear that Zheng Zuolin, these battle defenders who belonged to the third baton, would not be able to take over and defend Yenhua. You must guard our great Xia's national gate. Otherwise, we will never let you go. The warriors of the second baton all stared tightly at Zhang Zuolin like wolves. Feeling such a look from everyone, Zhang Zuolin was silent for a long time. After a long time, it's knotted down firmly. I will seriously fight against the 10,000 clans until the last moment. The entire Fong lineage, all of them. Hearing this promise from him. Only then did the frowns of the civilian battle guards who had recovered from the second rod stretch a little. After that, the civilian battle guards retreated to the side one by one. 
The only remaining anti-war military defenders in the second baton came before Zhang Zuolin. Perhaps before this, in the past history, they had some grudges against each other. But now, those things are not mentioned by anyone anymore. The second baton of resistance soldiers was just simply handing over to the warlords. There are three levels of the national gate, as well as many defensive battles, and there are seven great levels of the 10,000 races. Actually, the resistance soldiers of the second baton didn't know much information. But relaying is well, when you know something, you always have to pass it on. At the moment, this was true for the resistance fighters on Zhang Zuolin's side, and it was also true for the other resistance fighters of the Guardian War. In such a handover, the mentality of the scattered warlords gradually changed. They may still be egotistical, but the word protect the country has also been engraved in their hearts. Though in the end, what has changed is only partial. After all, most of the warlords came from bandits. Some people have the concept of the country, some people have the righteousness of guarding future generations. Then outside of this there are still people who do not care about anything but themselves. But, no matter what, there are some, there are some warlords whose mentality can be turned around is already very good. Keep our country, future generations, well guarded ah. It was the third month of the invasion of the 10,000 races. It was the fourth day of the truce period on the front lines of the countries. On this day, the second batons of the nations were handed over to their third batons. The dead souls on the front line were originally dying and coming back to life. So after dying once more or after the official handover at this moment, what will the resuccession of their life be like? It's probably just another long sleep and losing everything. Dasha, the front line battlefield. The soldiers of the resistance were already pretty much accounting for everything. It was interesting to say the least. During this handover, there were even people who had handed over to themselves. He had been a warlord subordinate during the warlord period, and then an anti-Japanese pioneer during the resistance period. The warkeeper of both recoveries was him, but again, he could no longer be counted as one person. You are me, and who am I? The two identical people stood face to face in amazement. To be honest, there was something comical about such an image. Frontline. Zhang Zuolin as well as an anti-war officer beside him. In unison, they both laughed out loud after seeing this scene. And the rear? When the people saw this scene, the corners of their mouths also smiled slightly. The thought of, if only time could be frozen in this moment appeared in their hearts. We should go. Only, this thing called a thought could only exist as a thought itself after all. This place, the front line, was destined from its birth not to have too long of happy times. After the basic handover ceremony was almost carried out. After the basic handover ceremony, it was time for those who still existed on the battlefield to part and dissipate. I defended our Dacia during the War of Resistance. The Republican era me, next, you can never retreat ah. In front of them, those two identical soldiers set a pact. And the Resistance era officer looking at them with Zhang Zuolin? After a few seconds of silence, it was also straightforward to carry out the goodbye that belonged between them. When in pain, just look at the rear. Our descendants, they are all looking at us seriously. And so it was, the fallen warriors of the resistance, officially ushered in their end once more. On the vast and boundless battlefield, the blazing sun shone high, as the bells of life once again rang in their ears. Those battle defenders that still existed in the second stick, they all looked to the rear where the descendants of Dasha were. Arise, people who do not wish to be slaves, take our flesh and blood and build our new great wall. I don't know who shouted out first, immediately afterward, the entire great summer front line. All of the second stick of dead souls defending the battle began to sing. Along with the singing, gradually, their bodies began to become blurred, like statues eroded by the years. And then, a light descended from the sky. Under the illumination of this invisible light, the bodies of all the resistance dead warriors became transparent again. Their uniforms and weapons became as fragile as a film. The inside of their bodies shone with a brilliant light, as if there were countless stars shining. Then after that, their bodies also completely turned into radiant points of light which were like agile butterflies, fluttering in the air and colliding with each other. At the end, all the points of light melted together to form a beautiful pillar of light that broke through the clouds and also lit up the entire sky once again. At the instant the points of light dissipated. These undead soul warriors who were guarding the next stick for Dasha did not feel fear or panic. On the contrary, their hearts were filled with tranquility and peace. Thinking back to the dots and dashes of these days, they felt that their rebirth this time was fulfilling and meaningful. They were proud of their efforts and dedication during this month. At the moment when the same turned into a point of light and eventually dissipated, that fallen officer from the war period also took another look at the rear. He softly uttered a sentence. Others might not know what he was saying, but the rear, winning sky in the hospital room was hearing it incomparably clearly. Child, when you're tired, you must rest. Don't fight all alone and hard anymore. 
facing the other party with these last wishes at the end. Opening his mouth, Winning Sky was eager to engage in some response. But unfortunately, without waiting for him to open his mouth, everything was already over. In the sky, the light that the ancestors had transformed into could no longer be seen. Immediately after that, on the frontline battlefield, snowflakes were falling down. The frontline was always like this, the weather was a mess. The old story has ended, the new story is about to begin. Such an image had already been experienced once by the people in the rear of Dasha. It was the same when the first baton of battle guarded dead souls and the second baton of battle guarded dead souls on the front line took over. Only, the second baton of battle guarding fallen souls did keep their agreement to hold on to the gates of the great Xia. I don't know what will happen to the brand new story that the third baton of battle guarded dead souls on the front line will bring to the world at this time. Another attack from the 10,000 races is coming. Time passed quickly. In the blink of an eye. One day, two days. The complete truce period then ended. After the truce period ended. The invasion of the 10,000 races once again came with a bang. And to everyone's surprise, on the first day of the new 30 days of this new official count, the first day of the defensive battle, the side of Dixia's newly appointed ROC warlords had actually achieved a great victory in a very outrageous manner. Although all the warlords were a bit flustered when they first encountered the 10,000 race demon monsters, as they fought, their guts and experience came to them. This is nothing. After the first day of the defensive battle, some of the warlords and their soldiers were having a big laugh. At the back, the deep Dasha populace was also happy to see the front line winning a great victory. But after being happy, for some reason, everyone is again some inexplicable coldness behind their backs. There is always a feeling that something is not right. Inside the ward, winning Sky's back was also a little cold. And then, after finishing a dinner, he violently raised his head. He finally figured out what was wrong with the front line at this time. The front line battle force on the Grand Xia side has been updated, and the additions have been updated as well. But the 10,000 races demonic monsters on the opposite side are still the same ones from before. How come they haven't replenished any new battle power at all? Dashya, in the rear, inside the hospital ward. Since Winning Sky was still only able to move his head at this time. So eating basically relied on Zhang Hanan to feed him. But that wasn't the focus right now. The focus now was. After Winning Sky brought up the front line that something was wrong at the moment. Zhang Hanan, who was on the side, also directly widened his eyes. Right, the opposite side is indeed still those secondary creatures that we've already familiarized ourselves with. Zhang Hanan took a deep breath, but this shouldn't be ah, when we update our side's battle power when changing rods, the 10,000 races side is also sure to update, it was like this before. Zhang Hanan took out his cell phone, quickly flipping through the internet to see what was going on abroad this day. And with this flip, her entire person then also shuddered directly. The front lines of other countries are already bumping into many new strange and bizarre 10,000 race demon monsters. Even tertiary, some of the 10,000 race demon monsters belonging to tertiary have appeared. A strange force in the universe hindered the 10,000 races that had invaded earth. This was also the reason why the high grade 10,000 race demonic monsters were unable to come to earth at the moment. However, such a hindering force was also weakening day by day. The invasion had proceeded until now. The third level demonic monsters finally possessed the ability to enter the earth. However, it was also at this time when the front lines of all the other countries had already hit the third level demonic monsters. The front line of the Grand Xia side. However, it was still facing the Mantis Tiger Clan that had fought many times before, the Little Moon Clan. This is the calm before the storm. Regarding this strange phenomenon, Winning Sky didn't think that it was because Great Xia had gotten lucky. And what about the fact that it was indeed so? The 10,000 races to Xia sub base. That night, a huge to terrifying orb then directly appeared out of thin air, connected to the ground, and stopped there. This orb was red in color, with many long golden thorns on its body, and a mouth that was so huge that it was extreme. After seeing this huge orb, the sub-base set up by the 10,000 races in Dasha, all the surviving second-grade demonic monsters could be said to be shivering in an instant. And the reason? It is also very simple. Just because this huge ball from the god-swallowing blood mouth clan, the one who succeeded the three geniuses of the Heaven's Eyes Eight Arms clan to lead us in a new round of invasion is actually a mother emperor of the God Swallowing Bloodmouth clan? Unlike the Heaven's Eye Eight Arms clan, which had human form and intelligence, the God Swallowing Bloodmouth clan's Bloodmouth mother emperor didn't even talk about human form. It didn't even have a brain. However, right now, it was such a brainless monster. The sense of oppression that it brought to the secondary demonic monsters in the base, but it was much higher than a hundred geniuses of the Heaven's Eye Eight Arms race. The ability of the Heaven's I-8 Arms Clan genius was to double the number of subordinates. But the ability of the Blood Mouth Mother Emperor was to give birth. The Blood Mouth Mother Emperor could quickly 
Give birth to a large number of blood mouth demon monsters with extremely powerful attacks. It's over. In the base, the talking level 2 creatures. At this moment, they could not help but say this. There it's over was aimed at two targets. The first target was naturally Dasha. It said that the country named Dasha will definitely be finished next. But other than that, the two words finished. The other word finished was also directed at all the other demonic monsters in the Dasha station. The blood mouth mother emperor can give birth to and eat at the same time. Next, what will the blood sucking queen be able to eat in the base? Unsurprisingly, 80% of it would be them, these pitiful second tier 10,000 race demon monsters. Well, it turns out that we're not the only ones to be eaten. When the blood mouth mother emperor opened her mouth and swallowed all of the second grade demon monsters in the base, these swallowed second level demonic monsters managed to find many more strange faces in the blood mouth mother emperor's void stomach. There were not only many new level 2 demonic monsters in these faces, there were even countless various level 3 demonic monsters. In this battle between the humans and the 10,000 races, the undead warriors in front of the human country's gates would be replenished with new ones, and naturally, the demonic monsters on the side of the 10,000 races wouldn't remain the same either. In every battle of gate invasion, the one clan side will not only change their leader, but also update the various types of small monster warriors that will go into battle. On the other hand, the reason why the Dissia side has not hit any third level monster so far may be the reason why. On her way to take over the position of invasion unification leader, the blood mouth mother emperor ate all the other demon monsters that also came. Surprisingly, a supreme blood mouth mother emperor of the god swallowing blood mouth clan went in. At this time, the three of the heavens I eight arms clans whom Zito were already leaving earth. On the other side of space and time, which was extremely far from earth, they sensed the current situation on Dissia's side. After realizing that the one who had succeeded them in entering the earth was actually a blood mouth mother emperor, and that this blood mouth mother emperor had directly eaten all the other level 2 and 3 demonic monsters that were teammates on the grand Sia side as soon as she had descended. The three of them looked at me and I looked at you, all of them couldn't help but suck in a breath of cold air. This looks like the right one is you guys. It's impossible for this country, grand Sia, to last any longer. Before, there was still some hope for de Sia, to be precise, it was Tao who had some hope for winning Sky. Now, he no longer had any illusions that de Sia could last past the next one or two sticks. Under the raging attack of the Blood Mouth Mother Emperor, the dead souls on the front line of the Grand Xia had no hope of being able to defend the gates of the Grand Xia. It should take 10 days for the Blood Mouth Mother Emperor to digest, right? During these 10 days, because all the other demonic monsters in the base have been swallowed, there will definitely be no more secondary or tertiary demonic monsters that dare to travel to. In the following. Therefore, in the next short period of time, it seems that this country of Dissia will be able to directly enjoy a wave of truly invincible joy? The heavenly eye broke through space and time. Gazing at the earth, Zay carried out such a jest. And Tao, who was standing opposite him. After hearing Z's words then he couldn't help but just shake his head. A short period of happiness. After that, you'll be faced with complete despair. At this moment, he even felt a trace of sympathy for Dasha. If it were me, I'd rather not have such happiness. In the next second, Tao withdrew his mind and stopped gazing at the earth. Since the ending was already set, what was there to see? Anyway. The story is all already becoming not going to be exciting anymore. There are no more monsters on the Dasha front. On the sixth day, nothing happened on the Dasha front. Disappearing monsters, what makes Dasha so lucky? Time passes like a white horse, and in the blink of an eye, it's another five days. In these five days, as the three sons of Tao analyzed, Dasha's front line ushered in a wave of invincibility period. Our own side was being beaten by the demonic monsters. The front line of the Grand Xia had no monsters in front of its gates. This makes the people of other countries on the earth can be said to be envious and jealous of China, as well as the most important hate, to the extreme. On what grounds? There are so many third level demonic monsters on our side of the front line, but there are no third level demonic monsters on the side of Grand Xia. How come the second level first level demonic monsters don't even appear anymore? Does Grand Xia possess some special means to keep the demons from entering? Strongly request that De Xia publicize the method and share it globally. I'm a Dasha person, I was forced to come to pretty country before, I cursed Dasha because I was forced to, can you let me go back to Dasha, why is this broken barrier blocking me, I want to go back to my own country in the barrier. In the face of all kinds of remarks from the people of other countries, on Dasha's side, there was basically nothing to respond to, if it was a mere advantage, Dasha will definitely have people responding to the online dejected, but at the moment, the front line was actually not even a single monster, too cool, too good, in a way, this will only make people more afraid. So do not pay attention to the other countries on the internet people said all. At this moment, the populace at the back of the Great Summer only wanted to explore the reason why there was no monster at the front line. 
Unless one can go and take a look in the bases that the 10,000 clans have set up on the far side of the Great Xia front line, otherwise it's simply impossible to know. The reason why the demonic monsters on the front line of our country all disappeared at once, Kyoto, inside the hospital room. The old man shook his head and uttered such a sentence when he came to visit Win Tian, and perhaps it was a meeting of minds, while it was making such words. On the front line, the Marshal Zheng Zuolin, who was at the Dashia State Gate Guardian Station 8, he was also staring into the distance, and synchronizedly uttered words that were exactly the same as his. Marshal, is it that serious? I feel that we fought too hard on the first day, and those monsters are scared, so they won't dare to come if they're scared? Beside Zhang Zuolin, there stood a big and thick bandit officer. Hearing his words, Zhang Zuolin really felt that his brain was severely insulted. The 10,000 clans are not as weak as you think. Zhang Zuolin glared at the other party. The other party instantly dared not speak. And then, after pondering for a long time, Zhang Zuolin still felt that he should do something. Thus, he sent out a wave of 500 troops and had them begin their journey towards the great summer subbase of the 10,000 races that was unknown how far away on the opposite side. Little by little, time passed, and quickly another five days passed. After the new five days had passed, the 500 people that had been sent out still had no news. They were like stones thrown into the sea, destined to sink into the sea at the moment of departure. In the end, what happened? Zheng Zuolin thought of himself as a brave man who had never been afraid of anything. Even if recovery had asked him to fight the 10,000 clans, he hadn't had a single bit of cowardice. However, now that the 10,000 clans had disappeared into thin air, it was something that made him uncontrollably start to get scared. The fear of human beings is never what ghosts and monsters, but the unknown. This unknown every one more day, that cannot be said to understand the fear will rise a section. Confused, uncertain, do not know what to do. In this way, another three days passed. And then, it was on the 14th day that Zhang Zuolin and the others officially started the war with the 10,000 races. On the front line of the Grand Xia, there was finally a bit of a special story. That is, the ground near Guardian Station No. 14 suddenly burst into flames from time to time. This kind of fire was able to burn the frontline warriors, so it also caused some confusion. However, it was just some confusion. After the problem appeared. Soon after, there was an undead soul warlord at the frontline who specialized in solving it. The solution exerted by that undead soul warlord was pretty fucked up. However, the method that was fucked up, on the contrary, worked. Mayor Gobi, rain on your labor. Or else I'll bring people to blast you with cannons. Zhang Zongchang, a warlord during the Republican era. At the same time, he was also a poet in the Republican era. What if the ground is on fire? Just put it out with water. So the first time, the warlord who once prayed for rain raised his hand and stood up. He used the same method of praying for rain as he did before he was born. Zhang Zongchang led his men to bombard the heavens. Not to mention, after this wave of bombing, rain really did fall from the sky. Cannons open up and bombard the mother. Wei Jia Hai and Yai Ruashi goes home. Count the heroes Ruashi Zhang Zongchang, and get the giant whale Ruashi Swallow Fusong. Ah, uh, labor can be so awesome. Seeing this wave of Zhang Zongchang begging for rain, whether it was the front line, or the rear, all of them were deeply speechless. Whether it was his behavior or his poem, everyone really wouldn't comment on it. AI, whatever, it's good that things are settled anyway. In the back, inside the ward of Kyoto Hospital. At this time, Winning Sky was already able to get out of bed. After experiencing a wave of days where only his head could move, the current winning sky was truly enjoying that comfort of moving his limbs. Professor Win, let's eat, I made fish soup today oh. While winning sky was moving around, Zhang Hanan once again arrived with a meal. At the very beginning it was the state that prepared meals for Win Tian. The ones that were prepared were the most rigorous kind of recovery meals. Winning sky really couldn't get used to eating it. He let Zhang Hanan get him some delicious food. Unexpectedly at the back, Zhang Hanan actually directly cooked the meal himself. It was worth mentioning that Zhang Hanan's cooking was really delicious. And he also considered nutrition while cooking. So, in the end, one thing led to another. Winning Sky's main chef was simply and directly replaced with Zhang Hanan. Brother, dinner. As Zhang Hanan came in, a little girl also followed into the ward. With that cute and adorable appearance, who could it be if not Yao Yao? Yao Yao brought candies for brother. Not more than a few days after Win Tian was admitted into the hospital. Yao Yao's family came to the capital. And the reason for that. It was rumored that it was because Yao Yao had been crying at home, always shouting that she misses her brother Win Tian. Yao Yao's parents had no choice but to bring Yao Yao to Kyoto. After they arrived, the countryside also heard about Yao Yao. Before learning about it, Winning Sky hadn't revealed his identity yet. Yao Yao often cried out for Winning Sky's story. The country's crowd of executives were also very touched. And so after that, simply also directly gave Yao Yao's family a new home in Kyoto. 
The location was not far from the hospital. Brother Wintian, when I came here today, I heard the doctor's brothers and nurse's sisters outside shouting for you to be a big hero. On this day, during the meal, Yao Yao suddenly uttered such a sentence. And then, without waiting for Winning Sky to respond, Jun Hanan on the side spoke up first. Yeah, your brother Winning Sky is awesome. A superhero who saved everyone in our entire Grand Xia. Having received Zhang Hanan's certainty, little Yao Yao instantly had her tail up in the air. That proud look was as if it wasn't Winning Sky who was the hero, but this little brat of hers. Alright, alright, hurry up and eat, or else your brother Win Tian won't like you anymore. A meal was finished in merriment, a day like this was really special and cozy. After the invasion of the 10,000 races, it was already difficult for the people in the rear of the Grand Xia to have such a life. These last 10 days were like a restful, beautiful dream. Like a gorgeous garden, people strolled through it, surrounded by colorful flowers. And then, within the garden, each flower exuded a unique fragrance, gathering into an aroma that everyone had never felt before. People were lost in this garden, and every step seemed to go deeper into the abyss of the dream world, unable to find an exit. Even though, during this period, from time to time, everyone will suddenly remember that sentence again the most peaceful before the storm. This is true despair. Inside the ward. After Zhang Hanan and Yao Yao left, Winning Sky then looked out the window again and fell into a daze. In fact, he as well as all the top brass of Disya were trying to break this beautiful dream before despair. However, there was nothing that could be done, and no matter what they did, it seemed that it would not make any changes to the story. There was no way for them to resist that impending unknown despair. They could only act as NPCs in the script written by the other side, and then they were in the first dream life scene set by the other side, being manipulated to move forward. AI. Sighing, Winning Sky returned to the hospital bed. Recently, every day was like this for him. Being drunk in a beautiful dream, and then suddenly awake to seek the path to break the dream. But every time, he can only get no solution, and then continue to go and float in the beautiful dream. This time, Winning Sky thought it would be like this again. But he didn't want to, the next second a little girl directly rushed into the hospital room. Brother Wintian, I still have two candies in my pocket, I forgot to give them to you. The one who rushed in was Yao Yao, holding two candies in her hand. Apple flavored ones? Brother likes eating apples the most. Thanks Yao Yao. Retracting his mind, Winning Sky smiled and accepted Yao Yao's candies. Brother Winning Sky, why are your hands trembling? After their hands came into contact, Yao Yao sensed Winning Sky's abnormality. So she inquired with great curiosity, are you afraid of something? Scared of what? Winning Sky froze violently. Then the entire person fell into silence. Even he himself didn't realize it. He was now often in a state of trembling. Brother Winning Sky, Yao Yao also has a lot of things she's afraid of. Ghosts, big bad wolves, and bad uncles, Yao Yao gets scared every time she just thinks about it. But, every time Yao Yao is scared, mom and dad will stand up. They would say that with them around, there's nothing to be afraid of. That's why brother Wintian can also look for mommy and daddy. Yao Yao counted her fingers and spoke very seriously. And then, she froze, and she violently raised her little head. Brother Winning Sky, isn't he a big hero? This sentence caused Winning Sky to directly open his eyes wide. In the next second, Yao Yao continued, a big hero should be even more powerful than mommy and daddy. Mommy and daddy and Yao Yao said that the big hero is invincible, he's not afraid of anything. Brother Win Tian, could it be a fake big hero? A big hero, should he not be afraid of anything? Winning Sky was stunned in place. As a matter of fact, this viewpoint was wrong. A great hero was also a human being, and since he was a human being, there was no excuse for him to be afraid. Opening his mouth, Winning Sky wanted to tell Yao Yao that big heroes also possessed the right to be afraid. However, not a single word could be said. After opening his mouth, he realized that he couldn't say anything. Because Yao Yao is just a child. Children have the right to dream, they can believe in the invincibility of heroes. It's meaningless to change the innocence of a child. On the contrary. In the meantime, the real meaningful thing is to change yourself. Not to tell the child that heroes have moments of powerlessness. Instead, go along with the child and make yourself invincible. While protecting the child, let yourself become a child. Since it is not possible to think about it, then do not think about it. Since the moment is happy, enjoy the moment thoroughly. And then, when the crisis really comes, stand out as a hero and shout, I am invincible. Such a mentality was really naive and foolish. However, it is the savior of winning sky, the great summer backfield. On the long road of despair and darkness that is the relay of the dead souls, he must have. Since I decided to be the savior. Then even if you are brainless, you must not be afraid. Brother Win Tian is of course a truly great hero. Stretching out his hand. Winning Sky rubbed up Yao Yao's head. Brother just had a hand cramp just now. Where is brother afraid of anything? Not to mention those things you're afraid of, even if it's something else. No matter what, in the end, 
brother will definitely be able to beat them down easily. Turning to Yao Yao, Winning Sky revealed an absolutely confident smile. It was the 14th day of the third stick of the 10,000 races invasion. During this day, Winning Sky had practiced the naive and invincible heart that a savior should have. Yao Yao smiled happily after sensing the real change in Win Tianjin. She left the hospital room and followed Zhang Hanan who was waiting outside. And after she left, Winning Sky lay on the hospital bed and soon fell into a dream. In the dream, he was standing in the only point of light in the endless darkness. And then, the darkness around him began to dissipate a little bit. One historical figure after another appeared beside him. It was 5,000 years up and down the Great Xia. Although the face of each person, Winning Sky continued to be unable to see clearly. But the words they conveyed to Winning Sky. Winning Heaven heard them all. That is, I am invincible. Winning Sky was being a savior, a hero, to protect the children of the entire Grand Xia. One man stood out and topped the naive invincible heart. But, above him, but, above him, there are more people, also top the naive and invincible heart. He claimed that he could become the invincible hero that he, the child, recognized. Although the surroundings are dark, but all around is the light that can be called invincible. Little by little, Winning Sky moved forward, and eventually, he saw a group of people. Unlike the people in front of him, the faces of the last group of people were visible. Carrying a bucket load, these last people were simply too many. Each of them stood there with their chests out and their heads up proudly as if they were the only ones in heaven and earth. Their eyes were firm and bold, without a hint of wavering. Their posture was as straight as a pine, without the slightest bend, just like a lofty mountain peak standing in the world. Each of their faces wore a fearless smile, a smile that knew its own value and was convinced of its own beliefs. What emanated from them was not arrogance, but a confidence and bravado that welled up from the depths of their hearts. They are not puffing out their chests for the sake of others' praise, their haughty look is a symbol of attitude. Biting the green mountain and not letting go, establishing roots in the broken rock, a thousand grinding blows are still strong, let the wind blow from east to west and from south to north. So what if the ten thousand races are about to usher in a great storm for the great summer? Let go of the evil with the stroke of a pen, the broken bamboo will be difficult to return. In the end, everyone dissipated, and there was only one man left in front of Winning Sky who had yet to leave. The man wore a long shirt, his hair stood up one by one, and he had a thick beard which was extremely similar to them in the official script. His body was very thin, and his skin was yellow with white, like a patient recovering from a serious illness, his face was emaciated. However, he was in good spirits, his whole body was refreshed and his eyes were shining. Winning Sky recognized the other party, and the other party also saw Winning Sky. He froze for a few seconds. Finally, he revealed a gentle smile. The story is about to begin. He said, The next second. Wintry opened his eyes and got up from the hospital bed. He opened the large screen that the old man had prepared for him, only to see that the front line was very different at this time. After the beautiful dream time, the real war was next. On the front line of Dashia, the blood mouth mother emperor was already completely digested. And after it had finished digesting, round after round, compared to ordinary second level third level demonic monsters, the blood mouth demon monsters, which were far more terrifying, had officially descended. They were not as big as the blood mouth mother emperor, but only as big as a human child. The appearance was also a red ball with gold spikes, and a huge mouth that gave people chills. Prepare for battle. On the front line, with Zhang Zuolin at the head, all the warlords of the various guardian stations stood up at this moment. The moment the smell of blood spread throughout the entire front line battlefield. They knew that the storm after the so-called tranquility was finally coming. Damn it, what the hell is all this shit? Countless bloodmouth demons and monsters charged in a completely irrational manner. Facing these weird contraptions, the various guardian battles all launched bullets violently. As a matter of fact, in the face of the special 10,000 races, both hot weapons and cold weapons had the exact same effect. Because the damage of the weapon itself was removed by the shielding, the chi on the dead souls that had been added by the style was the main body that caused the damage. But then again, although the damage was the same, hot weapons had the advantage of being able to fire from a distance. Therefore, at this moment, with the possession of firearms and even tanks and cannons, the dead souls at the front line naturally used these as their primary weapons. Countless bullets and shells covered the chi of the undead warriors, charging towards the bloodmouth demon monster. The bloodmouth demon monster's defense was really low. Basically, as long as the undead soul warriors' bullets could hit them, they would simply die. It doesn't seem that scary? At the front line, an undead soul warrior couldn't help but let go of his heart after killing a wave of bloodmouth demon monsters. However, soon, he paid the price for his relief. The defense of the bloodmouth monster was low, yes. But the reason why it was terrifying was not in its defense. The reason why bloodmouth monsters could become a tier 3 monster, and still the top group of tier 3 monsters, 
was because of their excessive damage, as well as their extremely nauseating death follow-up. On the battlefield, the undead soul warriors swept away the blood mouth monsters. However, when the bloody mouth monsters attacked, the undead warriors on the Grand Xia side attacked. However, the undead soul warriors on De Xia's side also died a large number of times. Just like a balloon, the bloodmouth demon monsters would violently increase in size by half when they attacked. After that, all of those golden thorns on their bodies would burst out with a bang. The excessive damage caused the undead soul warriors on the front line of Grand Xia. The moment the golden thorns were shot, they were basically sentenced to death. And then, the bloodmouth demon monsters besides initiating the attack to shoot out the golden thorns, while being attacked to death. Surprisingly, they would also directly bulge and shoot out all the thorns on their bodies. You don't kill him you die. You kill him to have a death follow-up to shoot out thorns, you still die. How can there be such an outrageous monster in this world, this is too disgusting. It doesn't stop when it dies, who can carry this? More disgusting is what, his side to die a, death directly will shoot dozens of gold thorns to, even if only hit 10 that is also for 10, killed him a, we instead of losing 9, also are all extremely fast long distance, hide or not good to hide. Dashya, the rear. When you see the dream for more than 10 days, the front line to deal with the magic monster is like this. All the people, all within the heart produced a deep despair. They all know that there is no such thing as a free ride, and that after a beautiful dream, there is bound to be a bigger storm. But now the intensity of such a storm still let everyone can't help but start to tremble. What's even more chilling? The number of such monsters alone seems terrifying as well. Central Sector The old man's body trembled slightly after seeing the situation at the front line at the moment. The word insurmountable once again filled his mind. That feeling of absolute powerlessness. It was as if he had aged a few years in this instant. Damn it, the soldiers. Frontline. Watching their subordinates die and get injured at a crazy speed. The warlords from all walks of life all had sore noses and red eyes. It was only until this moment that they finally realized the grueling battle of defending the country. This is the reality after a beautiful dream. Kyoto, inside the ward. Looking at everything on the front line, Winning Sky took a deep breath. At this moment, his body couldn't help but tremble. However, unlike the others. At this moment, his trembling was not due to any fear. I can deal with these monsters. It was excitement. The storm was truly coming. Instead, he began to tremble from excitement. We can deal with these monsters. At the same time, in Winning Sky's mind, that endless darkness, there was a soft clatter. Countless Republic of China literati also instantly all raised their heads. Gentlemen, are you willing to join hands once again? In the darkness, a man whose appearance was not outstanding, but not ugly either. A man with a temperament as warm as jade, a smile spread out from the corner of his mouth. Lord Kai, this time, it's time for us to make a big kill. Beside him stood another man. Winning Sky recognized the two of them. Kai Yuan Pei and Chen Broth Fu. At this moment, the two of them had the exact same aura as him. It was absolute confidence, absolute I am invincible in this battle. Obviously, the front line has become like this. Why did Winning Sky and everyone in his mind instead cheer up? Shaking his head and smiling, Winning Sky figured out why. No more, no less, just two points. One point was that the attributes of the bloodmouth demons seemed to be just right to be restrained by the wenches who had obtained the power of win battle. And the other point is that the opposite side of that still don't know why and give out of the 10 days of ease period, that just good to win the sky through the entanglement and finally practice naive invincible heart, in the next, actually is really can appear the role of the realization. The naive and invincible heart is just a state of mind, I, E absolute self-confidence, regardless of how the opposite, can be firmly faced, without uncertainty, but now take a closer look, but now take a closer look at, but found that it really can have a realistic role, that is, it can make the dead souls summoned by the winning day stronger, it was only a state of mind that could become a bonus after obtaining it, not a style, or a reward, a bonus given to the front line, rather, it's a bonus only for me and the dead souls I awaken, upon specifically perceiving this special bonus, Winning Sky only felt that this world had become even more mysterious. The 10,000 races, the national consciousness, and the battle rules that had descended from nowhere against the battle between Earth and the 10,000 races, as well as the power of the special edition, all of these caused Winning Sky to marvel in awe. At this moment, it was actually discovered that the person writing at the back of the battlefield could also receive a bonus through enlightenment. Although this edition was different from the others and more vast in its effects, yet, it is already enough to make people feel emotional and uplifted. In a certain way, this was even creating another new path for humanity. A more powerful, Rolalizade, backfield path to salvation. So what's next? What's going to depend on will also be my physical strength again. Sitting on the hospital bed, Winning Sky smiled bitterly. The power of the one war that had successfully chosen the right one. 
the one that allowed Dasha to just happen to obtain could restrain the opposite side. The communication with Yao Yao at the moment of comfort, allowing himself to accidentally reach the naive and invincible heart that could gain another bonus. These miscellaneous aspects are full of points. It would be really fucked up if winning Sky didn't give it a go on the main path next. Maybe pain is the life that this backfield savior of mine can't avoid. A computer and keyboard were placed in the hospital room. This was what Winning Sky had forced the country to arrange for him earlier. And now, they were finally able to obtain their true role. How do we start this time? The last baton that Winning Sky had supplemented was with various different armies. Was this bat going to be the same as before? After thinking about it carefully, Winning Sky felt that he could make some slight changes this time. Because at the moment, what has been forgotten is not just the Republic of China literati themselves. Rather, its entire group of stories are no longer left a little. So this time, what he wants to restore should not just be some specific people. What he wanted to retell was the era that was dominated by the literati, putting his hands on the keyboard, only putting them down for a moment. The pain that was so familiar that it couldn't be familiar anymore came back all at once. Although it had been resting for 10 days, it had only healed by the slightest bit. The slightest bit is also enough. Otherwise, I wouldn't even be able to move my hands again right now. Winning Sky was optimistic, or rather, as a savior he had to be optimistic. Strongly enduring the pain, Winning Sky seemed to have returned to the days when he was alone in his room. His mind once again came within the library called Great Summer History. And then, after searching for a long time, he found someone. Sir, going? A story that belonged to the Republic of China's readers. Winning Sky was prepared to use this man as the beginning. In the timeline, this man was fully qualified to be the beginning of the telling. For this trip, I will not go. Only, what made Winning Sky not expect was, this wave of shouting, he was unexpectedly rejected. From the beginning of the retelling of history until now, Winning Sky had never been rejected. Or rather, before this, he had never even made an invitation. Because every time, there was no need for him to invite. The undead souls within the library would all already be scrambling to come out on their own. This bat. I'm sure the other gentleman can hold it. So let me go to the next bat. The man spoke softly. But it was something that made Win Tin's heartache so badly for it. It will be hard to keep the next bat. Winning Sky said this. And then, the man froze slightly. A faint smile appeared on his face. That's why it's all the more important for me to appear at that time. In the most nightmarish of times, there always had to be people who could still stand up against the pain. Liang Qijun, character Zhuo Ru, a character Rinfu, the name of Ringong, also known as the master of the drinking ice room. He was a graduate in the Guangxu period of the Qing dynasty, and also a thinker, politician, educator, historian, and writer in modern Dasha. He was one of the leaders of the Hundred Days Reform, and also a representative figure of the modern reformist school and the new legalists in Dasha. The junior Dasha sayings is his work, he once said, the world's transportation, from chaos and into peace, the principle of victory and defeat, from the force and tends to wisdom, so the words of self-improvement today, to open the people's wisdom is the first righteousness. Winning Sky wanted to use him as the beginning because he predicted the rise of Dasha more than a hundred years ago, and also because for nearly a hundred years, many, many people had basically been influenced by him. But now, he was rejecting winning heaven. This person who could be counted as both the Qing dynasty and the Republic of China. He picked the more difficult one of the Qing dynasty to go for perseverance. Actually, I can also play both rounds. Split it by timeline. Split two of me between the Republican period and the Qing period. Liang Qiwei smiled and shook his head. But that would split some of my power. So it's better to leave the complete me all for that hardest next time. Some people appeared beside Liang Qijin. He smiled at those people and spoke. You guys can keep this bat down, right? The others all bristled. All right, don't talk if you don't come out this time. Our side is the same with or without you. The 10,000 races definitely won't be able to fight their way in. After listening to what these people had said, Liang Qi Ji made an extremely serious salute. Following that, he once again looked at Winning Sky, you. There was no waiting for him to finish his words. The next second, Winning Sky also opened his mouth. Since that's the case, then you can wait comfortably for the next bat. They all shouted okay for this bat, so there's even less of a problem on my side. Invasion of the 10,000 races, bat 3, day 14, night. The world outside the window had fallen into deep darkness. The light inside was faint, but enough to see clearly. Inside the ward. The only sound was the ticking of the clock on the wall. Click click click. And then, a full seven minutes passed. It was only within this room that another sound finally appeared. That was the clear sound that came out after the keyboard keys under winning sky were pressed. I'm inclined to be the unquenchable wildfire, lighting up the four corners of the world, and the world burns into my color. Storms hit and burn in unknown corners, when the wind blows, everywhere is me. 
Returning from the Library of History, Winning Sky was already starting a new head, since Lord Ren had chosen the next bat. Then now, let the gentleman be this bat of the story of the, the Age of Awakening, who is the medicine seeker. It's me, it's us. Before crossing over, there was a critically acclaimed TV series in Winning Sky's world that was about these very people he was going to talk about next. So now, he chose to follow the same pattern as that one, and then cast off some of the illusory ones and added some more real ones to redraw the story. This time it was no longer one article telling the story of one person. Rather, it is a succession of articles that tell a story that is made up of countless people. They, in the form of literati, formed a legendary era together. Censored 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 all censored. Find a way, perhaps from where, find some special channel buckle up, into some place to see? June-like, to bar six of its scattered dance without on. Autonomous rather than slave, progressive rather than conservative, aggressive rather than retired, cosmopolitan rather than lockout, pragmatic rather than fictitious, scientific rather than imaginative. Inside the ward, the keyboard crackled, and winning sky speed grew faster and faster with it. At this moment on the front line, the dead souls in front of the gate of the great summer kingdom had just finished a round of battle. During the rest period in between, the looks of the various warlords had been met with extremes. Horses, this is completely being crushed. If you can't beat them, you'll die, if you can beat them, you'll die, what kind of reasoning is this? Damn it, who in the end knows the way to make those broken balls not explode after death? Not seeing the slightest hope, this was the unified thought within the hearts of the various warlords at the moment. They had absolutely no idea how to go about solving the disgusting point that the opposite side would also spray spikes after death. If we really have to continue like this, we're afraid that we won't even last five days. Guardian Battle Number 8 An officer let out such a loud curse. And listening to the other party's loud curses, Zhang Zuolin was silent for a few seconds and also shook his head. Three days, we can last up to three days, still counting this first night of today. The moment Zhang Zuolin's words came out, all of a sudden, everyone inside Station 8 was dumbfounded. It's not that bad, right? The officer at the front took a deep breath. Zhang Zuolin's voice was hoarse, if we fight to the death, the opposite side has the limitations of the number of demonic monsters to be dispatched for each round of attack as well as the number of attacks per round per day, and it is possible for us to last until the fifth day. But, is it true that everyone in this entire frontline battlefield will fight to the death? One sentence startled all. The Eighth Guardian Battle. Everyone's faces became even more ugly in this instant. Yes, the dead souls on the frontline battlefield at the moment were too much of a mixed bag. Among the various warlord forces, although there were indeed patriotic, as well as strong-willed people, but there are also a lot of eggheads, as well as people who only care about themselves at all times. It was similar to what Zhang Zuolin thought. After the first night of the first round of fighting, on the frontline battlefield, there are quite a few people who have started to abandon the battle, or hiding in the deepest layer, or wherever they go, anyway, not stay in front of the country. At the beginning of the war, the foreign enemy did not empty the various stations of Disya. Now during the rest period, some of the guardian stations in front of Dashya are instead becoming empty on their own. This time, I'm afraid it's really over. Upon seeing the inside of their own front line become like this. At the back, the people of Dishya all despaired. Originally, the appearance of the blood mouth demon monster had made everyone's survival impossible. Now the abandonment of some of the war defenders had added another layer of frost on top of the snow. Is Dishya playing a pantomime? I've never seen such a funny theater before. I take back my previous words, I left Dasha just because Dasha this country is too ugly, the people who scolded me to run out at first, now know whether my original choice was right or wrong? It turns out that 10 days of ease was exchanged for utter despair at a later stage, then this luck we really can't afford to enjoy, it's better to let Dasha, the blessed country, enjoy it. The external enemy is too strong, and there are internal problems, I'm afraid it's time for Dasha to consider incorporating into another country. When the scene on Dasha's side once again became extremely ugly. Presently, the subjects at the back of this country were also all starting to mock once again. Their mouths always became very fast. Previously, when there was no blame on the front line of Grand Xia, they were jealous of the jealous and ingratiating themselves with the ingratiating. Now that the truth had appeared, they all immediately turned into we knew it all along. Faced with such mockery, the people at the rear of the Grand Xia were all incomparably stifled and angry. However, after, in the online endless scolding back but also always still less. After all, De Xia's current situation was really precarious. In this last period of time, everyone obviously still want to live their real life well. Until, where's your prof? When, it's his turn to come forward, right, where's the man? Don't mess, I heard, their professor Win Lim's all broken hospitalized, have become a patient and still ask people to come forward ah, take them off to their Dasha again write articles ah, not to revive their Dasha Republican literati? 
I still want to see what the power of the war of literature. Ahem, this don't be embarrassed to black, although the power of literary war did not play a role for their dasha, but it did benefit the world, our Japanese country too literati resurrected, actually can use the pen to write words to decelerate the foreign enemy all, it's really quite good. Ha, huh, you guys invaded them in the first place, and now they actually chose one that can help you guys but can't help themselves, too funny, too funny. So what about Dicia's previous history of winning the world? Wasn't it said to restore the splendor of that time? Now that it's been destroyed it's safe to say that it's not lying, it just didn't last until then right? I must say, this is a genius idea. In the next moment, those people outside mocked and mocked, and eventually even mocked winning Sky's body. Bunch of F asterisk curs, I groove your moms, do you hear me? I groove your moms. The people at the back of Dasha, exploded. What a waste of time, too lazy to argue, living in the present at the last moment. All sorts of points seem to become meaningless in this instant. Last minute. They could tolerate others to scold them, but they could never tolerate others to scold winning Sky. As a result, the battle situation on the internet among the various countries' nets was reversed in two levels in just a blink of an eye. All in the dog barking what ah, give you these foreign devils' faces not it. Winning professor line is not good as you worthy of saying, a group of no asshole stuff, I directly to your whole family kicked into the latrine pit, take a plastic bag and then sent to the orphanage to go. Okay ah, uh, finished on finished, but you remember, we are finished in this ya, you will not be good, I curse your forefathers in the front line, the next every stick met the most horrible 10,000 races, all dead. Nowadays, all the various languages on the internet could already be directly translated by the AI. But even so, when the people of Dasha scolded back, many of them still directly used the exclusive language of the country they were going to scold the netizens in, focusing on single-handedly letting the other party receive the most affectionate scolding. And then, when Dasha's screen full of retorts appeared, no surprise. On the internet, the people of various other countries were also instantly dumbfounded. Although they had encountered quite a few of Dasha's powerful army of spammers before when they taunted Dasha, however, this was the first time they had seen such a horrifying picture. What the hell, was the entire population of Grand Sia on the line? And even if there were so many people that it was terrifying, how is it that there is one counting one, and all of them don't stop? 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 1 hour, 2 hours. Nima, one person on their side cursed. On the Dasha side, 100,000 people instantly set their targets on that one person and directly cursed that person 10 million times. No, your front line is in such a critical situation, the country is dying. In the case of not thinking about merging into another country, this time should not cherish the time reality to do more meaningful things? Prepare to prepare for the aftermath, in the last two days to eat more want to eat love to eat, and then in family lovers good talk, walk, remember the sweet past, this is not what you should do? Should do you paralyzed, I do not care about anything, the next day will live online. My wife and I are scolding you, scolding you is the ultimate memories of my wife and I. Eat want to eat, I eat your mom ah? Huh? You have scolded the professor one, I still eat your hemp stink batch? On this day, the frontline battlefield of Dasha lost. But the rear network of the battlefield is a direct win to complete. And the root of the matter, only because the foreign people mocked on the Ingtian also scolded over the head. The Dasha people, who have more than a billion people living directly in the country, where can the foreign netizens carry them? So, the dejected came to the woeful role, the last moment, the people of other countries can only leave a sentence, how much more, Udasha is also certainly finished. Then silently remembered in their hearts that mocking Dasha can be done but never mocking Wintian, and then they quickly and temporarily all begged for ugliness to run away. Good lord, was it this lively outside when I wasn't around? It was now 12 o'clock at night. And at this time, Winning Sky also happened to finish writing his new article. After coming out, when he saw that the people of Dasha had actually engaged in a century-long sparring match with foreign countries because of him. Shaking his head, Winning Sky's side also couldn't help but just burst out laughing. What a beautiful victory. And then, boarding his professor account, Winning Sky smiled and uploaded the article he had just written. Then since you all won the battle. Next. Naturally, my side has to accompany you all to win the battle as well. It's like drinking. Friends are dry, can you not come with one? So, Dasha front, it's reversal time. Now let's give the whole audience a beautiful. The Age of Awakening, who's the drug seeker? It's me, it's us. It's a dark night. But it was instantly brightened by a message. Professor Wynn has published another new article. The moment Winning Sky's latest article was sent out. The entire Grand Sia, the entire world was once again abuzz. Due to the previous injury. Not a single person in this world thought that Winning Sky would be able to issue another article recently. And yet, they didn't want to. It has only been 10 days since then and that new article on troop reinforcement has come again. In the central part, the old man's mind was heavy at the moment, still staring at the front line. In the next second, an officer came directly with the printed article. 
This is. The old man was slightly puzzled. The officer took a deep breath. Professor Wynn's latest article on troop augmentation. Little friend he started writing articles again? The old man's eyes instantly dilated. How long had it been? He was still far from fully recovered, right? His body trembled slightly as two emotions surged through the old man's heart. One was heartache and heartache. At this moment, he could clearly imagine winning Sky's tormented and agonizing, tortured appearance when he started writing again after recovering only a little. As for the other emotion, it was surprise as well as a loose heart after being saved in a critical moment. After all, the situation on the front line was really too bad right now, and someone was desperately needed to help. Thank you, thank you. The old man's eyes contained tears. With regards to this newly written article by Winning Sky, his attitude was complicated. He really didn't want Winning Sky to continue to subject himself to torture without recovering. But after the article appeared, it was also true that he couldn't refuse it and was fond of it. This was a treasure that could save the entire Desia, all of its people. So in the end, the old man could only be thankful, and there was nothing he could do but thank him. Professor Wynn got up to write a text? Kyoto, a small building in the center of the area. Zhang Hanan, who was frantically cursing the netizens of other countries, was shocked after seeing Winning Sky's new article. Obviously, she was also not expecting that Winning Sky, who was still laughing normally tonight and having a casual day with him over dinner, would be the one to suddenly come out with a new text right now. Is it because tonight, the storm has finally come over the front line? Zhang Hanan looked out the window, but does. Need to be so rushed? The front line just had a problem, and you immediately started writing a new text. Zhang Hanan was touched. His nose couldn't help but sour again, as the person who knew Winning Sky's current state the most. She knew best how heartbroken she should feel for Winning Sky at this moment, but, also just like the old man. For this new text that had been written by Winning Sky, Zhang Hanan simply couldn't refuse it either. Or rather, the emotions of everyone in the entire Dashia this evening towards this new text of Winning Sky were the same. Today's Great Sia Frontline really had already reached a point of extreme despair for everyone again, ah. Thank you, Professor Wynn, thank you. In such a situation, the only thing that everyone could do was perhaps all but to give an extremely sincere thank you to Winning Sky after their heartache, and then, slowly take over this new heartfelt endeavor of Winning Skies. The Age of Awakening, who is the one who seeks medicine? It's me, it's us. This was the title of the article that Winning Sky had once again augmented this night. It was different from before. The era that the article corresponded to this time was already the Republic of China. If Winning Sky's article was written, then it was natural for everyone to read it. Otherwise, if Winning Sky had already tired and suffered, and the historical figures in the article could not be revived in time due to the story not spreading out, wouldn't this be a direct waste of all that Winning Sky had done earlier? I just don't know what Professor Win wrote this time. For the first article on troop reinforcement written by Win Tian in the Republic of China, all the people in the rear of Dashia were very curious. Everyone was pondering. What would be the warriors that everyone had forgotten about that Winning Sky had restored this time? Is it some special lineage of warlords, or is it something else? Everyone had a guess in their hearts. But, after actually opening Winning Sky's new text afterwards, the entire Dashia, all the people in the rear still couldn't help but all be stunned. Literati, what prof? Win wants to restore this time as the literati of the Republic of China. Yes, Professor Win had previously chosen the power of literary warfare when he chose the best edition. He had also said that the stories of the literati during the Republican period of Dashia were actually as bright as the stars. Now then, it would be completely reasonable for him to write about literati. Belonging to our Dashia. The stories of the literati in the true sense of the Republican period? Staring at the screen, Zhang Hanan looked forward to the extreme. As a matter of fact, before Winning Sky had even made that speech about the literati, Zhang Hanan had appeared skeptical when examining history, thinking that the content of the literati during the Republican period of Dashia shouldn't be so thin. And the words that Winning Sky had uttered when choosing the power of addition had successfully confirmed her suspicions. Now, can we finally meet the real literati of the Republic of China period? What did they look like? What kind of novels did they write? And what kind of wonderful poems did they make? With her eyes wide open, Zhang Hanan took up a detailed reading of Winning Sky's new text with countless imaginations. And then, her heart suddenly stopped beating as if it was held by a hand. There wasn't any novel, nor was there any poetry. Works articles were there, but none of them existed as a single body. The literati of the Republican era that Winning Sky wrote about, even if there were works and articles, the main function of their content was for what they were trying to do, as well as the ideas they were trying to spread. Revolution? Literati? People who read books can be so shocking? When seeing the first half of Chen Zhengfu's life, the people of Dashia lamented its splendor. 
when they saw Chen Zhongfu come out of prison, meet another scholarly Shou Chang and communicate with him, and talk about the theory of ideological revolution, the people of Dasha were amazed and praised him. When they saw Chen Zhongfu return to China to found the youth magazine and give a sensational speech on the stage, the people of Dasha were filled with hot blood directly up and down their bodies. Later, when they saw Chen Zhongfu's friendship with Kai Yuanpei, the president of Peking University in the Republic of China, and Kai Yuanpei's three visits to his hut on a snowy day, sincerely inviting Chen Zhongfu to join Peking University and formally starting the new era, the people of Dasha all smiled because of the touching. This final awakening, in the final analysis, the awakening of man. Autonomous rather than slave, progressive rather than conservative, enterprising rather than retiring, worldly rather than lockout, real profit rather than imaginary literature, scientific rather than imaginary. The story of the literati of the Republican period turned out to be this ironic? They are also doing something, they are also saving the country, this. This is also a revolution. Ideological reform, democracy and science. Three visits, warm and gentle, Duke Kai and Mr. Zhangfu have embodied for us what it means to be courteous to the literati of Dasha, because of the critical situation at the front line. So the length of this first article of Winning Sky was not too long. Of the three main elements, the new culture movement, the May 4th movement and the founding of the party, only the new culture movement was eventually covered, and that too only at the beginning. Chen Zhangfu founded the youth magazine Mr. De and Mr. Sai, which was the first half of the new culture movement. The second half of the movement was the deeper advancement that Chen Zhongfu made with Li Dezhe, Lu Sun, and other scholars at Peking University after the president of Peking University, Kai Yuanpei, invited Chen Zhongfu to join Peking University. In this first article, Winning Sky only wrote that Peking University President Kai Yuanpei invited Chen Zhongfu to join the university, and the rest of the article has not been written yet. But, even so, but also has already let the people of the rear of the Dasha enough shock. Because Chen Zhongfu Li Dezhe Kai Yuanpei three people, is already let everyone successfully understand the Dasha Republican period of the real literati, with their wild guesses imagined completely different. Literati not just only hide in the house to write this, write that. In times of national crisis, literati can also become giants and save the country. Who is the man who seeks medicine? It's me, it's us. After reading this new historical restoration document of Winning Sky, the world then understood that there was such a specific group of people who were struggling hard for everyone's thoughts to move from feudalism to democratic science. What prof? Win is going to write this time seems to be a big story of continuity. Indeed, the end of the article states that Mr. Zhongfu went to Peking University, but there's obviously content behind it, and the ideological reform has just begun. In the past, it was one article about an army, now Professor Wynn is asking for countless stories to make up an era? Mr. Zhongfu was like this, I'm really curious about how the other literati of the Republican era were like. After reading all of what Winning Sky had written out this time, the people in the rear of Dasha were all curious to the extreme about what Winning Sky would write next. However, after all, this is a life-consuming thing to write, so it's definitely impossible to rush it or anything else, and even if they could get such a piece, everyone would already be moved to tears. So take back the mind, everyone is also the same words will be stuck here on the words did not continue. Then thank you for thank you, thank you after, then also all will be mind if put, reinforcement article present can lead to out of the next content. I. E. The specific recovery of the character that was restored. Kyoto, Ward. Inside the historical library in Winning Sky S Brain. A dozen or so Republic of China literati led by Chen Zhongfu stood out. Although Winning Sky's first article. The main writers were Chen Zhongfu Li Shouchang and Kai Yuanpei. However, other literati were also involved. For example, the comrades who founded the youth magazine together with Chen Zhongfu. They all appeared in the article. So, there were actually a dozen or so people who were able to recover this time. Then, everyone, will take our first step. At this moment, these dozen of literati. Together, they made a salute to the literati who had yet to be written by Winning Sky. And in the face of this scene, what about the other literati who had yet to be written? They also smiled at Chen Zhongfu and the others before waving their hands. Go on stage and perform well, then, wait for us. A gentle wind blew from outside the window, and bits of starlight scattered. One minute later, Winning Sky's hospital room was also filled with more dead souls straight away. Little friend, have you eaten yet? Chen Zhongfu loves to laugh. He always had a very optimistic look. What time is it? You can stop talking if you don't know how. To the side, Li Shouchan helplessly laughed alone. With that, he also looked directly at Winning Sky. Little friend, rest when it's time to rest. With the crisis at the front line, we should be able to help out for a while. Winning Sky nodded and said, Gentlemen, when you arrive at the front line, your main role will be to give the other warriors an increase. Chen Zhongfu grinned and said, We still know this, small arms and legs like us are not suitable to charge the front row to kill like the warriors are not? 
Little friend winning sky, what are you thinking, do you take us for fools? Being disliked by Qin Zhengfu like this, winning sky instantly didn't know what to say. And seeing this, in the next second, Kai Yuan Pei on the other side also hurriedly came out with a smile. Zheng Fu ah, little friend is caring about us, don't play with your mouth. What's wrong with my mouth? Chen Zheng Fu was a bit displeased. Li Shou Chang smiled, there's nothing wrong with your mouth, it's just that it's not very beautiful when you open it. You are the one who is not beautiful. Chen Zheng Fu anxious, open mouth and Li Shou Chang Kai Yuan Pei engaged in an argument. After that the other literary dead joined in, and it was a lively scene. Looking at such joyful forefathers, Winning Sky couldn't help but laugh along with them. Just like this, one minute, two minutes, three minutes. After three minutes, everyone withdrew their minds. We're leaving. Chen Zhangfu said seriously. Winning Sky froze. Extremely seriously, he made a bow to the deceased souls of the ancestors. And afterward, the deceased soul forefathers all returned a bow to Winning Sky with extreme seriousness as well. Safe journey. Right now, these literati forefathers were going to the front lines. The end would actually not be much better than the war world forefathers who had been revived out of the last stick. After all, the Republic of China's Daxiao itself wasn't much different from the war period. However, after thinking for a moment, Winning Sky ultimately wanted to give them a blessing. In the face of this blessing from Winning Sky, the forefathers smiled slightly. Immediately afterward, they all returned a blessing to Winning Sky as well. You must be safe as well. The front line was urgent at the moment after all. The next round of attacks from the 10,000 races was coming soon. So after the mutual blessings were finished, the crowd also directly stopped staying. As usual, when the forefathers traveled, the sound of sending off chimes was naturally rare. The entire depths of the great summer. The lights were lit up in every household, and people all came down to see each other off. At this time, the front line. The next round of invasion by the 10,000 races was already starting a three-minute countdown. In the face of the current bad situation where some of the warlords guarding the front of the station had actually run away, it was the same as the previous baton of resistance pioneers who had split their forces to help station 27. The remaining dead souls also chose to split their troops to reinforce the station. Among them, Marshal Zhang Zuolin sent the most troops, as much as his own guardian station. Now, the number of remaining fighters was almost looking pathetic. All of them have died once before, how dare they fear death again? Letting their juniors go and acting like a wild dog in front of them. I, Zheng Zuolin, am disgusted by such people. Now that the 10,000 clans are fighting in a hurry, I can't control what happens to those people. However, I, Feng Department, can never have such people. If I know that we have such a person in our Feng Huang Department, I, Zheng Zuolin, will personally chop off your heads one by one. In these last three minutes when a new round of attack from the 10,000 clans was about to come again, Zheng Zuolin chose to lecture his men. And listening to Zhang Zuolin's command, the undead soul warriors under his command all let out chants, claiming that their side would definitely not be like certain warlords and their subordinates, who would be disgraced in front of their descendants. Alright, all cheer up. In a moment, fight those sons of bitches properly. The cold wind cut through the trenches and shattered buildings. The night sky was filled with smoke and fog. Starlight was obscured. In the darkness, the soldiers nervously guarded their positions. Each of their figures looked extraordinarily thin and lonely but their faith was as firm as a rock. All the commands were finished. Zhang Zuolin's side was also quietly engaged in waiting. However, after this, the first thing he waited for was not the next round of attacks from the 10,000 races. Instead, it was a special greenish-blue light behind him, as well as a small old man wearing glasses who stepped out from the light. Marshal, long time no see. Upon seeing the visitor, Zhang Zuolin's entire body was stunned. Kai, you on pay? To be honest, as the head of the warlord, Zhang Zuolin, the relationship with the literati of the Republican era was very poor. Even Mr. Li Shouchang, who had died in its hands in the first place. You guys even came out. As well. Was it that kid called Winning Sky in the back who summoned you guys? Zhang Zuolin opened his mouth to inquire. While taking over the baton for the handover. Zhang Zuolin then knew all about what happened regarding Winning Sky. So at this moment, the first thing that came to his mind was Winning Sky. It's that kid. He woke us up to help you guys. Kai Yuan Pei opened his mouth and said, Broth Fu Shou Taste and the others have also woken up, and have now gone to the other guardian stations separately. All are unwilling to come to me? Zhang Zuolin grinned. Kai Yuan Lin replied, There is no need for the marshal to think nonsense, the past has already passed, now facing the 10,000 races, we are one family after the revival, it's just that they are more or less embarrassed if they meet with the marshal again at this moment, and it's true that the other stations, which are weaker at the moment, are also in greater need of them. I understand. Zhang Zuolin nodded, and then, suddenly thought of something else. He smiled and inquired, 
It is said that the kid in the rear chose the power of civil war in the best performance bonus of the last baton. I wonder what specifically you guys can play now that you have come to this frontline battlefield. Marshall call all the warriors together. Next I will show you what is called the power of literary warfare. Under Kai Yuanpei's invitation, all the undead warriors on Marshal Zhang's side were all gathered. That number, although it wasn't a thing in front of the 10,000 races, it was still quite grand if one looked at it alone like this. What exactly is the power of a literary battle like? At the same time, at the back of the Grand Sia, all the people were also staring intently at the live broadcast. Everyone was still very much looking forward to what the Republican era literati summoned by Winning Sky could do even stronger after obtaining the power of win battle. The literati revived on the side of the brats seemed to be able to take like shooting arrows to shoot out ink with damaging effects after obtaining the power of literary battle. There's also the article, which is said to be able to make the article strike at the 10,000 races like a sword chi. On the pretty nation side is modern poetry ah, which can slow down the enemy. It was because the power of literary warfare chosen by winning sky was a globally shared bonus. Therefore, even before the recovery of the literati on the Grand Sia side at this moment, some of the literati recovered from other countries were already displaying the power of literary warfare. Only, after their various displays, everyone was also discovering another novel point. That was that although all of them were the power of literary warfare, the effects of literary warfare displayed by different levels and types of literati from different countries would be very different. I hope that the literati forefathers on our side will receive a sizable literary battle bonus. At the back, the people of Disya were all hoping for this. At this time in Kyoto, Zhang Hanan had also already rushed to the ward again overnight. She was afraid that Win Tian would have some kind of damage after writing the text, but after arriving and seeing that Win Tian was fine, she let her heart down and was able to sit and watch the live broadcast from the front line with Win Tian. There's nothing to worry about. Winning Sky smiled at Zhang Hanan. Although the power of literary warfare selection down targeted the globe, there was no special commission for Disya. However, he was looking at it based on the degree of splendor of the literati themselves. These people from the Republican period of Dacia, their own degree of flamboyance does not need to be questioned. What's more, before this, winning heaven also happened to be lucky enough to have practiced the innocent invincible Harda. The dead souls that he had evoked driven by this thing were able to receive another small increase. Chen Zhongfu and the others were able to display their abilities after being enriched by the power of literary warfare. Winning Sky's sight had already seen it before. He had full confidence. It was believed that these people would be able to be of great use in the current frontline battlefields of the Grand Xia next. There are two main types of win battle power, offensive and defensive. And in each kind. In turn, they all display different effects depending on the various attributes of the literati. On the frontline battlefield, Guardian Battle Number 3, Chen Zhongfu stood there. At this time, the number 3 Guardian Station should be considered the weakest station in the frontline battle of Daxia. Therefore, at that moment, Chen Zhongfu, who was temporarily portrayed as the most powerful by winning Sky, also directly chose this place. We, the literati who engaged in ideological movements during the Republic of Daxia, all that can be done in the power of literary warfare is still rather special. Forget about the attack aspect, it's not necessary to use it, or it's not worth it. Next, what we mainly do, is also to work more on the defense aspect. Turning to the battle guard warriors in front of the third guardian battle, Brothchen stretched out his hand. Science and democracy are the two main driving forces for the progress of human society. The next second. The hundreds of undead soul warriors in front of him had an extra shield directly on their bodies. Feeling the extra shield on their bodies, these undead soul warriors were all dumbfounded. As for the people of Grand Xia who were watching the live broadcast at the back, their mouths were also wide open at once. Like this, after 5 or 6 seconds, 5 or 6 seconds, along with Chen Zhongfu's continued introduction, everyone finally understood what the literati of the Republic of Grand Xia could do on the frontline battlefields after obtaining the power of literary warfare. They could spread their thoughts, or some of the contents of their works, thus applying a shield called the Iron Wall of Thought to the dead soul warriors at the frontline. The specific defensive strength of the shield is based on the strength of the thoughts or works recited by the scribe, as well as the degree of reappearance of the scribe, the stronger the two, the stronger the shield's defensive strength will be. Will these shields be able to block the thorns shot out by those monsters on the opposite side? The 8th Guardian battle, Kaiyuan Pei had also made a demonstration at this point. Upon seeing the golden shields appear on his men's bodies, Zhang Zuolin could not help but be stunned. Great odds that it's feasible. Kaiyuan Pei nodded his head and smiled slightly. However, due to the fact that its exact level of defense depends on more things, that's why there will be some specific differences in each of the Guardian stations right now as well. Like on Braswu's side of the Guardian tasting them, the content of the thoughts transmitted is more powerful, and the shield value given to the warriors will be higher, and will probably be able to block all of the golden spikes from two monsters. 
As for Brothfu's side, the current level of reproduction is higher, so the iron wall of thoughts he grants to the warriors can even directly block all the golden thorns of three monsters. Kai Yuan Pei carried out an extremely detailed introduction. The most crucial point was the degree of reproduction. As a matter of fact, when the dozen or so literati from the civil period reappeared on the frontline battlefields of Dasha, everyone noticed this point. That is, unlike the other undead soul warriors, the revival of Chen Bofu's group was not a complete revival. There were still parts of their bodies that were illusory, and they would even flicker from time to time. And the reason why this was happening was something that everyone had analyzed in seven different ways. That was that Winning Sky's article this time was to write the stories of many people at once, and the length was fixed, with more people, each person was depicted less. So these people were said to be revived, but they were only revived a little bit, and could just reappear on the front line to play a slight role. If you want them to increase their power on the front line, then you have to completely replenish the extent of their rejuvenation, bit by bit, of their former stories. That is to say, the so-called reproduction degree was raised. So that's how it is. At the 8th Guardian Battle Point, Zhang Zuolin pondered. Immediately afterward, his face could no longer hide his joy. Because regardless of the degree, it was true that the undead warriors at the front line could withstand the attacks of the blood mouth demon monsters. Even the weakest iron wall of thought could allow the undead warriors to withstand a wave of attacks from the blood mouth demons. This allowed the warriors to greatly increase their chances of survival, and they didn't have to worry about killing the opposite side, and then the opposite side blowing itself up and shooting out gold spikes instead, pulling themselves down as well. We will keep adding thought iron walls to the warriors at the back. The warriors in the front can also come back to re-accept the shield if it breaks. Kaiyuan Pei gave another cry to Zhang Zuolin, a cry that truly made Zhang Zuolin even more delighted. The shield could be used up to continue the set, which was obviously much more useful. Granting shields, will there be any effects on yourselves? A few seconds later, Zhang Zuolin suddenly thought of something else. Kaiyuan Pei smiled faintly and said, it will drain your mind. This, Zhang Zuolin was a little unsure of what to say all of a sudden. Kaiyuan Pei stopped him and said, it's fine, it's just a little tired. And, even if it's really exhaustion to the point of vomiting blood and fainting, for the sake of our descendants, it's all worth it isn't it? After Kai Yuan Pei's words ended, Zhang Zuolin didn't make any pretense. He nodded seriously, then looked directly ahead. On the front line of Disya, the next round of attacks from the blood mouth demon monsters was already coming. This time, however, they were not going to be as wretched as before. Grand Marshal, those monsters are coming. After the last bit of time had passed, as expected, the message came. Marshal, I'm going to start working. Kai Yuan Pei stopped dawdling and hurriedly frantically applied his shield. And at the same time, Zheng Zuolin was also straight away ripping his voice out, sending out a shout across the room. Mother Fasteris Kerr. This time, we'll let the opposite side know how powerful we are. The great battle was on the verge of breaking out. After the arrival of the blood mouth demon monster, the undead soul warriors on the front line of Grand Xia all raised their guns in their hands, the same means of attack. But the difference was that this time, the dead soul warriors of the Grand Xia front line had an additional layer of shield called Iron Wall of Thought on their bodies. It's really defensible, these golden thorns can't get in. This little guy blew himself up again, but this time he won't be able to drag us to hell together. Groove, then what are we afraid of? Brothers, fight, hit the motherfucker hard. After starting the battle, the blood mouth demon monsters were still shooting out all kinds of golden spikes, but under the blockage of the iron wall of thought, their golden spikes were no longer able to injure the undead warriors on the front line of Great Xia. The ancestors are too strong, Professor Wynn is too strong, our Grand Xia is saved. At the back, after seeing this scene, all of the populace raised their fists in excitement. The suffocation of the first half of the night was released to the extreme at this moment. At this moment, they only wanted to make one comment. That is, winning Sky's power of win battle was really the right choice. Other than the power of literary battle, none of the other bonus powers were able to help Great Xia turn the tide against the wind in such a desperate situation. Professor Win is not only the savior of Dasha's backfield in terms of writing articles on troop reinforcement, but in terms of various decisions, it's also the savior of Dasha's backfield. On the side of Dasha, surprisingly, the disc has been revitalized. The power of win battle can still have such an effect, this is amazing. No, 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 the power of literary battle shows different effects functionally on different types of literati in each country, at this moment it should be even more praised that Dasha's luck is too good, the performance of the literati called out on literary battle even happens to be able to have such a strong defense effect. Is it really luck? How do I feel that this is the absolute confidence of that prof? Win of Dixia, he knows those forgotten literati of Dixia and knows that he can definitely play a big role after reviving these literati, that's why he firmly chose the power of literary warfare. Yes, even if what is manifested is not the thought shield from the literary war, 
who's to say if these literati of Dicia will show any stronger abilities on the front line, the rear of the other countries. After seeing that there were actually signs of a turnaround on Dicia's side, the people of the other countries were silent for a while, especially those who had mocked Grand Xia in Winning Sky. It was truly a race of embarrassment right now. Kyoto. Originally, the internet scolding war Dashia won over other countries. Zhang Hanan was already happy. Now the front line had actually started to reverse as well. Looking at the silence of the people of his country. At this moment, Zhang Hanan could not be more excited. I thought you were a lady before. On the hospital bed. Winning Sky cried and laughed as he looked at Zhang Hanan who was so excited that he wanted to dance. And by Winning Sky's point, Zhang Hanan realized that he had lost his temper. Ahem, it's just that I'm too happy to see the front line getting better. Taking back all the extra movements, Zhang Hanan blushed to the extreme and lowered his head. Winning Sky didn't say anything else, just smiled and continued to look at the frontline situation. After a period of fighting, finally, the rest period had arrived again. And this time, the rest period was a long rest period. Because today, the number of attack rounds of the 10,000 races had already reached the maximum limit. It would have to be a new day to launch another attack. A great victory, these monsters are no longer our match at all. After the battle was over, each guardian station took a little inventory. There were definitely still casualties, after all, the battlefield was too chaotic. There were always a lot of mishaps in the process of shattering shields and replacing them with new ones. However, compared to the very beginning when there were no shields, at the moment such a number of casualties, it really was all already negligible. These monsters, they are no longer a threat to us. At the front line, some undead soul warriors let out such cheers, feeling this joy on the field. The group of men of letters summoned by Winning Sky were all extremely happy as well. However, while happy they did not forget to think of danger in peace. Marshal, the 10,000 races aren't that simple. Perhaps the next truly hard battle is just about to begin. Guardian battle number 8, Kai Yuanpei looked to Zhang Zuolin. Zhang Zuolin nodded his head, I understand this, I will have everyone remain vigilant afterward, but right now, having just experienced a night of fighting, there's no harm in letting them rejoice for a bit first. The battle with the 10,000 races was really too tiring, and the tiredness here was not only for the body, but also for the spirit. The one night battle was over, and the next one was already tomorrow, so in the meantime, Zhang Zuolin felt that it was fine to let everyone be carefree and optimistic for a while. It should last for two or three more days. Kyoto, inside the ward. When the curtain fell on today's battle at the front line, Winning Sky also roughly estimated the rest period for himself. Of course, the estimation here didn't include the changes on the 10,000 races side. He was just saying that if the 10,000 races remained like today, the first batch of the men of letters that he had summoned, with the current level of reappearance, the mind that they possessed would be able to support them on the battlefield for a few days. Just like how winning Sky's writing consumed his mind to recover. These men of letters also consumed their minds to recover from applying shields to the warriors on the battlefield. And that small half day of rest after the battle every day was definitely not enough. And so the time they had to exert their literary power was also definitely limited. Under such circumstances, winning Sky's side would naturally have to make another effort. Refining the personal stories of these literati that had already been evoked, pulling up the degree of their reappearance at the same time. It would also complete the cultural history of the Republic of China period of Dasha again, and awaken some more other literati to go to the front line to help out or carry out shifts. Professor Wen, in two or three days, are you going to write a new text again? Zhang Hanan understood what Winning Sky meant. Winning Sky nodded and said, unsurprisingly, it should be. But your body. Zhang Hanan was heartbroken. Obviously the injuries sustained last time had not yet recovered, but now it was just to add new injuries to the list. Speaking of which, this new article today was already causing Winning Sky to suffer more injuries, right? If only we could help you. Zhang Hanan said guiltily, it's obviously a battle for all of Grand Xia, but in the entire backfield, it's only you who's been laboring, and we're just like a bunch of losers. From the beginning of the invasion of the 10,000 races, everyone in the backfield of the Grand Xia had begun to constantly blame themselves. They felt that they had no role at all and living had all been almost as good as dying. You guys have already helped me ah. Uh. Winning Sky smiled faintly, preparing the best hospital for me and performing medical treatment every day. And then if you, you've been cooking for me every day, making delicious meals. What kind of help is this? Zhang Hanan whispered. Winning Sky spoke very seriously, I was at home by myself before but I could only eat some instant food every day, is this not considered a favor? Zhang Hanan lowered his head and stopped talking. Just like this, the ward was quiet. There was not a single sound. Yet, there wasn't a bit of awkwardness either. About a minute passed, and after a minute Zhang Hanan raised his head again. Professor Wen, I will definitely study my cooking skills more attentively in the future, so that you can eat even better meals. Amused by Zhang Hanan's serious look, 
Winning Sky also nodded seriously, then, how about having cilantro fried shredded pork tomorrow? Zhang Hanan nodded, but soon was shaking his head again, cilantro. Fried shredded pork? How can something as unpalatable as cilantro still be used to stir fry shredded pork? Zhang Hanan was shocked. And facing this shock from her, Winning Sky was also silent. All right, you can go now. In the next second, Winning Sky directly waved his hand. And so Zhang Hanan was simply driven out like this. Walking out of the ward, Zhang Hanan realized that he had said the wrong thing. It was clearly cooking for Win Tian. Why don't you just cook whatever Win Tian wants to eat? How could he directly criticize what the other party wanted to eat? Zhang Hanan, you're really a big dummy. Zhang Hanan spoke in a chagrined voice. And just at the moment she opened her mouth. Beside her, or rather, at the entrance of Winning Sky's hospital room, a man in military uniform also spoke out in a ghostly voice right away. Don't understand the deliciousness of cilantro, bad review. The man's name was Zhu Chengen. He was sent by the state to protect Winning Sky closely. He and his several hundred men were stationed at the hospital. However, Zhu Chengen generally didn't speak. It had been so many days. This is the first time Zhang Hanan has heard him speak. Only the first time he spoke was to stab Zhang Hanan's heart again. All right, I know. Puffing up his mouth, in the end, Zhang Hanan walked away in annoyance. As for the ward, Winning Sky heard the commotion outside and couldn't help but smile. In fact, he wasn't driving Zhang Hanan away because of this, but it was really late now, and Zhang Hanan's spirit had also been strained today, and at this moment, having won the battle with great difficulty, it was indeed time for her side to go back and have a good night's sleep. Moreover, Winning Sky's side next is also really have to receive medical treatment again. Professor Win, is it okay now? Outside the ward, a group of doctors were already ready. As a matter of fact, they had all come when Win Tian had just finished writing his first text. It was only because Win Tian insisted that he wanted to finish watching the battle at the front line that they hadn't been able to come in. It's ready. Winning Sky spoke to his attending doctor, that's right, remember to call the group of old men outside for me, tell them that there's nothing serious about me, and let them sleep in peace. The doctor understood that the old masters in Winning Sky's words were the top management of Disya. After Winning Tian's new article came out, the old men called and claimed that they wanted to come over. However, afterward, they were rejected by Winning Sky. However, Winning Sky knew that even if they didn't come, they must be concerned about this side. So at this moment, he also added this sentence so that everyone could have a good night's sleep tonight. Okay, prof. Win. Time passed quickly. In the blink of an eye, it was a new day. The next morning, the first rays of sunlight passed through the windows, illuminating every corner of the ward. The air was filled with a faint mixture of sterilized water and floral scent, making people feel serene and peaceful. Early in the morning, the old man and some of Dasha's senior management then came. They consoled Winning Sky for a long time. And Winning Sky also repeated to them that he was fine for another long time. After they left, it was also time for Zhang Hanan to arrive again. Just, upon seeing Zhang Hanan arriving with a large black eye and a serving of cilantro fried shredded pork, Winning Sky's side could not help but be silent once again. The horse passed between the windows, and soon, it was another two days. During these two days, the front line of Dasha was as usual. The blood mouth demon monsters did not make any new movements. They still just followed the previous pattern to attack. And after having literati who could release an iron wall of thoughts. Against this level of invasion, Dasya was already handy. After the fight, we managed to hold another day. It was different from the night raid on the first day. For the two days afterward, the blood mouth demon monsters shifted to daytime attacks. After the several rounds of attacks within the restriction were carried out, the one day invasion came to an end. It has successfully defended for 16 days. In theory, with most of the time of holding out having passed, and having successfully held out for the next day today, both the front line and the rear should be happy. But after the end of this day's battle, whether it is the front line or the rear, all of the people in Dasha are all worried. And the reason, finally summarized in fact only two points. One point is that although with the help of the iron wall of thought, but fight the battle to casualties cannot be no. So the process of resisting the defense of the war. Therefore, in the process of resisting the defensive battle, the number of dead soul warriors on the front line of the great summer was still decreasing. And the other point that was the key to everyone gradually becoming anxious again was that the many literati on the current front line of the Grand Sia, after these three days of fighting, were all really a bit unable to carry on. After all, their number is still small, and the frontline dead soul warriors need the iron wall of thought and too much. After spending a great deal of energy and effort to support a day's battle, the next day's battle would come again before they could recover. Not to mention the literati likely Shouchang and Chen Xiao, who had a high degree of reappearance, they even had to take care of two iron walls of thought for guarding the battle. Mr. Zhongfu, are you alright? Guardian battle number three. An undead soul warrior inquired to Chen Zhongfu. 
At this moment, Chen Zhengfu's face was already very pale. He forced a smile on his face and pretended to speak as easily as usual. It's fine, this is just where it's at. I just suddenly have some stomach pains. Hey, this has become a resurrection body that doesn't need to eat. How can I still have the feeling of eating a bad tummy? It's 80% that the last meal before I died in my last life wasn't quite right. No matter what the situation was, Chen Zhangfu liked to joke around a bit. But at this time, his jokes were heard in such a way that everyone did not want to laugh at all. Instead, they were all sour and bitter to the core. As far as his current appearance is concerned, where is he eating a bad stomach ah? Today, the last round of the devil's attack is the last round of the devil's attack. It's time to impose an iron wall of thought for the warriors. Anyone with a discerning eye can see how much pain it is suffering all over its body. Excessive consumption of the mind, the mind is consumed, the consumption is also the body. It's fine, it'll hold up, it can last another three days. Chen Zhangfu looked up at the sky as he said this. And besides his side, the other various guardian stations were basically the same at the moment. Obviously, every single civilian couldn't hold on much longer, but they were all still clenching their teeth and saying, it's alright, it'll hold on, it'll hold on for another three days. Kyoto, inside the ward. Seeing this scene, how could Winning Sky not be clear about who they were saying this to? They were clearly joining together to convey the content to Winning Sky, telling Winning Sky, we can't use you right now, we can, you can rest and rest again. What bravado! Winning Sky shook his head and smiled. And then, accompanied by a gentle push of the door, Zheng Hanan, who had brought the meal, also arrived again. After staying up all night the day before to study the cilantro fried shredded pork to the ward, but instead being scolded by Winning Sky, Zheng Hanan no longer dared to stay up all night. After not staying up all night, his spirit would naturally become better, so now Zhang Hanan was looking good again, prof. Win, let's eat. After two days of re-research, Zhang Hanan's current cilantro fried shredded pork was already extremely delicious. On top of that, she also made cucumber fried pork slices, tomato scrambled eggs, special mushrooms and fish soup today. This fish soup is really good today. At the dinner table, Winning Sky gave special praise to the fish soup made by Zhang Hanan. And after his praise, Zhu Chengen who was on the side of the table also gave a thumbs up right in a sly manner. Eating alone was really too boring. Therefore, Winning Sky made his small dining table a little more crowded. Zhang Hanan as the chef definitely had to be pulled in for a piece of dinner. In addition to this, the person that Winning Sky's dining hall pulled in again was the bodyguard Zhu Chengen who had been standing in front of the ward's door. Zhu Chengen is a very interesting person. The four words of iron-blooded soldier in his body got the most perfect performance. He was always neat and tidy, did not smile, and did not say a word on weekdays. But, from time to time, this person would suddenly contrast. After getting along with him, Winning Sky's evaluation was just one sentence, that is, this man either didn't speak, but if he did, he would definitely be very showy. The meal was eaten in a joyful atmosphere. After finishing the meal, Zhu Chengen then guarded the door again. Then, Prof. Win, I'll be leaving first. As for Zhang Hanan, he was also about to leave as usual. Stay today, I need you on my side. Only, unlike in the past, Winning Sky called out to her today. Ah, Professor Win, what's wrong? Zhang Hanan was puzzled. To be precise, even though she had already guessed some of the contents within her heart, she wanted to pretend that she did not understand. The situation at the front line is already a bit bad again, I need to write another new article on troop reinforcement. Winning Sky spoke seriously. But my hands are not so good at keyboarding anymore, so I need your help. As I said before, if Winning Sky's side opened his mouth and someone else helped with the keyboard, it would only be Winning Sky who would consume his mind. So at this moment, if he sought Zhang Hanan's help, Winning Sky didn't need to worry that Zhang Hanan would be affected by it. Professor Win, why don't we write it tomorrow? Zhang Hanan spoke in a very low voice. After her words were finished, Winning Sky directly frowned. Is this kind of important matter something that can be messed up by nature? Of course, Winning Sky knew that Zhang Hanan's words, write it tomorrow, was not because she personally did not want to write it today. Rather, it was because she didn't want to see Winning Sky suffer, and wanted to delay as much time as possible, so that Winning Sky could rest again. But even so, it's not possible to do so now. Winning Tian's troop reinforcement article now involves the entire De Xia, so even if he has to face the pain, he must move forward. Hanan, I know that you, all of you, all of us in De Xia are heartbroken for me. But this heartache of yours is something that can never serve as an existence to stop me. I want to save Dasha, this is my decision, I write to suffer pain, this is also my choice. You guys don't need to feel guilty because of this, much less yank me and stop me because of it. Being admonished by winning Sky's words, Zhang Hanan's head tightly lowered. And then, after roughly another 5 or 6 seconds, only then did winning Sky's tone moderate. Hanan, the gentlemen at the front line are already holding on strong. The greater the ability, the greater the responsibility. There were some things that Winning Sky had to do. He had already seen that the frontline gentlemen were holding up strongly. 
Then next, naturally, he had to stand up as well. This is his choice. A gentle wind blew outside the window. It also blew down the tears in the girl's eyes. I understand, Professor Win. At Win Tian's request, Zhang Hanan ended up sitting in front of the computer. Take it easy. After resting for a few more days, I've recovered a lot. As usual, Winning Sky revealed a warm smile. Only this time, his smile did not make Zhang Hanan become relaxed. This was because it could clearly sense that Winning Sky's true state at this moment was not good. He hadn't recovered at all, the injuries from his last strike had made his entire person almost wasted, and the new text from a few days ago had added a few more weights to his injuries. Even with the best medical team and all of Dasha to help heal him, a few days of rest was still too little. Write the title, this time the name of our article is. The Age of Awakening, There is No Road in the World, But the More People Who Walk It, The More It Becomes a Road. Much like what Zhang Hanan thought, Winning Sky's state at this moment was indeed still in a bad state. Injuries are compounded by injuries, and a few days ago, a stronger new text did bring him back to his worst state. On that day, the doctor's evaluation to Winning Sky after treatment was, the reburdening from writing the last article before resting enough has made all your previous rests useless, Professor Win. In other words, as far as the last text was written, Win Tian was not far from his newly hospitalized state even if he had not directly returned to it. How could the recovery be so slow? Winning Sky was exasperated to no end in his heart, and he secretly hated himself for not having a superhuman body. It was said that it would be useful in this bat as well. However, he had just finished writing his first new text a few days ago, and then he also returned to his wasteful state. Rest a few days to start writing the second article again, hands are still paralyzed, cannot hit the keyboard even so. At this moment, he had just read out a title, and his heart was in severe pain to the point that he almost fainted. At the invitation of Peking University's president Kai Yuanpei, Chen Zhangfu came to Peking University with his youth magazine and later succeeded in taking up the position, president of arts and sciences. But the good news was that such torturous moments Winning Sky had already experienced many times, so he was already drilling out ways to specifically face this situation. Deep breaths, constant deep breaths, and a deadly pinch on his arm when he really couldn't carry on. After becoming the president of arts and sciences, Chen Zhongfu realized that the current Peking University was divided into the old and new factions, that is, the conservative faction and the innovation faction. With the help of the old ways, Winning Sky was in a slightly better state, and taking advantage of this short-lived good state. Next, Winning Sky also directly threw himself completely into this new article. Picking up where the last one left off, the content written in this new article was also the follow-up of the new culture movement of the literati during the Republic of China. After founding the youth magazine, Chen Zhongfu came to Peking University to start the new culture movement. Afterwards, together with the reformist literati of Peking University, Chen formally pushed the new culture movement as the highest tide of that era. He advocated democratic science against authoritarianism, ignorance, and superstition. It advocated new morality against old morality. Advocating new literature against old literature. The vernacular language was thoroughly promoted and became the theme of Dasha. In this movement, Chen Zhangfu, Li Shouchang and Hu Shirji, Chen Shenton, Lu Banong and countless other friends, together staged a good show of innovation against the old culture. It's really, really wonderful. As Winning Sky narrated, Zhang Hanan recorded. As he heard every classic moment of Chen Zhongfu and the others in the new culture movement, Zhang Hanan couldn't help but get into it and was thrilled beyond himself. It's wonderful, but it's not just these innovators that are wonderful. Winning Sky smiled faintly and then continued the narration. However, in the subsequent narration, Winning Sky placed the theme on the old faction of Peking University, that is, the conservative literati. The old faction of Peking University was dominated by the literati Ku Hongming, and in the above story about the innovation of Chen Zhongfu and the others, these old factions led by Ku Hongming were like villains. They insisted on themselves and opposed outsiders, like old-fashioned people who closed the country to the outside world. However, it was this group of old-fashioned people, in the period called the Republic of China in Dashia, but also has their own style. They may be stubborn, but every one of them is truly patriotic and seeks a way to save the country. In the new culture movement, the new school and the old school were just different schools of thought, and it was an academic struggle. They each had their own mistakes. For example, even the new school had the radicalism of rejecting all the old things of Dashia. And then, they each had their own unique right. For example, Ku Hungming and others, although stubborn, but also has Dasha people should have Dasha people's self-confidence. Dasha culture may not be all bad. These are correct points of view. Finally, Ku Hongming this keep whip old stubborn in his speech on the speech is to make the whole Dasha are alarmed deaf. My braid is tangible, on the head, your braid is intangible, hidden in the heart. Don't ever think that just because we've cut off our hair, put on a suit, and have a mouth full of English, the foreigners will think highly of us. On the contrary, when a Chinese westernizes into a foreigner, it will arouse precisely their contempt. 
Only when they see that we, the Chinese, have their distinctive civilization and spirit, will they have true respect for us in their hearts. I was born in the South Seas, studied in the West Seas, married in the East Seas, and served in the North Seas, but I am a proper Chinese. What is a true Chinese? A true Chinese is one who has the heart of a child and the mind of an adult, who lives a spiritual life. I, Ku Hung Ming, will devote my life to promoting and spreading this great spirit, though I die nine deaths without regret. During the Republican period, all the literati had their own individual styles, and Winning Sky was responsible for telling them all once again. This is the new culture movement of the Republican period of Ardashia. After the new piece of writing was finished, Winning Sky already had no more strength in his body. Too brilliant. And after tapping the last word on the computer, Zhang Hanan's side was already completely stunned. Actually, in this movement, there was an even more brilliant role of the literati. On the side of the innovation faction of the new culture movement, that one is called the strongest sharp sword. A faint smile spread across the corners of Winning Sky's mouth. This literati he was talking about at the moment was named Lu Sun. Only the content of Lu Sun's story was just too much. And to write about him, then it would definitely be necessary to directly recreate his diary of a madman as well. Winning Sky was afraid that he would not be able to stick to that much content at the moment, so for the time being, he also put him to the side first. Zhang Hanan had also guessed what Winning Tian was thinking. Zhang Hanan was naturally very interested in this sharp sword. However, at this moment, she obviously cared more about Winning Sky's body. Professor Win, I'll go call a doctor for you. Zhang Hanan said worriedly. Winning Sky smiled, there's no need to shout, they're already guarding outside. Winning Sky now only had to start writing an essay as soon as he started. The entire hospital as well as the upper echelons of Dasha would get the news directly. Therefore, outside, the doctors as well as the Dasha's senior management had already arrived. Even the old man from Dasha had been waiting outside for a long time. Use my account and send out this new article. Winning Sky gave a final command. With that, he was also taken away by the doctors. And after he left, the old man, as well as the Dasha executives, also entered the room. Everyone, want to take a look at Professor Wynn's new article first? Zhang Hanan was a bit formal in the face of the Dasha executives. The old man shook his head, didn't young friend Winning Sky say that he would let you send out the article, so just send it out directly, and we'll read it ourselves on the internet afterward. Zhang Hanan nodded, then, using Winning Sky's account, Zhang Hanan quickly also sent out this new article that had just come out. Professor Wynn has come out with another new article, a follow-up to the new culture movement. Hu Shirji, the vernacular language. Elder Ku Hongming is also a magnificent man. After the article was sent out, it was instantly picked up by the people in the rear of Dasha as well. One by one, everyone clicked on the article to read Winning Sky's retelling of past history. And then, after reading it, one by one, they also couldn't help but all let out a gasp. This time, there are a lot of literati that can be conjured up. Inside the ward, light emitted from the old man's eyes. This article of Winning Sky's this time, the main point was that there were many people in one hand. All of these people reviving out was definitely able to make the front line easier all of a sudden. Letting little friends suffer again. A wave of literati that could be revived to head to the front line was definitely an excellent piece of news. However, the higher the degree of good news like this was, the more effort Winning Sky had expended in writing this piece of literature. Therefore, after the surprise, the old man looked towards the ward exit, but also couldn't help but feel heartbroken again. If we could contribute a little, little friend wouldn't have to work so hard. The old man sighed. Listening to the old man's words, Zhang Hanan's heart was also flooded with bitterness right afterward. Perhaps all the people in the entire rear of the Grand Xia right now were in the same mood at this moment. Alright, go out and send off the ancestors. There was no way, or rather no ability, to stay on the point of helping winning heaven for too long. In the end, the old man could only return to reality and continue doing the only thing they could do. After reading Winning Sky's article, the ancestors in Winning Sky's article were allowed to complete the last step of recovery. And then, the lights were lit up in the homes, and people came downstairs to see off the new batch of ancestors. Still want to say something to that kid, now it seems there's no chance. Kyoto, inside the hospital room, the gentleman in Winning Sky's new text appeared one by one. There was no one in Winning Sky's room now. Of course, even if there were people, those people were absolutely unable to see them here. After all, all of the deceased soul forefathers had gone to the front line before they were revived to gain a true entity. That child simply hasn't rested enough, the old injury wasn't cured before he wrote down two more texts in a row, and this time, he also wrote so many of our literati at once, something will happen if we don't save them quickly. In the past, the revived ancestors would come to find Winning Sky for some goodbyes, and this time, the literati who were revived by them were naturally no exception. Only, at this time, when they appeared, Winning Sky was already being pulled to the operating room for treatment. Forget it, when we get to the battlefield, we'll do a good job, and use the victories we won to send them back as a goodbye. 
In the end, Winning Skies revived Literati this time also traveled to the front line amidst the sound of Dasha's send-off chirps. On the front line battlefield, upon seeing countless new rays of light lit up, countless new Literati appeared from the rays. All of the undead soul warriors, all of them couldn't help but get excited, another new gentleman has been called out. Did Winning Sky write another new article? As for the Literati, each and every one of them had a bitter smile on their faces. Obviously, they had all joined together and said that they could still hold out for several more days. As a result, it turned out that Winning Sky still wrote a new article to support the front line of Grand Sia today. That kid saw how strongly we're holding up. But how is he not holding up strongly himself? What a disobedient brat. With this newly conjured multitude of Republic of China era literati from Winning Sky, the literati at the various guarding stations on the Dasha front line were suddenly not in short supply. Previously, Chen Zhongfu and Li Shouchang even had to guard two guardian battles each. Now that he was only guarding one guardian station, he was actually able to have an extra helper next to him. Moreover, my own power has strengthened a lot more. In Winning Sky's new article, the story of Chen Zhengfu, Li Shoshang, Kai Yuanpei, and the other first literati that appeared in the story was improved in some new ways. The more the stories were perfected and recreated, the higher the power of these literati naturally became. Even as their power increased, the mind and spirit they had previously consumed also recovered greatly. Seven days, we should be able to defend for another seven days. The overall strength of the literati at the front line was inventoried and counted. In the end, the group of literati pioneers led by Qin Zhengfu came to this conclusion. Currently, the second stick of Disya had already finished its 16th day of defense. If it was guarded for another 7 days, it would be able to successfully guard the 23rd day and go forward to the 24th day. It only held strong for a little while this time. That kid just wrote a second text to support it. We can definitely stop him in the next wave. Really? If he can hold out strong we can't right? With these people, we must at least, least hold out for 3 more days, to the 27th day. At this time, the literati were in different guardian battles, but linked hand in hand to directly set the same flag. While Winning Sky was worrying about them, they were all worrying about Winning Sky as well. On the front line and in the backfield, everyone wanted to exchange their own strong support for the other's lack of strong support. Everyone wanted to let the other party have a good rest and then take all the pain in suffering themselves. This really stinks. The literati were laughing to themselves. And after laughing, the actual action began. The next day, early. The invasion on the side of the 10,000 races then also began again. Mountains and seas of bloodmouthed demonic monsters once again frantically surged in. In the face of these monsters, the undead warriors, who had already been given the iron wall of thought in advance, directly raised the weapons in their hands. Today, let's have a great victory. It's going to be more exciting than ever. The 8th Guardian Battle. Elder Ku Hongming was placed here. After the bloodmouth demon monster's new day of invasion began, he looked at Sai Yuanpei beside him. And Kai Yuanpei? After a slight glance, he also revealed a smile. What Tang Shang wishes, we will strive for it. Ku shook his head. It is not my wish. Rather, it is the wish of all of Yenhua. Saying that, Ku Hongming cocked his head to the sky. Today's great Xia. It's time for a complete victory. And we left without seeing the boy. And so, then the words to use a victory as a farewell were put down. Hearing Ku's words, Kai Yuan Pei also smiled again. In that case, we have to repay him with a big victory as well. The sun slowly rose. Golden rays of light spilled onto the battlefield, illuminating the faces of the warriors. Today, let's have a great victory. Be more exciting than ever like that. In the next second, Ku Hong Ming used all of his strength to let out a shout. This shout directly broke through space and spread to all the guardian battles on the front line. Tang Shang is really old and strong. Chen Zhengfu grinned. Xian Xiantong held up his glasses, so how can we be weaker than him? Comrades! Li Shouchang followed with a chant, I'll raise your heads. The wind whistled and swept up countless dust as it wandered across the battlefield, blowing across the warrior's armor as if it was the caress of the god of war, causing everyone's wariness to be instantly high. Today, let's have a great victory. Be more wonderful than ever like that. And then after that, throughout the entire Great Xia front line, all of the literati guarding the battle carried on shouting like this. The bloodmouth demon monster came, and the undead soul warriors under the major warlords, at this moment, all stepped onto the battlefield. Their footsteps were firm and powerful, as if every step was a step towards victory. Their muscles were tense, and every cell was filled with fighting spirit and strength. Victory! Win the battle! Win the battle! On the battlefield, first a warrior let out a chant. Immediately after, all the warriors began to shout out slogans. Their voices merged into a powerful force. This was their battle cry. Then, the battle flag waved. On the frontline battlefield, the warriors all charged forward. Their steps were firm and powerful, as if they wanted to trample the earth to pieces. 
their eyes were burning with fire. It was hot blood, it was conviction, and it was their desire for victory. Kill. Facing the attacking 10,000 races, on the front line of Great Xia, the first thing to shoot out was not a cannon or a bullet, but a red-tasseled spear. This red-tasseled spear carried the chi that the wind and splendor of the deceased warriors on the front line had transformed into, tearing through everything, like a shooting star that broke free, and like a silver-red dragon that tumbled and pranced. Its body shone with electricity, like it was attached to the wrath of the heavenly gods, illuminating the surrounding clouds. Those clouds flickered with purple light as if they were ignited under the lightning from the gun's body. Boom! In the end, that lance accurately pierced the body of a bloodmouthed demonic monster covered in golden thorns and directly penetrated it, then the second, the third, and the fourth. Bang bang bang! The bloodmouthed demon monsters that were pierced exploded at the same time, turning into blood mist while spewing out all of the golden thorns they were carrying. These monsters wanted to use these golden thorns to pull the warriors on the front line of Grand Xia to hell in one piece. But unfortunately, none of the current Dis Xia warriors would even be afraid of these golden thorns anymore. Labor has said it, labor has said it many times. No matter who it is, they can't fucking infringe on this piece of land underneath the feet of labor. Countless golden shields lit up on the bodies of the frontline warriors of Grand Xia. It was the iron wall of thought and the most resolute will on their bodies. Die. Gunfire, shouts, explosions, and the sound of shields being added on again. The Dasha frontline, which had already been replenished, played a symphony called Great Victory today. Looking at this kind of battle, at the back, all the people of Disya couldn't help but start trembling, and even, some people couldn't help but cry out. 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, the battle ended. The battlefield full of blood. An undead soul warrior picked up the large flag on the ground. His arms were firm and strong. A gust of wind blew past, and that big flag directly fluttered up recklessly. We are victorious. Although all of the previous days had also repelled the blood-mouthed demon monsters. However, they had never been killed as painfully and sharply as today. The Great Xia Frontline had always been holding on, but it had always been just holding on. A truly great victory like today's was the first time it had ever occurred. What does this mean? Means to give confidence to the people at the back, telling them that they don't have to be afraid? Or did it mean to tell themselves that they could always hold on next? Or maybe it was to let Winning Sky know that his dedication was really useful? Perhaps, nothing means anything. But, who said that doing something had to have a specific role to do it? Been pressed for a long time, suffocated to the point of no return, stand up, that's all. We are victorious. In the next second, the front line of Dasha, the rear, all places, all resounded with cheers. And in the face of such a victory for Grand Xia, the people at the rear of the rest of the world were also even more silent all of a sudden. This answer sheet we handed in, I wonder if that kid can be satisfied. At the front line, Guardian Station Number 8, a smile spread across the corners of Elder Ku Hongming's mouth as he raised his head to look at the sky. But unfortunately, at this time, Winning Sky was unable to look at each other again at the same time in different spaces with them, the seniors of the front line, like before. In Kyoto, inside the operating room, Winning Sky was still receiving treatment. The entire night had passed, and Winning Sky had yet to come out. He was really a bit too severely injured this time. It originally injured the origin. Before he could recover even a tenth of it, he was injured twice more in a row. Professor Wynn's current state is too bad. He definitely can't write another new article until he recovers at least half of it. If this injury on top of injury happens again within a few more days, Professor Wynn, he might die. Half an hour later, the still unconscious Wynn Tian was pushed back into the ward. Toward the Dasha congregation of executives who were still in the ward, the doctor uttered these words. Hearing these words from the doctor, the old man fell into silence. And then, a full minute passed. Only then did the old man shuddered and uttered, I know. Although Winning Sky always pretended to be fine, but his body couldn't fool anyone. The injuries sustained during the last baton were simply too heavy. It was so heavy that he simply couldn't exert too much force in this baton. This was something that everyone knew from the beginning. It was just that after that, Winning Sky tried to show off twice. It gave people an illusion. Thinking that he really could still be like this. Keep repeating, keep going on and on. But the truth is, when he wrote the first text, he was already out of it. He knew it himself, but he chose to be brave. Inside the hospital room, the old man stayed for a long time with the top brass of Dasha. It wasn't until the afternoon that they got up and left. And at this time, Winning Sky was still not waking up. I'll stay a bit longer, maybe Professor Win will wake up in a while. I even brought him some rice, I'm going to heat it up for him when he wakes up. In the end, only Zhang Hanan was left in the room. She just kept waiting quietly like that until she was so sleepy that she fell asleep against the wall. Little Wintian, you're stupid, you're stupid. How was the situation outside? Winning Sky wasn't out clear. 
He was only clear that he had been walking in the darkness for a long time. At the end of the darkness was a small garden that possessed a small pavilion. And after that, he met the little girl he met in his last coma dream again. Why did you call me stupid? Also, who the hell are you? And what did you mean last time when you said you were dying? In just an instant, Winning Sky realized that he was in a dream world at the moment. All things in dreams were illusory, and Winning Sky was clear about this. However, for the little girl in front of him, Winning Sky couldn't help but be curious. Little Winning Sky, don't always think about getting that sword, you can't hold it. The girl did not answer Winning Sky's question, but instead uttered another inexplicable sentence. By the way, someone is waiting for you oh, we have to hurry over law. Immediately after that, without waiting for Winning Sky to respond, she directly dragged Winning Sky to the pavilion. The pavilion was just a very ordinary pavilion, but there was a woman sitting in the pavilion. That woman clearly looked to be only in her thirties. However, it was giving Winning Sky the feeling that it had already lived for several thousand years. Sure enough, your hair still needs to be black to look good. The woman smiled warmly. She called Winning Sky to her, then touched Winning Sky's head. It felt as if she was the mom and Winning Sky was her child. What am I doing ah? Uh? Winning Sky could clearly feel the strangeness of the image, but he just couldn't control his body, or even his consciousness. Little Winning Sky, you've already done a good job. Don't always be alone, let everyone help you next. The woman picked up a pastry from the table and handed it to Winning Sky. Winning Sky ate the pastry and only felt his body become lighter. So you're leaving? The little girl looked at the woman. The woman nodded, I have to do something sometime. With that, the woman looked to the sky, everyone's trying, whether it's those children from the past, or the little Winning Sky. But you're hurt too, and even if you hitch up what's left of your soul, you won't be able to do much. The little girl was clearly a child, but instead she was somewhat of an adult. The woman wasn't angry either, she smiled and finally spoke gently, maybe, but at least, I can make little Wintion less lonely. What the hell are you guys talking about? Winning Sky couldn't understand the conversation between the two. He only knew that in the end, the woman looked at herself. Don't worry, I'm just sleeping for a while. As the words fell, the woman turned into debris and dissipated with the wind. And then, with a sharp opening of his eyes, Winning Sky woke up from his dream. Professor Win, you're awake? Zhang Hanan was startled by Winning Sky and also woke up in a panic and hurriedly looked. Have I slept for a long time? Winning Sky looked out the window. Zhang Hanan looked at the time and said, slept for a whole day and night. Winning Sky had fallen asleep in a coma last night after writing the second new article on troop reinforcement. And now it was already 9 o'clock in the evening today. Professor Win, what's wrong with you? Zhang Hanan could see that something was wrong with Win Tian. Winning Sky was silent and eased for a long time. After a long time, he shook his head, nothing. Just had a very strange dream. Winning Sky and Zhang Hanan recounted their dream. Like Winning Sky, Zhang Hanan didn't understand too much. But this niece was good at picking up the key. Professor Win, are you lonely? Winning Sky was asked by Zhang Hanan's words. In terms of writing to save the country, he was indeed a bit lonely. However, he definitely couldn't say this kind of thing frankly because saying this kind of thing would only make everyone feel even more powerless, and it wouldn't have a single bit of other significance at all. By my side, I have Yao Yao who will bring me candies, Yu who will help me cook, Cheng who guards the door for me, the Dixia executives who come to visit me from time to time, and all the people in the rear of Dixia who are worried about me at all times. What do I have to be alone for? That woman in the dream was just talking nonsense. Laughing, Winning Sky eventually chose to skip this topic. He inquired towards Zhang Hanan about the situation at the front line. Upon learning that the front line had been superbly victorious on the Grand Xia side in every round today, especially after Zhang Hanan also specifically described the specific images of the front line, Winning Sky's entire body was also uncontrollably excited. The ancestors are so powerful. Zhang Hanan was also very excited. Yeah, those monsters were beaten to death. Professor Win, I'm telling you, you didn't see it. In the third round, emotions got the better of him. Zhang Hanan directly continued to start talking big again. Would Win Tian, who was lying on the hospital bed unable to move, refuse this kind of interesting chat? That naturally wouldn't be the case. Thus, the drawing style plot within the hospital room was also simply fixed directly into this. Great victory, great victory, another great victory. For the next three days, the front line of the Grand Xia continued to be inundated with reports of great victories. The literati that Winning Sky had replenished out this time were indeed numerous and strong in battle. With enough shields. The blood mouth demon monster had basically become a less dangerous enemy. And this was what made the Dixia side, whether it was the front line or the rear. Everyone's hearts were gradually relaxed. These monsters with golden thorns are nothing more than that. The front line warriors are really too strong. We should be able to hold the past safely with this baton, right? Rear. 
The populace of Dixia already possessed such thoughts, without any accidents, seven days should be able to casually hold it, and then after that, that's what we said before about holding strong for another three days on top of that, and what about the Dasha front line? After this new day of invasion by the blood mouth demon monster ended, the literati had a plan to defend the war against them, they also analyzed it again in this manner, everything is going well, everything is going smoothly, this is the situation on the front line of the great summer in the past few days, and it seems, this kind of days can also be like this has been continued, or rather, it's that everyone is looking forward to him lasting forever, battle of the sixth guards, when the 21st day of the second baton of the frontline guardian battle came, the moment the early morning sunlight sprinkled above the earth, Li Shou Chang snapped his eyes open, although there hadn't even been any movement on the battlefield this day, but he just had a premonition that changes would come out today, don't have any accidents, everyone just hold on, this was everyone's beautiful imagination, but in reality, how could accidents really not appear, if the 10,000 races side really only ever looked the same, then they wouldn't seem so terrifying, so, after so many days of good times had passed, at the beginning of this new day, the changes on the blood mouth demon monster side had finally come, the 10,000 clans to Xiaogua men sub base, the huge blood mouth mother emperor suddenly turned black as a whole, at the same time, countless more vines appeared on his body, the vines wrapped around the blood mouth mother emperor's body one moment, a moment later, it was released again, it was like several long tentacles pointing randomly in the air, the places that he pointed to, the air all began to emit a swampy devouring sound, gulp gulp, and then, the blood mouth mother emperor began his new day of procreation, his birthing speed was extremely fast, and he was able to give birth to several hundred blood mouth demon monsters in just one second, if it wasn't for the fact that the 10,000 races invasion of earth at the moment was limited to the number of invading monsters in each round, before, it was feared that just by relying on the number of blood mouth mother emperors would be able to directly take down the gates of great Xia. click, after a change in itself, at that moment, the blood mouth demon monsters that the blood mouth mother emperor gave birth to all changed along with it, they looked as if they were shrunken blood mouth mother emperors, and their bodies were all wrapped in vines as well, the blood mouth demon monster has evolved, as for exactly what power they possessed again, soon enough, the undead soul warriors on the front line of the great summer would also clearly understand and experience it, the appearance of these monsters has changed, their color has turned black, and there are more vines on their bodies, what's the deal with these vines, is their defense so high that it takes half a day to penetrate them, be careful, their vines are able to lengthen and stretch out, being touched by those vines will directly kill them, the iron wall of thought can only block the opponent for a moment, and the opponent's second attack will come soon, there's no time to go back and replenish the shield after it's broken, the vines that were added after the evolution of the blood mouth demon monster possessed two new effects, one was defense, which allowed the blood mouth demon monster itself to have thicker blood, the other was attack, they no longer had the ability to directly radiate golden thorns, but were able to extend their vines to act as golden thorns. In the past, a bloodmouth demon monster had so many gold thorns on its body, and it could not be shot singly but could only burst out all at once. Therefore, the attack of a bloodmouth demon monster was actually only once. But now, a bloodmouth demon monster could launch countless attacks, and the killing power of each attack was exactly the same as the previous golden thorns. Groove, even though these monsters don't have gold spikes on their bodies anymore, they can actually explode gold spikes from their bodies when they're killed. Well, it was all strengthened like this, but the ability to self-detonate and pull people out was still not gone from them. Why did these monsters suddenly, inexplicably become like this ah? The first round of the New Day's battle ended with heavy losses directly on the frontline side of Dasha. The undead warriors were puzzled, puzzled as to why they were suddenly like this. Only the literati, who were constantly imposing an iron wall of thought on the warriors, knew. This change is in fact from the beginning will be destined to appear content. This is ultimately a war of games between two sides. The other side is not a fixed machine. If there is a change on their side, then there will definitely be a change on the other side. But we have not dared to think of this accident in advance. No matter what you think, you have to look forward to saying, no surprises. Thinking that if they didn't think any further, everything would go on without any changes. The biggest problem right now is that after the warrior's shields are broken, there's no time to come back and replenish them with new ones. At the front line, the clerics looked at me and I looked at you, and finally made a unified decision. That is, they, the shield givers, also went to the front of the battlefield, the warriors were too late to find them, then let them go to the warriors. Just like the doctors, before the doctors stayed in the hospital and waited for the patients to come. But now, the doctors are always watching where the patients are, and then at a medium distance, they just throw an iron wall of thought over them. This will never work. 
After hearing the thoughts of the civilians, the 8th Guardian battle, Zhang Zuolin directly and firmly refused. On this battlefield, your lives are all extremely valuable. Anyone missing one of them will make it harder to hold our front line. You all absolutely have to stand at the very back, this cannot be altered. Zhang Zuolin's idea was also the idea of all the fallen warriors on the front line. It's just that, although such a concept was correct before, but after the changes on the side of the bloodmouth demon monsters, it became less correct as well. Those monsters have accelerated the frequency of their attacks, the warriors simply can't come back in time to replenish their shields again, we can continue to stand at the back, but if we stand at the back, but none of the warriors at the front line can come back to replenish their shields again, then what's the point of us standing at the back? Separating the space, Li Shouchan's voice directly penetrated the entire front line. Comrades, since ancient times, war sacrifice is a common thing, you say that our lives are precious, but without you, even if we are all alive what is the point? It's just waiting to die, in the end, our gates will still be broken, and our country will still fall. Changes have occurred on the side of the 10,000 races, and if we want to deal with it, the only way is to have changes as well. Li Shouchan's voice carried an irresistible force. We go to the front line, and damage deaths are very much a physical pain for the entire front line. But if we do not walk to the front line, our country is directly dying Ah! The wind whistled and blew, rolling the dust on the battlefield into the sky. After hearing this statement from Li Shouchan, at the front line, all the undead soul warriors were silent. They didn't want to accept such a shift, but right now, it seemed like they really had no other choice as well. Then there must be a certain number of warriors for your protection. Zhang Zuolin gritted his teeth and made a final retreat. Hearing Zhang Zuolin's words, the literati forefathers of the various guardian stations smiled. They nodded one after another before jointly replying to Zhang Zuolin, Good, Professor Wen, that. I still have things to do, so I'll be leaving today ha, huh? Kyoto, hospital ward. This night. After eating a new day's dinner with Win Tian piece by piece, Zhang Hanan took a step and without looking back, she was about to leave in a hurry. But unfortunately, she didn't walk out of the ward after all. When she had just taken two steps out, Winning Sky's shout came, Colden, why don't you stay tonight? Winning Sky smiled and opened his mouth. Zhang Hanan was in pain, Professor Win, I really have something to do. Winning Sky softly inquired, what exactly is it? It's that, well, forgetting to close the door to the house, the years might run out. Zhang Hanan had a flash of spiritual light, only feeling that he was a genius at this moment. It's fine, Yearning doesn't like to go out. But unfortunately, she had underestimated Winning Sky's determination after all. There's a problem at the front line. Winning Sky said, it seems that the literati forefathers are going to the battlefield as well. You know, if that's the case, their numbers are far from enough. So on our side, it's also imperative that we write out another new article on troop reinforcement. After watching the sudden changes at the front line. Winning Sky had the idea of writing another new article to support them. Zhang Hanan guessed this thought of Winning Skies, which is why he also thought of sneaking away in a hurry. Prof. Win, it's only been three days, you won't be able to retell history again. Zhang Hanan spoke helplessly, your body can't take it. Win Tian skimmed his mouth, just try, how do you know if you don't try? I won't help you anyway, or everyone will beat me to death. Zhang Hanan spread his hands out with a posed look. Winning Sky frowned, who dares to beat you up, you call him over. All the top brass of our country, Zhang Hanan said. Winning Sky was silent, Hanan, the front line needs us. It was the same speech as last time again. But unfortunately, this time, Zhang Hanan would not be affected. I'm quitting anyway. With that, Zhang Hanan left. The ferocity with which she left even caused Winning Sky to freeze violently. This niece, why is she so determined all of a sudden? Winning Sky was a bit puzzled. And then, after staying alone in the room for another 10 minutes, Winning Sky conducted another shout at the door. Big Brother Chang'an, is it there? The bodyguard outside the door, Zhu Chang'an, responded, yes. Do me a favor? Winning Sky asked with a smile. However, he didn't want the wooden man Zhu Chang'an, who had always responded to all requests. At this time, he directly shook his head, no. Being rejected in such a firm manner, Winning Sky was also once again unable to tense up. After seeing the situation at the front line, he really couldn't help but want to make a move. However, his hands really couldn't move right now. The people outside had suddenly all inexplicably become particularly determined again. Hey! Without anyone to assist, this night for Winning Sky was destined to be a night of inaction. The next day, on the front line of the Grand Xia, a new round of invasion by the 10,000 races once again came roaring in. The Bloodmouth Demon Monster side was the same as yesterday, still covered in vines and powerful in battle. On the other hand, on the side of the Grand Xia army, there was one more literati on the battlefield, following the battle. Don't be afraid, new shields are coming. No need to go back, I'm here, pick up this iron wall of thought. Democracy and science, go to. 
These literati were weaving in and out of various parts of the battlefield. As long as they found that the iron wall of thought had been broken, they hurriedly expended their divine sense to make a breakthrough in the medium-sized soul warriors. They hurriedly consumed their divine sense and threw out a new iron wall of thought for them at a medium distance. The first round of invasion by the blood mouth monsters ended very quickly. Compared to yesterday, the situation on this side of Dasha was significantly better today. The undead warriors were able to replenish their new iron wall of thought in time, and were able to put up a much better performance in their battle with the blood mouth monsters. However, in such a situation, another significant problem appeared. That was the fact that the divine sense consumption of the people above the battlefield was much more than at the back. Is it still okay? Zheng Zuolin looked at Kai Yuan Pei beside him. Kai Yuan Pei pretended to be calm. It's fine, no problem. Just like that, after the second round of invasion by the bloodmouth demon monster began, the literati continued to roam the battlefield. And then, the third round, the fourth round, the fifth round. Under various difficult struggles, the bloodmouth demon monster's 22nd day of invasion on the front line of Dasha came to an end. Compared to yesterday, the number of deaths and injuries of the undead soul warriors had decreased significantly. However, on the side of the literati, the impact was so great that it made everyone very frowning and heartbroken. In addition to the relatively large consumption of basic divine sense, in today's battle, three literati died on the Grand Sia side. The attacks of the blood mouth demon monsters were ultimately too fierce. Even though on the battlefield, there were many undead soul warriors around each literati for protection. But the literati who should die, in the end, still have to be attacked to death. Moreover, this was still the result of the blood mouth demon monsters not having intelligence and fighting purely indiscriminately. If the bloodmouth demon monsters possessed intelligence, understood the role of the literati, and specifically targeted the literati to attack, then the number of dead and injured literati on the battlefield at this moment would be even more, I'm afraid. I'm needed at the front line, we really can't delay any longer on our side. Kyoto, Hospital Ward. This day, Winning Sky was shouting from the beginning to the end. But not a single person, not a single person was willing to answer him. Zhang Hanan even brought in his meal and hurriedly slipped away. It made the person who fed Winning Sky today the person outside the door, Zhu Chang'an. Why is it like this? Winning Sky was very confused. He started yelling and screaming inside the ward, trying to draw attention to himself. And in the end, he did attract people. That old man from Dasha came to his hospital room at night. Professor Win, you can't write any more essays, your body can't support it anymore. You'll die if you write any more essays before you recover. Turning to Winning Sky, the old man finally told Winning Sky that he would die if he wrote another text. Hearing the old man's words, Winning Sky couldn't help but be stunned. He lowered his head and was silent for a long time. After a long time, he spoke rather helplessly, but if I don't make a move, the front line won't hold up, and if the great Xia dies, won't I still die? What Winning Sky said was the truth, but there were many truths in this world, that is, even if you knew it, it would be hard to do something about it. Let me write another text, maybe I can. Winning Sky spoke seriously as he said, the forefathers on the front line are already holding on strong. Previously, when he had impressed Jung Hanan, Winning Sky had used these words, and now he was speaking like this again. Only, what was different from last time was that. This time, the frontline side actually sent back a reply even the instant he opened his mouth. Brat, just who is holding out strongly ah? Can you stop putting so much drama on yourself? Next, you are not allowed to make a move. We'll show you that this current frontline battlefield, even without you, we can still annihilate the enemy army just the same. The 23rd day of the third stick of the 10,000 clans invasion. The invasion of the blood mouth demon monsters became even more ferocious. Though eventually round after round. The great Xia frontline all managed to hold the country's gates. However, the damage on their own side had been so great that it was terrifying. This day, only until noon. There were already four more literati sacrificed in the middle of the battlefield. Among them. Even contains the 8th guardian battle main crane secretary Kai Yuan Pei. How can this be guarded? Kyoto, hospital, inside the ward. After the crowd of literati stood out last night, Winning Sky was silent. But when this new day the situation on the front line came back again, how could Winning Sky still, continue to endure? What do you say about not needing me, without me, you guys can still annihilate the enemy army. It's just holding on, what's the point of holding on like this? Winning Sky didn't understand, didn't understand what exactly everyone behind the front line was thinking at this time. Obviously, if he wanted to defend Dasha, it was impossible for him not to write this third article. Why do we have to keep on doing this, making fearless sacrifices? Maybe Winning Heaven would have written the article long ago. With more people and more power, the frontline literati would be able to sacrifice a little less. It's hard to believe that these people still really think that they can already defend through this stick just by themselves. In the afternoon, the invasion of the blood-mouth demon monsters came roaring in once again. 
The final result of the battle was, unsurprisingly, naturally that de Xia's side continued to defend. But after defending, a more serious problem also came. That was that the clerics at the various guard stations had all exhausted their divine sense. Or rather, it was exhausted early. The iron wall of thoughts they applied to the undead warriors on the front line was already starting to consume their bodies, and the pain doubled and doubled and doubled again, and it was almost as if they were winning the sky in the moment of the great late stage. Perhaps tomorrow, the invasion of the bloodmouth demon monsters they will no longer be able to hold back. Upon realizing this, winning sky could no longer remain calm. He called out for Zhu Chengen to contact the old man. And then, extremely firmly, he spoke out what he could see. If you don't let me make a move, tomorrow, Great Xiao will be finished. Everyone will die by then. What in the world are you all still tangling and dawdling about? For the first time, Winning Sky's tone was so bad. Looking at Winning Sky in this manner, the old man did not say anything. However, the right hand behind his back could no longer help but start trembling. Winning Sky would die if he wrote another text. But if he didn't write any more, the great Xiao would really die soon. At this moment, just how should one choose? As a person who was being helped, the old man really didn't want to let Win Tian suffer anymore. However, as the upper echelon of a country, the old man also really had no way to ignore the country. Before, it has not come to this last moment, so the old man can always escape. But now, let me write. Winning Sky's expression was extremely firm. The old man looked at Winning Sky. Winning Sky spoke again, let me write. After a long time, the old man no longer had the strength to hold on. With red eyes, he nodded, good. Then, trembling, he walked out of the door and called Zhu Chengen in. I said it's fine if you write it. Winning Sky looked at Zhu Chengen. At this time, Zhu Chengen was already sitting in front of the open computer. Seeing that Zhu Chengen was already ready, a deep breath was taken. Winning Sky's side was also making final mental preparations for itself. In my current state, will I directly die if I write another augmentation article? The word death was a very scary word, or at least Winning Sky had always been terrified of it. He was afraid of the unknown feeling when he died, afraid that after death, he would never be able to eat good food again, and also afraid that after death, the follow-up of Dasha would become no follow-up again. Just like what he had thought about before, after his own death, the splendor of Daiming, Datang, and Qin would all go unrepeated. However, thinking about it, but also directly then want to go back to the original point again. It was just like those contents that Winning Sky had lamented out when he had put everything he had together during the last baton. Although he wanted to live more than anyone else, and wanted to carry on with the follow-up narrative again. But the problem now was that he had to get everyone through the moment first. To say the only difference between this time and the last time I lamented. It might be that the probability of one's death has become much greater this time? Winning Sky was silent for a long time. Afterward, nothing was said anymore. Directly, he carried on reminiscing in his brain library. Love it or hate it. Dying was also considered to be the end. After all, this theater he had already tried his best to the extreme. As for after that, the next bat, the next next bat. All one can say is to beg the old gods on whichever piece. Let's see if he has the ability to make a library appear in someone's mind again. After the new culture movement, it will be the May 4th movement. This time, let's retell the stories of the forefathers in the May 4th movement. Winning Sky rationalized what he was going to write today. If his current body really would die if he wrote another text, then it would be good to have the May 4th movement as his last article. Not only young in his own quite echo. In terms of the degree of help to the front line, these people are also absolutely enough. Even if one's own wave really live or death. Just this one article, it should also be enough for Dasha to survive this stick. As for the next stick to Ching, repeat the above. That should be the job of the next person with a library in his head. And if there's not going to be another lucky one in the world. Damn. That's not something Winning Sky can help with anymore. The Age of Awakening, bearing the bone of the wind and the bone of the sharpness, having a dream is just. Bringing a bitter smile to the corner of his mouth, Winning Sky spoke out the title of today's new article. After he spoke, Zhu Chengen quickly typed the content on the computer as well. Hmm, where to start? Let's just still pick up where the last article left off. Winning Sky thought for a moment and found a good entry point. The familiar feeling of pain came, but Win Tian was all but able to ignore it already. Or rather it was that death was already in front of him, and the pain all of a sudden wasn't a thing anymore. Chen Zhongfu started the new culture movement to its climax at Peking University. And at this time, another influential event suddenly occurred in Dasha. Exactly the same as the last time, Winning Sky used the oral method to tell history again. While he was speaking, Zhu Chengen was writing. Chen Zhongfu started the new culture movement at Peking University to its climax. And at this time, another influential event suddenly happened in Dasha. After writing two sentences, Zhu Chengen waited for Winning Sky's next sentence. However, after that, it was a full 10 seconds of waiting. 
Yet, he also didn't hear another sound from Winning Sky side. Professor Win, then what? Xu Chang'an inquired, and no one responded. He raised his head. In the next second, he could only hear that the opposite side of Winning Sky was filled with panic. Obviously, his mouth was wide open, but he couldn't make a single sound. Winning Sky's voice was mute. There was no sign. It became like this extremely suddenly. A drop of sweat fell from his forehead. At this moment, he panicked to the extreme. But the reality was that no matter how much he repeated it again, if you can't change your voice, you can't change your voice. Professor Wing Yu. Zhu Chang'an was also shocked. He hurriedly went out and called for a doctor. However, the doctors after checking out Win Tian, all of them were also bewildered to the extreme. It's not a physical condition that caused the inability to vocalize. It has nothing to do with the body, so. It's the 10,000 clans? Inside the ward, the old man was already coming in again. When Winning Sky was writing the text again, he couldn't bear to look at it so he went out. But he didn't want that something like this would have suddenly happened inside. Now, was it the 10,000 clans that had engaged in a means to keep Winning Sky from speaking out? Following the most previous global amnesia, the 10,000 races once again made a move to affect the back of the countries? Winning Sky was also looking out the window in shock at this moment. After the all races had engaged in global amnesia before, they hadn't struck out at the rear of the countries again. So Winning Sky also never thought that such an accident would occur again. No, no, it's not the 10,000 races. Winning Sky's heart was violently startled. It was because he felt it carefully. It was discovered that the power that was preventing him from speaking was not sharp. Instead, it also carried an extreme amount of warmth and softness. Yes, the great summer consciousness. Winning Sky finally realized who it was that was preventing him from speaking. However, he didn't understand, didn't understand why the great summer consciousness was doing this. He was clearly trying to save the entire Grand Xia and all the people in the rear of the Grand Xia. Why? Winning Sky's heart was burning inside. Unfortunately, the Great Xia consciousness was acting as if it did not exist, not responding to Winning Sky at all. After the last article was written, Winning Sky was severely injured again and could only speak simply. Now, he didn't even have the ability to speak. If he couldn't speak, then there was no way for a new article on troop reinforcement to come out. Great Xia may really have to die. The pupils of his eyes lost their color, and Winning Sky was like a puppet in an instant. And at the moment he realized to understand these, actually is not the most difficult. The hardest thing is, in the next second, he also realized that. Those remaining Republican literati in his brain's historical library disconnected from him. Of course, it wasn't that they were leaving Winning Sky to find others. Rather, this wave of them, they refused Winning Sky's call. They took the initiative and all refused to come out. Why, why ah? Uh? Two lines of tears flowed down from his eyes. But just like the great summer consciousness not replying to Winning Sky. At this moment, these literati who were still inside the library also stopped replying to Winning Sky. Just like that, in a situation where it was clear that he was completely prepared. Winning Heaven's third article on troop reinforcement was terminated extremely suddenly. Lying on the hospital bed, Winning Sky did not move anymore. He just quietly looked at the ceiling. While looking at this appearance of Winning Sky, the old man was also very heartbroken. He sat in the hospital room for a long time and pacified Winning Sky for a long time. And after a long time, he also hurriedly went to deal with other things. Because Winning Sky couldn't make any more articles on his side. Then De Xia might really be finished next. As the head of a country, the old man had a lot of things to do in these final moments. Zhu Chang'an was still standing outside the door, and the ward became empty once again. The 24th day of the third stick of the 10,000 races invasion. The current situation on the front line of De Xia was already extremely bad. However, the corners of the mouths of the various literati were all wearing smiles. That kid can't speak anymore. Quite good. There were no excessive words. After nodding to each other through the air, these literati then went back to the battlefield, following the undead warriors in the front line to fight against the bloodmouthed demonic monsters on the opposite side. The golden age is not behind us, but in front of us, not in the past, but in the future. The things in the universe are infinite. The cream of the scientific territory to be opened up is from the vast, the youth reluctant? What is different from me may not be wrong, and what is the same as me may not be right, what is right today may not be right, and what is wrong today may not be wrong. Every man of letters is expounding the thoughts they once had. And these ideas, in the battlefield turned into countless ideas of the iron wall, to protect the warriors continue to move forward. Poof. Somewhere in the corner, after patching up a new iron wall of thought for another deceased warrior, Mr. Li Shouchan didn't hold back, and a mouthful of blood spurted out directly from his mouth. Sir. The undead soul warrior was startled. However, Mr. Li Shou Chang was still smiling and opened his mouth to say back, no harm, nothing much. As the battle progressed to this point, 
the bodies of all the literati on the front line at the moment were already all unable to carry on. Even without the attack of the 10,000 races on them, just simply applying the iron wall of thought to the warriors without stopping, it made them all about to fall to the ground. Strongly holding on, they were all using their lives to hold on. The historical dead souls guarding the gates of the country, the ones who recovered were all people who had died once. What was it like for them to die once more? It shouldn't be much different from dying for the first time. Winning Sky called the undead soul warriors to the battlefield. In essence, it was still trying to keep everyone from dying again. Although they still had to dissipate after each stick guard, dissipation was still not the same as death in any sense. Maybe after dissipation they can revive again, still be conscious, or even live in another world? But if they died again after revival, what if they were really considered non-existent in the full sense of the word? Winning Sky can't bear to see his forefathers like this, he asked Zhu Chengen to turn off the screen in his hospital room. But he couldn't help it, he couldn't help not paying attention to them. After a period of time passed, Winning Sky once again called out to Zhu Chengen to come in and turn on the screen with the frontline images. At this time, the frontline has already finished the first two rounds of the new day. The battle situation was very tragic, and several more literati were killed by the bloodmouth demon monster not to mention. All the other literati, too, had already coughed up blood and almost died themselves. Gritting his teeth tightly, Winning Sky tried to get his hands moving. Then he sat in front of the computer and hurriedly made up the new article. However, he couldn't, couldn't move at all. All right, rest obediently. In a trance, a voice came back from the front line. Listening to this voice, Winning Sky once again fell into silence. A day passed quickly. Out of everyone's expectation. On this day, the undead soul warriors on the front line of Grand Xia actually defended again. Who said we can't hold today? We can. Brat, your estimation is wrong. At the front line, the remaining literati were laughing. Such laughter lasted for more than 10 seconds. After laughing, their expressions became serious once again. They looked at each other across the room, said, on this trip, with all of you as companions, great goodness. Immediately afterward, and also in synchronization, they all looked to the sky and to winning sky. Little friend, we may not be able to hold out any longer. Snow once again fell in the sky. That snow fell on the bodies of the frontline crowd, and it quickly spread a thin layer on the earth. At the front line, the literati wanted to say something else but their bodies were already all unable to carry them. The story had progressed to this point. Each of them was already at their own extreme. Poof. The snowflakes were like countless fluttering elves, sprinkling down on the earth in a flurry. In this silver-clad world, a red trace stood out. It was a mouthful of crimson blood, spurting out from the mouth of a certain literati, cutting through the silent snowy night like a blooming red plum, poignant and stunning. The blood fell on the snow, contrasting with the white snow. It soaked into the snowflakes, as if it had colored the pure and flawless snow with a layer of enchanting red. That literati's body trembled in the cold wind, and every time he spat out a mouthful of blood, it was as if he was burning the flame of life even more fiercely. And the blood that spewed out from his mouth was at this moment like it was the strongest cry of his life. Pong. This literati finally collapsed in the snow. With that, his body was blown away by the wind little by little, as if this world he had never come. Poof. This scholar's fall was not the end, it was only the beginning of this scene in the snow. After him, one after another scribe vomited blood, and one after another fell. Carrying hard until now, everyone's lives were clearly at their last moments. There was no way they could continue to carry on hard, they, had to go. Little friend, little friend ah, you absolutely can't have anything happen to you, you must live. The snow was getting bigger and bigger. In the midst of the snow, Mr. Li Shouchan let out this cry. Eventually, the snow covered all. The 24th day of the third stick of the 10,000 races invasion, night. On the front line of Grand Xia, all the literati guarding the front of the battle were almost completely dead. Looking closely, above the entire battlefield. At this time, there were only two literati left. One was Li Shou Taste. And one was Chen Brofu. They came the earliest. They also stayed here at the end. At this moment, they are not dead. But they could no longer create an iron wall of thought. They stood in the snow. They looked extremely powerless and lonely. A gust of wind blew by, and it was as if it could blow them down. Don't listen to the sound of leaves beating through the forest, why not chant and walk slowly? The bamboo staff and shoes are lighter than a horse, who was afraid, a straw raincoat is a peaceful life. Chen Bofu stretched out his hand and picked up a piece of snow. And after he picked up this piece of snow, in the back, in the hospital, inside the ward. This was where Winning Sky understood exactly what these people were up to. On a new day, at 5 in the morning, Winning Sky was able to make a sound. The Dasha consciousness was no longer blocking him in any way. The other literati in the library in his mind were also no longer making rejections. In order to keep this country, Winning Sky had to be writing a text, 
This was a fact that could not be changed in any way. However, outside of that, they were able to slightly change some of the details. For example, everyone can hold on for a little while longer. Then, let winning heaven rest for a little while longer. Although the chances are slim. But just in case. Just in case is to rest for that much more day. Winning Sky can then write this third augmentation article without having to die? Lying on the hospital bed. At this time, Winning Sky was already in tears. He understood the intentions of his forefathers. Understood that the forefathers' strong support was not something for the sake of face. Nor was it for the sake of letting Winning Sky not write the text. Winning Heaven had to write a third text in order for Dashia to hold on to the past. They knew that better than anyone. And on top of that, they are also aware of the many new characters in Win Tian's third text. In and of itself, they were certain that they would be able to hold on past the remaining so many days on the Dasha front. And so, they chose, from the very beginning, to hold out strongly until they were sacrificed. Using themselves who were no longer needed after my third text came out later. In exchange for me being able to rest one more day, two more days. And then, allow me to write my third text with that much more one point, two points of life. Winning Heaven had no qualifications to comment on such an approach by the ancestors. Because everyone was ultimately doing it for him. Moreover, even if one only looked at the correctness, there really wasn't any problem with this approach. Because Winning Sky's Live also didn't only represent himself, but also the future hope of the Great Xia. At the last moment, what Winning Sky thought was that this was it, he tried his best, and there was really nothing he could do after he finished. However, what the forefathers thought was that even if there was still a sliver of hope, they would definitely let Winning Sky add one more point to continue the story. I will live, I can't die, no one can take me away. If death comes, then I will beat him back. At this moment, Winning Sky's attitude towards death changed once again. At the same time, the entire rear of Dashia was also experiencing a change. The frontline literati's strong support is not meaningless. They not only added one more day's rest and one more point of vitality for Winning Heaven. They also created the final warm-up time for the last dance of the Great Summer Consciousness. Don't worry, I'll just sleep for a while. In a trance, inside the hospital ward. Winning Sky heard the woman's voice from the previous dream again. He looked out the window, only to see that snow was also falling at this time in the back of Dasha. Along with the snow in this dark night. In the rear of the Grand Xia, all the people woke up and opened their eyes from the dream world. And then, a piece of content appeared in all of their minds. This content caused all the people in the rear of the Great Xia to sit up violently. Immediately afterward, the mouths that were open wide opened wide and couldn't help trembling trembled. From today, to the complete end of the third baton of the Guardian War. As Winning Sky retells history. Each and every descendant of the rear side of the Great Summer puts their right hand in front of their chest. There is a very slight chance that all may share a hint of damage for Winning Sky who is retelling history. Note, although the bearer who succeeds in docking only shares away a sliver of Winning Sky's damage, the damage endured when bearing is a hundred times that sliver. This extra content in his mind was very simple, but the impact was extremely huge. Because it represented that the other people in the rear of the Grand Xia could also do something. They could stop watching helplessly. They can also help Winning Sky, a piece of the front line, to write articles to increase troops. As for, there is only a very small chance that they can share away the damage that Winning Sky has suffered. Oh, as long as there are enough people, this problem won't be much of a problem, right? Our great summer's rear, the last thing we need is people. Professor Win, this time, we can finally help you. Aside from watching the front line with respect, we can finally do something else as well. On this night, all of Dasha's subjects were invigorated. The group of Dasha's top brass led by the old man. It was even afterward. Straight away, they went to the hospital ward where Winning Sky was. When they arrived, Winning Sky was crying. Or for those ancestors who fell in the snow yesterday. Or just for that, I just sleep a little. Today. It was only today that Winning Sky finally realized that the dreams he had sometimes were not just dreams. Who is the little girl in the dream is still not very clear. But the warm and kind woman who said that Winning Day was still a good looking brunette. Her name was, the National Consciousness of Great Xia. When Winning Sky was injured, she helped him recover. When Winning Sky wasn't in the spotlight, she made all of Dixia see him. Now, she had done something else. Under the oppression of the 10,000 clans, her power had been reduced to a mere pittance. And now, she used all that was left of her as well as herself. In exchange, she gave Winning Sky the last chance of life in the second stick. Is it really just a nap? When the old man and the other Dasha executives didn't come over, Winning Sky asked in a low voice to the empty room. There was no answer to this question. What the world gave to Winning Sky at this time was already only absolute silence. Tears could not stop flowing out of Winning Sky's eyes, while people were cheering outside, inside the hospital room. Only Winning Sky was crying his heart out, like a child, while Winning Sky was crying. 
in front of the door of the ward. The old man and a bunch of other Dasha executives just kept waiting like that. Three minutes, five minutes, ten minutes? I don't know how long it took, but Winning Sky raised his head after he had finished crying. I'm going to start writing the next article on troop reinforcement. When he raised his head again, Winning Heaven's expression had completely transformed. Only four words remained in his eyes, immortality. Watching Winning Sky recover. The old man and the other group of DCI executives also had smiles spreading from the corners of their mouths. Yes, it's time for us to fight back. At this time, it was already 5.30 in the morning. There was only a short time left before the first round of invasion of the 10,000 races for the new day. At that moment, there were already only two literati left on the front line. And these two literati were already at the end of their strength and in danger. On the new day, the gate of Dashia wanted to be defended again. Winning Day's new text has become an indispensable existence. However, and the past is different. This time the winning day to write a text, you do not have to worry about his death. Because the entire back of the great summer, all the people will stand by his side. Professor Win. The door was pushed open, and the one who excitedly barged in was Zhang Hanan. Seeing Zhang Hanan, Winning Sky couldn't help but smile. Now, can you go and play the keyboard for me? Zhang Hanan wanted to cry and laugh again. In the end, she didn't say anything and just nodded down fiercely. Turning the computer on and the writing software on, Zhang Hanan made herself ready. And at the same time, all the people in the entire rear of Dashia were also ready. At that moment, the Great Xia officials did not release any announcement to require the people in the rear of the Great Xia to have to place their hands on their chests while Winning Sky was writing a text. After all, this is not necessary at all, without any coercion, even without any guidance, the people in the rear of the Grand Xia will come forward on their own. They no longer want to be powerless to resist people. They no longer wanted to see Prof. Win suffer for them. This time, Prof. Win is no longer alone. This time, they would closely follow Professor Win's side. Gentlemen, are you willing to come out this time? Win Tian called out from within the historical library in his mind. What responded to him was the light laughter of countless forefathers, Mei, pulling his consciousness back, glancing at Zhang Hanan who was already poised in front of the computer. Winning Sky's third article once again finally made a strong appearance. The Age of Awakening, bearing the bone of the wind and the bone of the sharpness, if you have a dream, you are strong. The story still picks up where the previous one left off. The content of the new culture movement comes to an end first. Entering the stage once again were countless youths holding up the flag. The May 4th movement was a patriotic movement that took place in the capital city on May 4, 1919, in which young students were the main participants, and the general public, citizens, industrialists, and businessmen and other strata of the population participated, through demonstrations, petitions, strikes, violent confrontations with the government, and other forms of patriotic movement. The cause was the peace conference against the chariot country in January 1919, and in the case of being a victorious country, the other country even decided that the Japanese country would inherit the privileges that the chariot country had once had in the Dasha Haidai area, and even more disgusting was that the Kashio amplitude even agreed to it. For such bullying and humiliation, the people of Dasha were naturally never willing to accept it. So, with the Dashang literati lead, the major university students as the heart, the follow-up citizens do body, sensational, shocking the world wind and thunder rang. Haidai lost, we lost, we completely lost. Didn't we win? But now what's going on? Disya, as a victorious nation, deserves such a powerless and humiliating treaty? The loss of the diplomatic corps, the bullying of other countries, and the weakness of the Hanyang amplitude. Dasha entered the darkest period of its time. And in this extremely dark period, the literati of Dasha stood up. As soon as this word on the contract is signed, Haidai will become a Japanese country. But can we agree to this if we are a Xia country? No promise. If the upper level can't save the country, then start from the lower level. Taking the students as the main body, they paraded the streets and shouted, and then led the entire people of Dashia to fight back in unison. They're ignoring my Dashia. As long as the 40 million people of Dashia are of one mind, Dashia will not die. This time, Winning Sky still wrote extremely much about Mr. Chen broth Fu Li Show Taste. This was because they had also really dedicated extremely much in this campaign. However, much was much. However, the subject in this piece of writing could not really be considered them. This time, the subject of the story is all the Dasha, Yanhua people. The issue of Hai Dai, not the survival of a province. Our own country, we do not love, who loves? Give me back Hai Dai, fight to the traitor, give me back Hai Dai, fight to the traitor. As long as we can awaken the people of Dasha, we'll do anything even if we have to give our lives. Defend sovereignty, refuse to sign the contract, defend sovereignty, refuse to sign the contract. In the darkness, everyone was using their own way to defend the great Xia's land. And it was then that the literati of Dasha emitted an even shinier light. 
Who said that the literati were useless? Who said that there were no literati in the Republic of Dasha? When Dasha was without medicine, they were the ones who sought medicine for Dasha. When Dasha was in trouble, it was they who stood up, bled, and sacrificed. Even if the enemy's guns were blocking in front of them, they, too, will continue to cry, compatriots, unite. What is a scholar of Dasha? This is a scholar of Dasha. To die is to know that all things are empty, but to grieve and not see the nine states together. The king's division north of the central plains day, family sacrifices without forgetting to sue Nywing. In this world, there is no such thing as a scholar. The real scholars have their own firmness. At the end of the article, Winning Sky wrote about a scholarly student. The student was so worried about Dasha that he turned white in one night. He wrote a letter in blood, raised his banner and cried out for the land of Dasha. In the end, he died on the road of recovering national sovereignty. The day when Dasha recovers the island city of Hyde Ai, you will go to my grave and tell me and my father. When Winning Sky finished this last sentence of the current article, inside the hospital room, all the people were already in tears. They had read the bones of the Dasha literati in this article. Put this article out. Winning Sky said. Zhang Hanan nodded. With that, directly then, he also released this new article. Little friend Win, are you alright? The old man looked towards Winning Sky with some worry. They all placed their right hands on their chests when Winning Sky retold history just now. However, none of them had succeeded in becoming someone who could help Winning Sky share his injuries. It's okay. Winning Sky smiled faintly, indicating that there was no problem on his side. And it was true that after this article was written, he did not have any problems. Although there was still a small bit of damage as well. But it was much better than the one at the very beginning that would have directly caused him to die. Everyone is helping me. Winning Sky looked out the window. At this moment, at the rear of the Grand Sia, all the people's right hands on their chests had yet to fall. They had all taken the initiative to come forward the moment the official announcement from the Grand Sia said that Winning Sky was going to write a text. The vast majority of these people were like the old people in Win Tian's hospital room, who had not succeeded in sharing the damage for Win Tian. However, because there were simply too many people who stepped forward at the same time, so even if only a very small portion of them managed to share a hint of damage for Win Tian, when added up, it was already something that could become a very terrifying number. Has Professor Win finished writing his new article? Hi Dai, Island City. A young man wearing glasses slowly lowered his hand. At this moment, his forehead was completely covered in sweat. The entire person was also trembling uncontrollably. Yes, he was the one who had successfully shared a trace of damage for Winning Sky, due to the fact that the bearer had to bear a hundred times the damage. So even if he only shared a trace of it, his was already injured to the point of death at this moment. However, after sharing and suffering, the youth's face was instead all smiles. Because, after the invasion of the 10,000 races, after the invasion of the 10,000 races, he could finally become a truly alive person again. Professor Wynn, it's really great to be able to help you in our country. At this moment, all of the people who had helped Win Tian share the damage were in the same mood. They were all honored and happy. They were all smiling. Of course, there were also some who were crying. It was because after they had personally shared the harm that Winning Sky had suffered. It was only then that they realized just how much pain Winning Sky had suffered in the first place. Granted, the damage sustained by their side was a hundred times more. But even if it was a hundred times, it was still completely incomparable to what Winning Sky had endured in the first place. Even the sliver they shared from Winning Sky. By itself, it might not even be one ten thousandth of what Winning Sky had endured. I wonder what the content of Professor Wynn's article is this time. The spectacled youth opened his computer and searched the internet for Winning Sky's article. Since Winning Sky had already sent out the article, so soon it's also seen the full content of the new article. As long as the 40 million people of Dasha are of one heart, Dasha will not die. And after that, upon reading this new article of Winning Sky in its entirety, the spectacled youth was undoubtedly in tears as well. Even more than the others, the emotional infection on his side was deeper. Because, the place that everyone was trying to recapture in this article was his hometown Ah, Thank you, thank you. Since the 10,000 clan side had used tactics, these stories no longer existed. Now that he saw this history told by winning Tian Chong, the spectacled youth only felt hot-blooded and heartbroken. He first clenched his fists and wanted to follow with a loud shout, and then he wanted to suffer with tears in his eyes. His emotions went through several rounds, and in the end, he was smiling. Because the subsequent Dashia lived up to the wishes of the forefathers, really stood up in the world. Haidai, the island city, is now still firmly in the motherland mother's arms. Also because through Prof. Win, they remembered back to this history in the beginning. The forefathers in that part of history could live in their memories again. Strength, it's back. 
At the front line, Chen brought Fu and Li Shou taste, who had already exhausted themselves, suddenly possessed strength again. They raised their heads violently and looked towards the sky, and then, all of them understood the answer. It was Winning Sky's third article that had come out. And through this article, their reappearance level had been augmented again. So, everyone else is coming as well? Li Shou taste inquired. Brof Chen grinned, probably saying goodbye to that kid right now. Rear, hospital, ward. At this time, there were indeed quite a few more ancestors around Winning Sky. Since the ward was really too small, not everyone came. Just like before, just some newly revived representatives had come. You won't blame us for not coming out before, right? A literati ancestor inquired. A smile spread across Winning Sky's mouth, how could I blame? Is it the gentlemen who have come to conduct their farewells? The old man as well as a group of Dasha's senior officials were still in the ward at this time. They were all jolted when they saw that Winning Sky had started talking to himself. The forefathers would basically come to say goodbye to Winning Sky after they were revived out. This previous days, Winning Sky had spoken to them. But now that they had personally bumped into it, it felt really different again. Although they simply couldn't see or hear it this time. Inside the room, the literati forefathers stayed for a moment. And then, together, they nodded at Winning Sky, and without dawdling, they all rushed off to the frontline battlefield directly. After they left, the old man couldn't help but make inquiries, did the ancestors say anything just now? Winning Sky froze, then, a warm smile also appeared on his face, they said, next time, don't have so many people in the ward, it's crowded. The 25th day of the third stick of the 10,000 races invasion. Frontline, battlefield. A new day of invasion by the blood-mouth demon monsters came as promised. But this time, both the front line and the rear. The people of Grand Xia were all no longer afraid. Fellow countrymen, unite. Just like when they raised their flags and cried out to defend Haidai Island City. This time, countless readers raised their hands and defended the entire Yanhua. Teachers, students, workers, the front line of Dasha was crowded. Among them, the teachers and students revived and gained the power of literary warfare, serving to travel through the battlefield and impose an iron wall of thought for the warriors. As for the workers, they revived out although not added, but with the thought iron wall of power, an absolute spiritual power, but also can be added on the previous guarding the war passed away warriors of the empty space. The forefathers added out of this one text are just too many. There were only a few days left in the defensive battle of the third stick of the 10,000 races invasion. No surprises. They would then also be able to successfully guard this stick of the great Xia's gates. We, don't have to be afraid anymore. As a matter of fact, this piece of text winning Sky originally didn't want to conjure up so many people. It was because he knew his physical strength. With the only physical strength he had left before, even if he really died, he would never be able to do so. But then, with the help of Dasha's self-consciousness slumber, winning the sky did not have to hold back to right high. As a result, on the frontline battlefield, facing the invading blood-mouth demon monsters, the warriors on the Dasya side directly launched a crushing attack. Although your side has added vines for defense, but in the end, it will break in a few times. Whereas on my side, I have countless literati, and without a teacher I also have students who are frantically applying shields for me, I simply can't use up my shields, so how are you going to fight? Unsurprisingly, on the 25th day of the defensive battle, the Great Xia frontline gained a great victory. Although the Bloodmouth Demon Monster was powerful, it was mainly powerful in terms of numbers as well as attack power. But now, the numbers were limited by the rules of the warkeeping, and the attack power was also limited by the thoughts that the literati kept putting out especially. All the advantages were just about finished being grammed, then he naturally turned from a big tiger into a small bug. It's hard to believe that this time, the best defense battle is going to fall on Great Xia's head again? Damn it, it's obvious that our pretty country has the best defense this time, we have the previous baton of defense fighters left behind, and the monsters on the opposite side we face with ease. But the Dixia side is again classically winning with less, and they're fighting with more and more ease. It's all because of these literati, how on earth did this country of Grand Xia have so many literati with such a strong will in that broken era back then? After seeing the current situation of Dixia, the populace of every other country in the world was also taught. From the beginning of the invasion of the 10,000 races, they had disparaged and mocked the Grand Xia. But now, Great Xia was the one who had captured the best once not to mention that it was even going to do it again. Then, what about those who had mocked Great Xia? Either they have been robbed of the best. Either that, or they are even already without a country that belongs to them. Prof. Win, there's still a follow-up to this third story of yours, isn't there? Dasha, Kyoto, Hospital, Ward. At this moment, Zhang Hanan was already not really concerned about the opinions of the people of other countries. She was now only concerned with her own front line and her own history. And just like her, the other people in the rear of Dasha right now also had the same mentality. Compared to fooling around back on the internet, they now still wanted to know a little bit more about the missing history of Dixia's past. 
After everyone finished reading Winning Tian's third article, it was obvious that they could feel that there was still a lot more to come after this, and then there were the literati, when Winning Tian wrote the first two articles, the netizens all felt that there was a little bit of content missing, as if one of the most crucial characters was missing. Right, Prof. Win, didn't you say to me when you wrote the second article on military reinforcement that there was also a very brilliant literati in that era, and was even called the Sword of Reform? Zhang Hanan suddenly thought of something. Lying on the hospital bed, Winning Sky was first stunned, and then he also couldn't help but laugh. Yeah, there's still a lot of content that I haven't made up yet. And then, saying that, Winning Sky was suddenly excited, Colden, what do you say I fill out the rest of the story as well as the literati that I haven't written about next as well? Great people shouldn't be forgotten, and great stories shouldn't be forgotten either. Granted, this stick of battlekeeping was enough for these forefathers conjured up at the moment. However, besides the most basic battlekeeping, some other things were also important. Forget it, although it is said that these remaining days I have little consumption of writing on my side, but if I really go to write more content, the people in the rear are the ones who will have to suffer along with me. A few seconds later, Winning Sky shook his head again, he felt that although he had no problem on his side, he had to consider the other people's side as well. Only, when the sky is not clear is that at this time the rear of the great summer populace, want to know the follow-up of the heart then he wants to send out the follow-up of the heart but also a hundred times more urgent. Damage some, in exchange for the integrity of history, this fucking blood earn good. And a person can't carry it, the big deal is that he put down his hand from the chest, and then let other Dasha people top. The people in the rear of Dasha can help win the sky to share the damage only for a few days. From the next baton onwards, everything would be back to business as usual. At this time when they can still contribute a little bit, and there is really a need for them to contribute. Winning Sky came with a sentence that said, don't hurt yourselves, and then didn't allow them to do anything else. This is even worse than killing them, right? In fact, now the people of Desia are all eager to try. It was just that they were afraid that even if they had their share, the damage on Winning Sky's side wouldn't be very small. That was why one by one didn't dare to show their heads at this moment. Professor Wen, in fact, as long as you're fine, we're definitely fine. Zhang Hanan timidly opened his mouth. Win Tian froze violently, me? I'm sure I'm fine, I've got you guys to share the damage, our Dasha's rear population is so large, what problem can I have, no problem at all. Then we have no problem either. Zhang Hanan responded very firmly. Being responded by Zhang Hanan like this, Winning Sky couldn't help but fall silent. After a few seconds, Winning Sky said, then you use my account to post a segment of content, and if everyone does think like you, then we'll continue. Good. Zhang Hanan was excited to the extreme. Not long after, Zhang Hanan picked up the computer and showed Win Tian the comments. Look, Professor Win, everyone thinks the same as me. Winning Sky fixed his eyes and looked. Sure enough, the populace in the rear of the Grand Xia was already crazy about wanting to strike. Then right, after reading the replies from the netizens. In the end, Winning Sky's aura of fervor came up. Previously, it was that the damage was too great for the divine consciousness body to carry. Now there was a constant stream of power behind it. Then what else was he afraid of? Great people and stories shouldn't be forgotten. They will all live again in everyone's memories. And the frontline battlefield, even if you're afraid of fewer people, you're still afraid of more people? Still relying on you. Winning Sky smiled and looked at Zhang Hanan. Zhang Hanan nodded, guaranteed to complete the mission. The two of them docked like this. At once. A new movement was also started right after the Great Xia's convenience to utilize this opportunity of others being able to share the damage. Tell all the stories of the other literati again as well? In the center sector, the old man learned of the news that Winning Sky had started writing texts again. After hearing this news, the old man only felt that everything was particularly marvelous. Obviously, before this, the Grand Xia had been in a state of crisis. And now, it was possible to go higher on the basis of winning battles. It could even be purely for the sake of learning about history. Well, in fact, after the baton. The Qing dynasty comes, and the people can share in the power of the damage dissipates. Dasha would then return to the difficult situation it was in before. But, then again, after. Him is finally after. The invasion of all races for so long, who is still not clear about the meaning of living in the present ah? The matter of the latter will be discussed later, and there is no way to think about it in a chaotic manner now. Since living in the present and having the ability, let the present be exciting enough first. Don't forget, if it's exciting enough, you can still get a bonus reward for being the best. Then let's start with the sharp sword that I didn't write. Inside the hospital room, the corner of Winning Sky's mouth spread with a smile. To Zhang Hanan, he said the title of that fourth augmentation article that came next. The Age of Awakening, if there is no torch flame after this, I am the only light. The strongest literati in the Republican era, there is no one. Whether it was his personal character, his actions, or the venom of his works, 
he was one of the most powerful writers of the Republican era. The one I am going to write about in this article is a sharp sword. During the dark time when Dasha was seriously ill, he had his moments of confusion. Brother Yukai, isn't it depressing for you to live here? Depressing is not only my house of mending trees, outside of the bookstore, those rotten odors are even worse, looking around ah, just feel that this society is really rotten, there is no cure at all. There was uncertainty. If an iron house, which has no windows and is difficult to break down, contains many sleeping people, who will soon be suffocated to death, but from sleep to death, they are totally unaware of the sorrow of death, and now you yell out, startling the more awake a few people, so that this unfortunate minority to suffer irremediable dying pains, you think that you can afford to do right to them? But, in the end, he still firmly raised the banner of ideological reform and saving Dasha. Who is the one who seeks medicine, and where is the medicine? I, we, and the words of the medicine are your great work, brother Yukai. I'll try. Abandoning medicine and turning to literature, pan and ink to quell evil. If we say that other literati in the Republican era focused more on ideas, then this one is thought and work, the pinnacle of both paths. There's a lot to write about next. Winning Sky spoke to Zhang Hanan. Zhang Hanan smiled, is it time to write about this gentleman's works, it's fine, I can type very fast. The exertion of retelling the works of a historical figure would be much less compared to directly retelling this person. This was also the reason why Winning Sky had finally decided to relitigate this person's works today after pondering for a moment. Well, in fact, the more important reason is that if we don't let this person's work reappear in the world, it will really make the world regret. The entirety of Diary of a Madman is 4,700 words. It wasn't a lot, but the power was enough. It was impossible for Winning Sky to retell all of this person's works. Therefore, he picked up the most classic one or two from it. The Diary of a Madman was undoubtedly one of the most classic ones that had to be on there. A certain gentleman Kuanjong, now hidden its name, are you in the past in the middle school when good friends, separated for many years, the news gradually queue. A few days ago occasionally heard that one of its great illness, suitable to return to his hometown, a detour to visit, then only met with one person, said the sick his brother also. When Winning Sky began to transmit his thoughts, the sound of the keyboard under Zhang Hanan's hand also became crisp and coherent once again. At the same time, while writing, Zhang Hanan was also conducting a self-serious reading of the article Diary of a Madman. The level of Diary of a Madman naturally did not need to be questioned, and the satirical reality and various words in its content made people's hairs stand up after reading it. So, the more right, Zhang Hanan's pupil is also cannot help but follow the put more and more big. I turn over the history of a check, this history has no age, crooked each leaf is written on a few words of benevolence, righteousness and morality, I can't sleep horizontally, carefully look at the middle of the night, only from the word seem to see the word, full of this is written in two words are, cannibalism, is it right that it has never been so? I may not be unintentionally, not eat my sister's pieces of meat, and now it's my turn, with 4000 years of cannibalism experience, although I didn't know, now I understand that it's hard to see the real people. Every sentence made Zhang Hanan thrilled. The moment the whole article was finished, Zhang Hanan realized that his hands were completely soaked with sweat from the shock. Impressive? Winning Sky inquired. Zhang Hanan swallowed a mouthful of saliva, too strong. That's why I'm wondering how this one will perform when he reaches the frontline battlefield. Winning Sky smiled and opened his mouth, then asked Zhang Hanan to finish as well as publish the article. Alright, rest and relax, we'll continue tomorrow. After writing the article, Zhang Hanan, who was already very tired, left the hospital room and returned to her own home. And after she returned home, the entire internet in the rear of Dasha was also already blowing up straight away. Cannibalism, this article is written in such a way that I have goosebumps all over my body. Ideological reform of the sword to raise the flag people? Too strong, too strong. Can I say, after reading this gentleman's life, my back is all sweaty now? Upon reading the fourth article on troop reinforcement in this third stick of winning sky, every single one of the people in the rear of the Grand Xia were all in awe. They looked at this gentleman's life over and over again. In the end, the eyes then all landed on. The paragraph that lay amongst the countless sheets of paper after this gentleman had finished writing the diary of a madman. Joe Shuorin, from now on it will be called, Lou Flood, the 26th day of the third stick of the invasion of the 10,000 races, early morning, there was one more literati on the front line of Dixia, unlike other literati, shuttling through the battlefield to frantically impose an iron wall of thought for the warriors, this man of letters finally chose his favorite attack, a sharp sword is a sharp sword, no matter how many times I come, I'll always be the one charging, on the battlefield, seeing the newly revived old friend of the literati, Flood, the corners of the other literati's mouths were flooded with faint smiles. Iron wall of thought we will add to the warriors. So, give the opposite side some color, you'd sigh. Tell those monsters. We, the literati, can not only defend, but also attack. 
The power of civil war itself was not just fixed on defense, it was only that the benefits of defense outweighed attack before. That was why the literati had all chosen to defend. But now, there were already enough literati who were able to release the iron wall of thought. So attacking and whatnot was also possible for a bit. Not to mention, Lu Flood itself was the greatest good at attacking. Different literati performed differently after acquiring the power of literary warfare. Lu Shun was such a poisonous sword. After obtaining the power of literary battle, the means of attack that it can show is definitely able to amaze the world. And the truth, it is also true. At the time when the blood mouth demon monsters came to invade once again, the battle on the frontline battlefield of Grand Xia was also followed by another touch and go. And in everyone according to the original routine you to and fro, perseverance to defend the battle time. Lu Shun, on the other hand, directly transformed a brush in his hand, and countless sheets of blank paper. He didn't stand at the very back, nor did he stand at the very front, he was right in the center of the battlefield. He brought a table and a chair from somewhere. In the battle, blood spurting, humans and monsters cluttering the picture to the extreme. It was as if the spot he was in was isolated out, quiet and empty. It's about to start? A scribe passed by as he traveled through the battlefield. Lu Sheng nodded, it's been so long since I've used a pen again, I don't even feel comfortable with it. You have to get used to it, or else if there's a monster you missed later, you'll be warping on the spot. That's all I'm saying, hurry up and leave me alone, I'm going to start. Yukai cheer, Yukai is the best, Yukai is our little pride. I said go. Hey, why are you still moving your legs? Only after driving a certain person away did Lu Flood pick up his pen again. With that, he glanced at the army of bloodmouthed demonic monsters in front of him that were forced to retreat by the warriors. Burying his head, Lu Shun began his writing. He wrote quickly, the ink variously splashing on the blank paper. And when he formally started writing, countless visions were directly revealed on the battlefield. That was one knife after another that was transformed into ink. After the ink knives appeared, Lu Sheng didn't pay any attention to them, he just continued writing. And these ink knives of his? After they appeared, then they also attacked the bloodmouth demon monsters on their own. Put. One of the ink knives slashed into a bloodmouth demon monster with unerring precision. Immediately, that bloodmouth demon monster turned into blood mist on the spot and dissipated into the battlefield. So strong. At the back, the people of Grand Xiao were all watching Lu Zun's maneuver at the moment. Upon seeing that the ink blade it materialized was actually so powerful, everyone was uncontrollably stunned. One must know that the current blood mouth demon monsters were version 2. Zero. They had vines on their bodies, and their defense was greatly increased from before. On the warrior's side, they basically had to fight many times before they could decapitate one. This is just the beginning. Inside the ward, Winning Sky also saw this scene. However, he didn't feel that this was all that Lu Flood had to offer. And the truth, indeed, was pretty much what he thought. Along with the increasing completeness of Lu Flood's article, the content that the ink around him transformed into also became more and more powerful. First it was a sword, then a tiger, and in the end, it actually became a huge monster with an open mouth. Cripes, isn't this damn thing one of those monsters from across the street? There's still a difference, this one on our side is way bigger than them. Seeing this last scene, the people at the rear of Grand Xia all had their mouths wide open. As for the front line, the situation wasn't really much better. Whether it was on the side of the Great Xia Warkeeper or the opposite side of the Bloodmouth Demon Monster. One by one, after this ink monster appeared, all of them directly began to tremble. Yukai, what the hell is this? A literati came to Lu Shun's side. Lu Flood was silent, I don't know, I just wanted to use ink to make some monsters that are the same as the opposite side, but when I did it, I suddenly realized that there was a road in front of me, so I just kept on making it, kept on making it. You called their mom? Lu Flood coughed, I get out of these is still ink after all, there is no who shouted to say. Sensei what it is, you see now in front of the line, this fucking opposite the monsters directly all began to tremble, and even some are beginning to run back. Lu's son. The rear of the whole Dashia. The rear of other countries that came to peek at the screen. Yes, as outrageous as it was, that's what the frontline battlefield of Dashia had become right now. Directly after the appearance of the gigantic bloodmouth demon monster that Lu Sung had wielded with his pen, the army of bloodmouth demon monsters on the opposite side of the battlefield all turned their direction and left. Before that, people had imagined what the first battle would be like after Lu Sun's appearance. However, no matter how much they thought about it, they could never have imagined that he would be the one to dominate the attack of the monsters on the other side. Yukai, I really love you. Yukai is the strongest, Yukai is the best, Yukai is our little pride. Damn it, this is too damn dramatic. On the 26th day of the third rod of the 10,000 races invasion, after the first round of invasion by the bloodmouth demon monsters in the early morning ended like this, on the frontline battlefield, all the people started cheering. 
As for the rear, the people of Great Xia were all on the verge of going crazy with joy as well. Mr. Lu Flood won't really shout out the opposite of mom, right? If it's not mom, it's dad. Does this count as one person blocking a round of invasion from the opposite side? It shouldn't count, but it does, and it doesn't, well, it still counts. All in all, after appearing in the first battle, Lu Sung brought a huge surprise to the people. And then, after some time, the second round of invasion by the Bloodmouth Demon Monsters began. Just like the previous round, this time, Lu Shun used ink to transform a huge Bloodmouth Demon Monster again. But it was obvious that the same method couldn't be used twice, and it seemed that they had already been reprimanded by their real mothers, and this time, these Bloodmouth Demon Monsters finally recognized what was real and what was fake. Poof. The huge demonic monster formed by the ink pounced on a dozen or so bloodmouth demonic monsters at once, and in an instant, all of these dozen or so bloodmouth demonic monsters also became blood mist. Lu Sun, well, recognized or not, it's actually all the same. It was already not weaker than the opposite side of the Great Summer Front. Now with the added strength of Lu Flood. Unsurprisingly, the day's defensive battle was a big success. Defending the next day again. On the front line, all the pioneer warriors were engaged in cheering. In the rear, the people of Dashia were also happy. However, while they were happy, they were the ones who had other things to do. That was to continue following Winning Sky to retrieve more memories. As a matter of fact, after watching the first battle of the Lu Flood defense during the day, Winning Sky's side then also continued to start a new writing, and those ancestors that he had newly summoned up, all of them had already logged onto the battlefield in the following days. At that moment, Winning Sky was in the middle of his second writing of the day. There were only a few days left until the end of the third baton of the defensive battle. In these few days, the front line basically had no problem in defending the battle. Then what Winning Sky needed to consider on his side was how to utilize these remaining days to tell as many stories of the Republic of China literati who had been erased by the 10,000 races as possible during the time when others could still follow him and share the consumption. Can everyone stand it? Zhang Hanan appeared to have caught a cold last night and did not arrive due to illness. The one who helped Winning Sky write today was the bodyguard in front of the ward door, Zhu Chang'an. I can withstand it, we have a lot of people in Dasha. Zhu Chang'an opened his mouth very firmly, if you can't bear it, put your hand down and don't participate. Okay, then continue. Winning Sky grinned. Just like that, the next few days were basically spent in such a pattern. Relying on the special sharing power that Dasha's national consciousness had exchanged for self-sleep. Winning Sky managed to spend these last few days in the third stick of the battle guard. As far as possible, he reproduced all the literary content of the Republic of China that had been erased by the 10,000 races. All sorts of historical stories reappeared in this world with everyone joining hands. As for the frontline battlefield, along with the appearance of more and more new literati, as well as the re-editions added by the new Fenghua stories to the literati that had already appeared, everyone was becoming smoother and smoother on the path against the Bloodmouth Demon Monster. This day was the 30th day of the third stick of the 10,000 clans invasion. The month of each installment of the Battle Guard Relay would be 30 days, not 29 or 31. Therefore, when this day's Battle Guard ended, the task of the Great Summer Republic's forefathers after their revival would also be considered finished. They, surprisingly, defended it again? The Blood Mouth Mother Emperor, even she didn't manage to deal with them? Somewhere in space and time, the three members of the Heaven's Eye Eight-Armed Clan, Sun Zitao, who had previously faced off against the Grand Xia, after realizing the current situation of Earth's Dasha, all of them couldn't hold back and enlarged the pupils of the third eye above their heads. To know, in the blood mouth mother emperor descended, they are directly made a big summer will be finished judgment. These literati in Dissia's baton are really outrageous, even changing the situation of the entire front line with their own strength. No wonder Lord Wanju wants to erase some of the history on earth, these characters are indeed difficult to deal with after they don't erase their existence, revive and then get special editions. So it's this Professor Win again, without him these characters wouldn't have reappeared. All three of Hun Zito fell into silence. Then, Hun raised his head, however, after this wave, Dasha is actually considered to have suffered a huge damage, after all, their national consciousness. Tao, the stoic people coalesced to create a stoic national consciousness, and this stoic national consciousness ultimately protected these stoic people at the cost of sacrificing themselves. Zay, at this moment, the blood mouth mother emperor should be very suffocating, clearly being exceptionally powerful himself, but being just the right powerful point to not be able to play, with the rules restricting the number of his subordinates, and the opposite side of the literati just restricting the characteristics of his subordinates themselves. Hold back? The blood mouths have no brains. The three of them, Hun Zito, glanced at each other and all laughed helplessly. But in this way, it seems that we lost in the first place is even less of a loss. Yeah, after all, the blood mouth mother emperor didn't even capture this country when she descended. Passing through time and space, looking towards the distant earth, 
The three of them laughed and talked for a long time, and after laughing and talking, in turn, they then also then resumed seriously analyzing the Great Xia's battlekeeping journey. This stick, Great Xia's firm defense actually had an element of luck in it, their literati just happened to restrain the opposite side's bloodmouth mother emperor, and their national consciousness was also sacrificed in this stick. So what about the next bat, will they be so lucky in the next bat? Or rather, will they have anyone else to stand up for them in the next bat? The upper side of the 10,000 races erased part of Earth's history. So this erased part of history can be considered an accident. But the problem is that the next, all the contents of the Qing dynasty period of Daxia, the upper echelons of the 10,000 races did not do anything to erase it, did they? And in the absence of erasure, all of the specific content that they have shown, it seemed that they simply didn't have the ability to be able to hold on to their country's gates anymore either. So, this time, it really should be over. Hoon let out a breath and made another judgment. But unlike in the past, this time, he was a bit vain again when he let out his words. It couldn't be helped, it was really because the first two bats were full of confidence every time, and the result that came each time was too ugly. So even though the situation was like this, he would be ridiculously less confident because of Dasha's first two bats. He always think, win the sky in big summer, and can make what new tricks to. Of course, this is also on the earth, Winning Heaven does not know their analysis at this moment to talk about. Otherwise, Winning Sky would definitely be shouting in his heart, I myself don't know what else I can do. Whether it was during the War of Resistance, or the Republic of China, or even the Ming Dynasty and all the ones further up, Winning Sky had the opportunity to strike at the back of the field and change the situation at the front line. But the Qing Dynasty, the only Qing Dynasty is the biggest exception, because the Qing Dynasty simply does not exist in the missing content, and Winning Day simply does not need to write a troop increase article to add firewood to it. I can't get out of the way, but the problem is that there's a high probability that the Qing dynasty, even if it's intact, won't be able to keep the next stick down. Before the end of the ROC's time to keep the war, everyone was able to live in the moment and not look at the next bat first. But today, the war-keeping mission of the Republican pioneers is over. Hark in turmoil. This was winning Sky's mood today. However, the successful keeping of the current bat was a good thing after all. At a time when the whole country was cheering and happy. Winning Sky felt that it was better for him not to disturb the atmosphere. The rest period for the handover of the two bats this time was still five days. Every rest period was the time when people were most relaxed. Therefore, this time, Winning Sky also relaxed with everyone for two days first. After all, there wasn't much use for him even if he didn't relax. There was really no way to think even if he thought about it. Moreover, after the end of this stick frontline guard battle in the Republic of China, the connection between Winning Sky and the people of Daxia was also gone. This made Winning Sky even more as if a bird had lost its arms. Things have come to a head, let's eat first. Paper drunk, but not quite paper drunk. After all, Winning Sky's person was still in the hospital room. One could only say that he ate a bit more in the next two days. So round and round I can still only fret. Lying on the hospital bed all day long one could only think about this and that. Going round and round. Not wanting to go back to the next bat seemed to be simply impossible as well. Worrying about the next bat? On the third day of the rest period, the old man came to the hospital, seeing Winning Sky who was staring out the window in a daze. The old man softly inquired, worrying that the next bat won't be able to keep down. Winning Sky shook his head, indeed, I'm worried, yet I don't have any thoughts to help. The old man, indeed, the history of our Qing dynasty is complete, you do not need to make any additions. Winning Sky skimmed his lips, however. The difficult point at the moment is that Qing the dynasty is really an era with the lowest degree of splendor in our country, he is too humiliating. Are you worried that the grace bonus they received after their revival is too low to face foreign enemies? The old man inquired. Winning Sky sighed, that's one, and the second is that I'm worried that some of them simply won't be able to defend the battle for the sake of their descendants, and, have no guardianship for the country of Dixia. The old man, just like some of the warlords in the third stick? Winning Sky replied, yes, this is indeed possible. The old man coughed. Winning Sky was helpless, it's not possible, but it's a certainty, and the number of those who abandon the battle will definitely be much more than the number of runaway warlords in the third baton. The old man fell into silence. As a matter of fact, what Winning Sky had thought about they had also thought about these days. But the result was just exactly the same as Winning Sky, clueless. But the Qing dynasty's overall level of splendor is low though. But it is ultimately a dynasty. There are still quite a few bloodthirsty people present in it after all. The old man grew more and more depressed, and at that moment, it instead became Winning Sky to comfort him. Winning Sky continued to speak, these people, they should be able to hold out for a dozen days. Just ten days? The old man inquired. Winning Sky nodded, eh, that's still on the bright side, after all, the battle power of the 10,000 races side is also rising, 
We're not really sure what kind of terrifying existence we're going to face in the next baton right now. All of a sudden, the old man became even more depressed. He had obviously thought of all these things before, but now that it came out of Winning Sky's mouth, the feeling after hearing it was really completely different again. After all, Winning Sky was the one who continuously created miracles for Desya, and now even he, the Lord of Miracles, was depressed and didn't know what to do. In this way, an old man and a young man stayed in silence in the hospital room for a long time. After a long time, the old man raised his head. Perhaps, the best performance bonus given by the third bat can work? Compete strongly for the best performance bonus with the best performance. Then pick the most correct bonus attribute with a reasonable choice. This is inherently part of the battle of the keepers. But the question is, what kind of plus attribute can save Dasha's next at bat? At least none of the three add-ons that appeared last time were able to change the situation. At most, they could only make the frontline warriors go from defending the next 10 days to defending the next 13 days. Even if it was the cumulative power that had appeared so far, which many people considered to be the strongest. That cumulative object is also counted from the next stick. That is to say, after the fight, the Qing dynasty's defend the warfighters can accumulate to the Ming dynasty then use. For the next stick of the Qing dynasty itself, it can't play a big role at all. Is it possible that we can't even get the best on the third bat? The old man's eyes suddenly widened. Winning Sky was silent. Then you can push me out the window right now. Facts. Dasha's current situation was not that miserable. Although there was a lot to worry about. But there was still no need to worry about who the best performance would fall to. There was no specific time for the best performance plus to descend. But on the fourth day of the rest period. It was still very accurate and gave successfully landed in Dasha. Yes, it was Dasha. This time, it no longer fell on Winning Sky alone. But thinking about it, the second batting was purely winning Sky alone saving the day at the back of the field, but the third batting was something everyone had all contributed to, so it was only natural that the list of bonus choices would revert back to the front of the entire population. What will it be? Winning Sky only hoped that a more powerful best performance plus would come, so that the fourth batting Qing Dynasty's war defenders could hold on for seven, eight, or nine more days. As for what came after that again, one could only say that they would go back to thinking hard about something else. When the bonus option landed, but no specifics had appeared yet, almost the entire populace of the rear of Dasha was of the same mindset. They basically didn't have any illusions that this one addition would completely solve the situation at the front. However, when the specific content of the three additions chosen this time was revealed, the entire rear of the Grandsia, all the people were all stunned. The greenish-blue insubstantial scroll floated in front of everyone in the rear of the Grandsia, only to see that there were three specific options for additions written on it, which were 1. In the subsequent round of defending battles, all of the defending dead souls in the front line of Great Xia will have an additional life added to them. 2. In all subsequent rounds of defending battles, the defending dead souls of the Great Xia front line will receive an additional 100% speed bonus in addition to the wind and elegance bonus. 3. In the subsequent round of defensive battles, the rear of Great Xia can send a support unit for the front line every day, and the support unit can only enjoy one-tenth of the front line's bonus, composition of the support unit, half freely chosen, half randomly selected. Three additions, all of them different from last time. They were called, the power of life, the power of speed, and the power of support. Among them, the power of life was very strong. However, it was also the stronger the stronger, and the weaker ones were only boosted a little, which didn't do much for Dasha. As for the power of speed, he was the long-lasting type, which was helpful for all the relays behind him. But for the next baton of Dasha, it was just like scattering bottles of water in the desert, with low significance. However, throwing away these two choices. The next third edition, Power of Support, could have a different meaning to Dasha. Power of Support, it actually allows people to be sent from the rear, to support the front line. The number of warriors that can be supported per day is variable, a minimum of 50,000 and a maximum of 300,000. This ability was strong, very strong, and was definitely like a divine power for the current Dasha. Choose this, absolutely no mistakes. The moment they saw this addition choice, the eyes of all the people in the back of the entire Grand Xia turned bright. Seriously, if this addition was utilized well, maybe the next baton of Great Xia would really be able to survive. It's just a pity that under the powerful effect of this addition, but it also has a powerful limitation. The rear can send soldiers to support the front line is certainly a good thing, but the soldiers sent there can only enjoy one-tenth of the front line style bonus. To know, to the front line of the various weapons itself damage is also basically removed, can cause damage to the 10,000 races is also the main damage is the style of addition to cohesion into the personal chi. The degree of elegance when the Qing dynasty existed, can give the fourth stick when they defend the battle to bring the bonus itself is low. Now that the warriors in the rear had gone over, it was amazing that they could still only enjoy a tenth of their elegance bonus. 
This isn't even about winning against the strong with the weak anymore, this is to battle a fierce beast with the attitude of a bug. Moreover, on top of that, the composition of the support force was also very difficult for people to bear. It's surprisingly going to be divided into two parts, a part of the free choice of the object sent, the other part, but to be randomly selected. In other words, after choosing this ability, the support troops that would be sent to the front line every day would definitely not be all the soldiers currently serving in the rear of Grand Xia. The ordinary people, too, would all be part of the war guard. The pros are outstanding, and so are the cons, so. Inside the ward, Winning Sky looked at the options in front of him and thought carefully. However, before he could fully make a decision, the scroll in front of him was then also already prompting him that his choice was finalized. 98% of the Great Xia's rear personnel have chosen the power of support. And the remaining 2%? It wasn't that they were afraid of going to the front line themselves, so they didn't dare to make a choice. They were just like winning Sky, they just hadn't gotten around to pressing that select button yet. Everyone, still really fast ah. Lying on the hospital bed, regarding everyone's quick decision. Winning the Sky with tears in the corner of his eyes, the whole person is wanting to cry and want to laugh. Just like the predecessor's recovery is to go to the death. At the moment the rear of the everyone choose this choice, but can only be one tenth of the style bonus on the battlefield behavior, is to send death and the send death. But in the end, they still resolutely and directly chose this choice, simply because this one addition, most likely to help Great Xia to defend the next stick. Or still, they really wanted to do something for too long. Even if they could only enjoy a tenth of the bonus. Even if in the past it really was just a matter of piling up the time to defend the battle with their lives. But to be able to do something, to be able to guard their own country on their own. For them, it was already enough to be lucky. Next stop, the savior of the backfield will no longer be me. Rather, it will be everyone in the backfield. Kyoto, inside the hospital room. Winning Sky took a deep breath. At this moment, he was already thinking about the contents of the subsequent front line. Originally, he thought that the power of addition would only add a little effect. However, he didn't want it to actually give Disya a path to break the situation. Although, this path was really very painful to walk. But there is no way out. In addition to that, there is really no other way. As long as we can defend Dasha, no matter what, it's all worth it. The forefathers on the front line were able to recover and sacrifice again for Dasha. Then there wasn't much to lament about everyone going to sacrifice here. All for the sake of Dasha, our Dasha will not die. The matter of the entire population of Dasha making the next choice was soon spread abroad as well. When they had previously learned that the Qing dynasty of Dasha was about to take over the Baton, the people of certain countries were mocking. But now, seeing that the people in the rear of Dasha had resolutely chosen the option of sending themselves to their deaths, these people who like to ridicule, also as all of a sudden have retreated. Although there were a lot of disputes in various countries, this kind of firm choice to die was really not to be mocked. The fifth day of the rest period, night. The old man sat beside Winning Sky's hospital bed, chatting. They were chatting about the details of the power of support. Choosing an option didn't mean that there was nothing else to do. Under a simple option, there are many other things but there are many other things. These will be shown on the scroll only after the selection is made. For example, support troops don't have to be assembled together, a voice will appear in their ears every morning when they want to go out, and as long as they choose to do so, they will go directly to the front line. Then, the randomly selected portion of the population in the support unit can be replaced by blood relatives who will go to the front. Finally, if the chosen person does not wish to go to the front line, they can refuse on their own, and others will not learn that they are the chosen person or that they have made a refusal, but as an effect, a variable number of support fighters going to the front line will be subjected to a randomized negative impact. Do you think there will be a lot of people who were chosen and refused to go to the front line? Anyway, no one else knows that they were selected as well as carried out the refusal. Winning Sky looked towards the old man, and the old man also looked towards Winning Sky. Immediately afterward, both of them all smiled uncontrollably. This question did not need to be answered, they already both had the answer in their hearts. The soldiers of Great Xia are ready. In the first baton of the dead near, modern military people guarding the battle, they were all already itching to watch, and now, they were also finally getting the chance to personally go on the field to guard their own country. The old man spoke to Winning Sky, who nodded his head, wanting to make a reply. However, he didn't want to wait for him to speak, but in the next second, a treble came from outside the door in a cold manner. I'll be there too. The person who raised his voice was Zhu Chang'an, his fighting spirit was high. Winning Sky cried and laughed, is that so? Then you'll have to live to relay with the next baton. Why? Zhu Chang'an was puzzled. Winning Sky replied, you'll know when the time comes. The fourth day of the rest period between the third and fourth batons of the 10,000 races invasion. The rear of the Grand Xia completed the specific selection of the best performance bonus for their side. 
and at the same time, the new handover of the front line of each country had finally begun. The undead forefathers of the fourth bat of each country collectively revived in a magnificent scene. Among them, Dashia even ushered in the peak of their frontline warrior numbers. After all, until now, the Qing dynasty is the only one whose history is completely complete. Neither the handiwork of certain internal feints, nor the chaos of the 10,000 races, the entire once great Qing dynasty, can be on the field now basically all the people on the field. Soldiers, high-ranking officials, literati, eunuchs, and even some famous concubines. As for the populace, although their stories were not too much known to the people in the rear of Dasha today, it was because the entire history of the Qing dynasty had been restored to a certain extent. So as a gift, it was also directly revived extremely much, but of course, it was impossible to revive all of them as all. Well, actually these are not the focus, the real focus is. By this stick, the historical figures of various countries ranked at the imperial level are also finally able to make their debut. Qing dynasty and it's after the various times of the emperor level characters, pressure does not need to win the sky to tell their stories again, when the current people in the rear of the great summer, itself for them are also all understand. The reason why they know, when the war is being defended, these people have not appeared, just because the first few rods have restrictions, just like the 10,000 races are limited to the number of rounds of invasion per day, the various countryside is also limited to only soldier level general level characters can appear on the scene. Now, that restriction has finally been lifted. Because of the time that has passed, naturally, the imperial characters of the previous batons are still unable to appear, but the imperial characters belonging to the former Qing dynasty can now all appear one by one. 12 emperors, each with a different style. Heaven's Mandate, Tianzong, Xuanji, Kangxi, Yongzheng, Qianlong. Each of them carried a faint golden glow on their bodies, highlighting the difference between them and the others who were revived out of the front line at the moment. Revive and defend the battle? Among them, Emperor Yongzheng was the first to open his eyes. Basically every emperor during the Qing dynasty was assigned to a different guardian battle at the moment. In the case of the Yongzheng emperor, his guardian battle number was 7. At this time, Lu Flood was here. He wasn't here originally, but he came here for a day to help with the battle. In the end, then he also stayed here. He he, the emperor has come out. Lu Shong glanced at Yong Zhang, his attitude couldn't be said to be good or bad. Since I've come out, I'll tell you about the situation on the front line. Characters resuscitated in history at the front line, all gained a lot of memories. Then, add in the retellings of the warriors who didn't leave in the first stick. Basically, for the entire front line all would also be all known. In short, it's that these country gates will be under your control next. This is also the country that you once stayed in, so no matter how much has happened since history, now that you have appeared at the front line, the only thing you need to think about is how to protect him, got it? After recounting all the circumstances, Lu Xiong added this sentence in a very serious manner. Listening to Lu Sun's words, Emperor Yongzhang was silent for a few seconds and finally nodded his head fiercely. I will. Yongzheng said extremely seriously, we will. Lu Sheng narrowed his eyes and swept Yongzheng twice. In the end, he directly turned his head. Come on, I actually believe in you guys, your promises aren't worth anything at all. At this moment, Lu Flood's tone is really not very good, questioning the strength of the even fast broke through the sky. But to really say that the heart, for the eyes of this, Lu Flood in fact, were slightly put a little heart. After all, the entire Qing dynasty, the best reputation is this. How about other emperors is not clear, but this should be able to let people rest assured. If by then, this are running away. Then the next stick without much ado, directly declared defend war failed on the line. The 10,000 clans? What a bully. During the conversation between Lu Sheng and Yong Zhang, the other side, the other guardian stations of the Qing dynasty were all in a state of shock. On the other hand, the Qing dynasty other various guardian station and the emperor also woke up. After learning all about the situation, each and every one of these emperors was in a fighting mood. Facing the fighters from the previous baton. Like Yong Zhang, they all made a vow that they would absolutely protect Dasha. Are these people really good? Guardian battle number 4. A literati came to the corner after dealing with Emperor Kangxi of the Qing dynasty. In the corner, sat another Republic of China literati, at least the number of people is much more than us, and it's really complete, the eunuchs are all here. Say, do all these eunuchs back people really know each other, how can they come out too? Don't have to know them completely, a lot of small people are able to come out incidentally, unless it's a big role. There must be at least a few tens of thousands of people who probably know a little bit of its story, otherwise, Basically they all know that there's such a group as well as the group's approximate actions, and they can all come out with it as well. Just like our previous military fighters, it's not possible for every soldier to have a whole bunch of people behind them who really understand ah, basically, follow the group will also be able to all come out. The two literati conversed a bit, and eventually the line of sight again all fell on the front of them, the emperor whose title was Kangxi. Are these people really okay? The literati who had first inquired, 
asked once again at that moment. Listening to its question, the other literati was silent for a few seconds, and eventually nodded down fiercely. The wind at the front line was getting stronger and stronger, whipping up sand all over the sky. After that, it was unknown whether it was because the wind and sand were too strong or because of something else. The Great Summer Front Line The remaining warriors from the third stick from before, all of them were a bit unable to see the road ahead. Next, these people of the Qing Dynasty is really okay? I'm afraid, it's no. I don't want to talk about will or anything else, it doesn't make much sense. If we just look at the strength, I'm afraid that these people from the Qing Dynasty won't be able to compete with the 10,000 clans. The strength of the 10,000 races is getting stronger as they go on. On the other hand, on the side of Grand Xia, although it was said that the number of warriors on the front line was finally getting bigger. However, the era style bonus they received had become considerably lower. They can't. This was the final judgment of the collective of the remaining third stick warriors on the front line. But what about? After judging? Running to say loudly that you guys can't, we're done? In addition to disturbing the military center of gravity and pulling the negative emotions full circle, it was afraid that it was meaningless. So, now in fact is not the Qing dynasty these people in the end cannot put the next stick guard down the matter. Rather, no matter whether they can or can't, everyone can only believe in them and think that they can do it. Null. Holy hearing spirit? This time, does Xia has to face him? An unknown distant time and space. As before. The three heavens I eight armed clan geniuses who had suffered defeat at the hands of Di Xia. Sun Zitao's trio habitually observed the great Xia frontline once again. And this time, when they saw that the enemy that Da Xia had to face was actually this one, Sun Zitao three people also could not help but open their mouths wide again. What is going on with this country? How can it be so unlucky as this? It was fine for the third bat to face the blood mouth mother emperor. Now it's great that the super brain intelligence angels are here. The three of them, San Zitao, glanced at each other. Immediately afterward, all of them fell silent. And it's still this monster, the Holy Listening Spirit. Holy Listening Spirit, was a name. The super brain intelligence angel itself was a very strong existence. And the sacred hearing spirit, in turn, was the greatest genius of the younger generation of this race. It seems that what Lord Manji is jealous of is really this country. The invasion had proceeded until now, and the three of them, whom Zito, were completely certain. Prior to this, the higher-ups had been targeting Earth to erase all sorts of history. For the sake of, should be the big summer, Yen Hua this country. So, they then above us really have a very strong history? Strong enough that Lord Wan Ji has to lead the senior management to make all kinds of means to prevent it. Strong enough that Lord Manji is crazy enough to want to fuck them up before then. Hoon bristled, his gaze falling back to the front lines of the other nations of Earth. To be honest, the story up to this point. The rank of the 10,000 races commanders that the countries had to face were all no longer low. Among them, in terms of intensity, it wasn't as if there were none that were more powerful than Grand Xia's side. However, among this batch of undersiders that had managed to come in by breaking through the restrictions, the super brain intelligence angel might not be the strongest existence in terms of strength. However, it was definitely the existence that was most targeted at the Grand Xia. This kind of targeting had even reached a somewhat deliberate level. He is like for Dasha, oh no. Accurately said is for the great summer Qing dynasty specially customized to come to the enemy like. Moreover, he is really disgusting. In the same battle, if the end itself could only end in death, then everyone would definitely not choose to die under the super brain intelligence angel. This thing, he has a lot of sickening stuff in his head. He loves to torture people. Dasha, just how strong is the history that is missing on the way up? The sight of the 10,000 races in the preliminary memory attack, the erasure of documents. After the official invasion began, it is even more deliberate targeting. Moreover, when you think about it, the rules of war that the universe has set up to protect the earth, the specific division of the relay period, it seems to be completely in accordance with the great summer side. Previously, whether it was the human side, or below the top level of the 10,000 races, no one understood the specifics of each bat. Everyone didn't understand what the specific division of each baton was. 100 years, or what? Or maybe it was according to modern times, World War II, World War I and then onward? Now, they understood that the punctuation point of this relay was Dasha. All sorts of things eventually brought the spotlight down on Dasha. This made the Hun Zito trio. For a moment. It was also impossible to stop wondering about Great Xia's previous history. What a mess, I don't know how it's divided. At the same time, on Earth. Some of the residents of the country's rear that still existed. All of them also noticed the issue of the specific division of the time to defend the war relay. However, unlike Sun Zitao who had learned more about it, they wouldn't think that Dashia was actually very tough. There must be some more specific rules of division that they didn't understand. The inhabitants of each country were deceiving themselves in this way. 
Afterward, they could even say, this side of Dashia is really happy. Directly is stuck with a hand of complete waste of the Qing dynasty recovery out of the war. He he. Dashia, Kyoto, inside the hospital room. Winning Sky swiped the comments of some people from other countries on the internet. Skimming his lips, he could only say that these people were still living in a dream. The war of the guards had been going on until now. He was also the one who had already fully confirmed the specific division rules. Or rather, from the beginning, he clearly felt that. The era to which each stick of the battlefield is divided is the era to which the great Xia side of the battlefield is divided. It was the dynasty on this side of Grand Xia. Of course, this is not necessarily a good thing. Right now, for example, such a division looks bad. Qing dynasty, through and through. Only the Qing dynasty, with such a dynasty as the boundary. Recovering out warriors to guard the gates of Great Xia, the success rate of being able to hold on to it really wasn't high. But then again, it's still the same old saying. Before there was a fight. No matter what, one could only encourage and believe first. What if the 10,000 races on the opposite side of the Great Xia were not strong this time? What if this time, the Great Xia just got through it easily? Then, the world will know who is the protagonist. The fourth day of the truce. Every place had its own story. And winning sky here. He was still unclear about the terror of the new enemy on the other side. Spring. Is here? Time continued to pass. It seemed like only a breath was taken. Another day had already passed. The fifth day of the truce. A strange thing happened on the front line of Great Xia. That is a change from the usual bloody sadness. The environment on its side suddenly became beautiful. The wind and sand are gone, and the ground has become green. And countless fragrant and beautiful flowers bloomed. Are those flying butterflies? It's so beautiful. Rainbow, it's a rainbow. When this scene appeared before the eyes, whether it was the front line or the rear, the entire Grand Xia, or the entire world, all of them were dumbfounded. Just such a place, you couldn't even call it a battlefield at all. What was the front line like before in Grand Xia including other countries at the moment? Although the corpses of the 10,000 race demon monsters and the battle guards would dissipate after they died, but the blood spilled in battle wouldn't dissipate. Wind and sand filled the sky, blood flowed into rivers, and not an inch of grass was left to grow. This was what the frontline battlefields of various countries truly looked like after the invasion of the 10,000 races. However, right now, what is this on the front line of Great Xia? Is it hard to believe that our side will be without enemies for another 10 days? And then 10 days later, a bunch of outrageous demonic monsters will come directly? With the previous experience, people wouldn't foolishly take this as a good thing nowadays. Thus, the first day of the fourth stick of the 10,000 races invasion had yet to officially arrive. Before the first day of the fourth baton of the invasion of the 10,000 races had even officially arrived, the people at the back of the Great Xia, the front line, had already entered a state of wartime one step ahead of the other countries. Nothing happened. After the environment at the front line changed, the spirits of the people at the front and back of the Grand Xia began to tighten. In the second half of the fifth day of the truce period, there were no other changes on the front line of the Grand Xia, but everyone was still unable to relax. After all, no one really believed that there was nothing special inside such a strange sight. And so, this tension continued until the first day of the fourth baton of the 10,000 races invasion officially began. The 10,000 clans are coming. Early in the morning on a new day, in the seventh guardian battle, Emperor Yongzheng squinted his eyes and looked into the distance, faintly making such a statement. Hearing his words, the Qing dynasty battle guards who belonged to the same station as him, Station 7, also all perked up their spirits. Among them, there were many characters that could be named. What kind of dynasty was the Qing dynasty? When it comes to this dynasty, I am afraid that all the people of Dixia will feel incomparable shame. Because the shortcomings of this dynasty are too many, and the black spots brought to the history of Daxia are also too many. Garbage to the extreme. This was the collective evaluation of the Daxia Qing dynasty by many people at home and abroad. But now, the new era of elegance that has finally fallen on the front line seems to have confirmed this point once again. Now, the people of the Qing dynasty resurfaced on the front line of Daxia, and the style bonus they received was so pitiful that it was hard to see. Daxia's second and third batons also did not receive much in the way of style bonus, but even then, the light that was shown after they received it was also something. Simply won't be like Qing dynasty, weak to such a point. How can you insult my Qing dynasty like this? The second guardian battle, the one assigned here was Emperor Qianlong. In the entire Qing dynasty, if one were to say which emperor was the most arrogant, it was none other than Qianlong. Therefore, when he perceived that the specific style bonus they received was so little, the emperor's face directly turned into a pig's liver color on the spot. Similarly, and Qianlong the same ugly face, there are many other emperors of the Qing dynasty. Even Yongzhang can accept a lot of criticism of Yongzhang, also some slightly unable to bear. If you were more competitive yourself, how could you usher in insults? 
When Emperor Qianlong was angry, a person suddenly stood out beside him. Fixed eyes to see, that person is not the previous refused to win the sky Ren Gong who can be? Ren Gong Liang Qi mocking, a person who had made significant contributions to both the Qing dynasty and the Republic of China in Dasha. At this moment, he looked at Emperor Qianlong, the late period was weak to the extreme, constantly ceding land and making reparations. As for the early period, there were good times, but overall yet it was just a golden jade outside and a corrupt, boastful and arrogant thing. Such an era, can't get much of the era style edition, this point, is not you guys before, are still confused can't figure out, reasoning is not clear? Being Ren Gong so scolded on, Qianlong only feel more suffocated, what are you? Do I need you to educate? Ren Gong shook his head and smiled, then, he did not speak again. Seeing that Duke Ren no longer took care of himself, Qianlong also eased himself up and accepted the facts of the moment. Or rather, in fact, after they had recovered, they themselves fully understood that they would not be able to obtain much of a bonus on their side. They just temporarily some can't accept, this kind of addition less surprisingly can be as little as this degree. All blame that thieving woman Yen Era Xingzhen. Shenlong spat viciously, and in the end, the cause of the overall era of the Qing dynasty's low-style bonus was all added to Cixi's head. However, the truth was that during their reign, they had led the country of Dasha not much better. Speaking of which, right now, Cixi was also on the frontline battlefield of Dasha. This woman who brought Dasha to the most shameful pillar, after recovering out, directly after some righteous people were severely whipped, in the end, the specific relife and death, Dasha's people in the rear are still not too clear. So what to do, such a style addition is simply not enough for us to defend ourselves against those monsters on the opposite side. The second guardian battle, Emperor Qianlong eventually found Duke Rin again. Duke Rin looked ahead, the elegance bonus that Dixia's previous two rods received wasn't enough to fend off the monsters on the other side either, but the guardian warriors from those two rods managed to hold on. They weren't even quite complete, and they still needed that kid winning sky to help replenish them. Qianlong frowned, what are you trying to convey? Duke Rin smiled, I want to express that if our will is strong enough, then the point of not having enough style bonus can be made up for, big deal, we'll just pile up our lives, there are so many of us, we can hold out for a long time by just piling up our lives, pile up lives? Chen Long froze, Duke Ren nodded, that's right, until there is not a single person left on our side, if that doesn't work, then the follow up will have to rely entirely on those juniors in the rear, although this is not a good result, but at least, we tried our best. After listening to Duke Ren's words, Emperor Qianlong was once again angry. He did not feel that this was a good choice. That's all you came up with? Duke Ren sighed, the overall nature is this. As for the other specifics, that will have to wait until we officially start the fight with the 10,000 races and learn about the other side. Qianlong lapsed into silence, he wanted to look for some other ways. But the truth was, in the case of strength, there was simply no other way to hold on to Dasha. Time passes drop by drop, unconsciously, 10 minutes passed. Ten minutes later, Shenlong no way to think of ways. Because the first round of invasion of the 10,000 races in their baton had officially begun. There was no way to think about anything else. After the 10,000 races appeared, the Qing dynasty war defenders also instantly took up their weapons in their hands. Roar! On the frontline battlefield of Grand Xia, the first to charge towards the various guard stations on the Wan clan side was a group of blue lion armies. Unlike the lions on earth, these lions had a lot of pus on their bodies and many tentacles with mouths on their backs. When the tentacle blue lions entered the battle, they directly killed a group of Qing dynasty warriors. Previously, what the Qing dynasty warriors knew about the 10,000 races was what they had heard from the previous bat. Now, they had finally realized how terrifying the enemies they were going to face were. Good, so terrifying. These monsters are too strong, this is simply not an opponent we can defend against. Dead, all at once, so many people are dead. The terror of the 10,000 races is always something you can only understand after you and actually go up against them. Grass, flowers, butterflies, rainbows, and a slight wind. The front line of Dasha, at this time, has the most beautiful environment. But, above the most beautiful environment, at the same time staged, but the most tragic and tragic scene. The monsters tore into the human warriors on the front line, brutally dividing their bodies into several halves. Even a very strong warrior was just an ant in front of certain huge 10,000 races. At this moment, the warriors of the great summer Qing dynasty finally, from their souls, began to be cowed and afraid. We, are simply no match for these monsters. The first round of the first day of the fourth baton of the 10,000 races invasion. The 10,000 races that rushed in. All of them were successfully blocked by the Qing dynasty warriors on the front line of Dasha. However, blocking it did not mean success. Because this round of the 10,000 races itself was just a simple trial run. And it was the other side that was just starting to try their hand. The Qing dynasty warriors on the front line of Dasha had all paid a huge price. Not to mention the heavy casualties, more importantly, their fighting spirit collapsed. 
Before they really fought the 10,000 races, they could be all kinds of brave. They could say in a loud voice, leave the rest to us. They could also casually make a vow, we will definitely defend the country's gates. But now, they have really crossed paths with the 10,000 clans. All the things that had once been there had instantly drifted away like smoke under the absolute oppression of the 10,000 races. Their self-confidence was gone, and they finally lived in reality. Our defense is meaningless, we can't hold on. Finally, the most feared thing of all the people in the rear of the entire Grand Sia had happened. They had the heart to give up, and their fighting spirit became fragmented. Rear, Kyoto, Hospital. Before the start of the Qing Dynasty's battle of defense, Winning Heaven had thought of this scene. But no matter how much it thought about it, it did not expect. These people actually only finished the first fight, the fighting spirit has already all collapsed. Qing Dynasty this dynasty, why the degree of elegance can be so low. In fact, if you think about it carefully, the most important point is related to the fighting spirit. Qing dynasty, especially the late Qing dynasty, the overall spine has been removed. He is not just some emperors are weak, but the whole country have become weak. The result under the rule of the Xiao Shu Min group was such that they were unable to bring the whole country under a completely rational pipe. Then what can be done, either is the absolute force of suppression, or is as if the dog training, all kinds of training, will be under the people are trained to become a weak dog. The Qing dynasty, obviously, has been following the second path. They consolidated their rule in this way. But at the same time, they also made Dashia, as a country, completely collapse. So much so that when an external enemy struck, it would easily result in a collapse of fighting spirit. So, so soon it's time to make the people in the rear the main force in defending the battle? Lying on the hospital bed, Winning Sky was very worried. In the last round, De Xia had chosen to lay down the power of support, which could allow the rear descendants to travel to the battlefield as well. But the number of rear descendants that could go forward was unstable, and the bonuses they could get were greatly weakened, and their battle power was much lower. So according to Winning Sky's thoughts, if this stick of Dasha wanted to successfully hold out, no matter what, the Qing dynasty revived the war defenders, are also to have a role. The people at the back are really just a kind of support. They must have been supporting from the first day. Around noon, the power of support would come down and allow the chosen people in the rear to go to the front. But while they went, the Qing dynasty's war defenders themselves all gave up fighting and ran away. Then, relying only on the people who supported the people who went there, De Xia's national gate would definitely not be able to be defended either ah. It can't just collapse like this ah. Winning Sky's concern at this moment was also the concern of all the people in the rear of the Grand Xia. Everyone was staring at the big screen, fearing that the Qing dynasty's defenders would really collapse so quickly. And then they really started to abandon the battle and run away, which was impossible to evaluate. Time passed in this way, bit by bit. Until the front line of the Grand Xia, the second round of invasion by the 10,000 races officially began on this day. As the story progressed to the present, the atmosphere at the front line of the Grand Xia was already extremely unfavorable. Even many people in the rear. Already, they were already seeing the images of certain Qing dynasty war defenders on the front line running away in advance. What to do? People in the rear were inquiring in their minds. And finally, Da Xia's front line also gave them the answer. That was when everyone was extremely uneasy. Great Xia front line, each guardian battle, stood out so a group of people. These people were all characters that could be called famous during the Qing dynasty of Grand Xia. We have to fight even if we can't, if we don't have the strength to block, then we'll block with our lives. Is anyone thinking of escaping, this is not a good idea. If anyone dares to leave, I will cut off his head first. It was impossible to argue. The Great Xia Qing dynasty was indeed an extremely poor one. But, even if it was an even worse dynasty, there were always many people who could be called elegant. At this moment, they stood out. They used their behavior. They calmed the worries of everyone at the back of the Grand Xia. We will charge at the front. Gazing at the big screen, the images in the front line, the people in the rear of the Grand Xia recognized these people. It was clear that they had never even seen these people's faces before. But now, it was the moment they saw them that all appeared in their minds, their names. Guardian Station Number 3, the one who stood up first, was called Zhang Guofan. Guardian Battle Number 6, the one who stood up first, was called Zhu Zongtong. No. 7 Guardian Battle, the first one to stand up, called Lin Zexu. No. 11 Guardian Battle, the first one to stand up, called Deng Shi Sang. In addition, there are many, many people. These people stood up when the Qing Dynasty in general was about to lose its spine again. With their voices, momentum, at the same time for the Qing Dynasty again formed a temporary spine. As long as we are here, this front line of defense, will not yet be able to fall apart. The chance of these people woke up all the war defenders that the Qing Dynasty had revived out of the front line. Their voices carried a special power that made the cowardly Qing Dynasty warriors, instantly, full of fighting spirit again. 
Battle, 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 battle. The shout spread throughout the entire Dasha front line. The sound startled heaven and earth. At the same time, it also disturbed a certain jade-faced angel in the great Sia subbase on the opposite side of the 10,000 races. On the transparent throne, the holy hearing spirit opened his eyes. His eyes were pure white, and his eyelashes looked like they were covered in a layer of snow. At this moment, the commotion at the great summer front line disturbed him who was taking a nap. His brows were slightly furrowed, and it was clear that he was very dissatisfied at this moment. Disgusting fighting spirit. As the most flabby demonic race in the universe, the super brain intelligence angel hated the word perseverance the most. And now, the frontline warriors of Dasha have changed their fighting attitude. Undoubtedly, they have hit the exact point of his dislike. Spine? The holy hearing spirit bristled. Immediately. On the spot, he followed suit and sent down a command with his mind, telling all of his subordinates to prioritize their attacks on these great Xia's backbones. Both sides fought against each other. Unconsciously, instead, fighting spirit became the most crucial element. This is very surprising, but when you think about it, it's not surprising. After all, the Qing dynasty on the front line of Dasha to defend the war. At the moment the real weak point, itself is that the so-called fighting spirit. As long as the fighting spirit in, like Ren Gong said, Qing so many people, pile of life can also guard many days. And once the fighting spirit is not there, then don't even need the 10,000 races to study how to fight, easily, the Great Xia's national gate will also be broken. Kill. Great Xia, the frontline battlefield. Because there was a clear spine to support them. Facing the second round of invasion by the 10,000 races on this first day, the Qing dynasty's war defenders were clearly in a much better condition. Although the casualties were still very serious, but since people's emotions were able to stabilize a little bit, so after the fight, the total casualties were definitely much less than the first wave. It should, for the time being, be stabilized. Seeing that their own front line had a group of characters to be the spine, and that the war defenders, although their fighting strength still wasn't good, at least they didn't directly collapse, the rear of Dasha, the hearts of the people were finally put down a bit. Time came to noon. The front line side temporarily stabilized. Then the story, it was time to shift to the populace at the rear of Di Xia. The time for the power of support to work was set at noon every day in Grand Xia. Right now, the modern army of Di Xia was ready to go. Half of the soldiers in the rear that could be supported to go to the front line every day were randomly selected from the entire rear, and half could be freely dispatched by the country's top brass. So these people who were soldiers themselves were already directly ready to be dispatched to the front line. Are you guys scared? On the huge open space, a general held a microphone and looked down at the densely packed yet incomparably neat Dasha soldiers below and asked loudly. And in response, the Dasha soldiers replied with a unified and shocking three voices, not afraid. The general took a deep breath and continued to speak, those of us who support the past will receive even less, so little that it's pathetic, so basically after we go, it's impossible for us to come back alive. You guys, you're the ones who are going to die the ones who are going to be meat shields, the ones who are going to forcefully drag out the time of the defense battle with your bodies. Even so, are you all still willing to go, or are you not afraid? Soldiers, not afraid. No fear. Not afraid. The shouts shook heaven and earth. Listening to this consistent cry from the stage, the general standing on the high platform also couldn't help but wet his eyes. Many of these soldiers had attachments that belonged to them. Family, children, lovers. At the very beginning. When the country selected the soldiers who went to the front line, they were selected according to conditions. For example, only children and so on will be put slightly to the back of the selection. But all the soldiers refuse to be screened this way, whether they are only children or have wives and children. In the matter of supporting the front line, their answer was, I'm going. The country couldn't turn them down. So, in the end, they can only give them the same opportunity to die. The country will take care of your families. The sun shone directly on the bodies of the Dixia soldiers. Everyone is good. The general moved to praise. And afterward, along with this praise from the general, a powerful supporting force also finally, officially descended on the rear of Great Xia. A gust of wind blew through, and in just a moment, everyone in the rear of the Grand Xia was clear in their minds as to how many people were available in the rear to support the front on this first day. On the first day of the fourth stick of the defensive battle, the rear of the Grand Xia can reinforce 80,000 warriors for the front line. 80,000, split in half that means. On this day the country could designate 40,000 soldiers to be dispatched to the front line. Yesterday the army was already randomizing the serial numbers for everyone. So at this moment, after learning that the number of soldiers that can be sent is 40,000, the soldiers whose serial numbers were in the first 40,000 on the field directly stood out. They did not have the fear of going to their deaths, but instead, one by one, the corners of their mouths were all wearing smiles. Finally, can let themselves again, have a little roll. 
Yes, before this, everyone had already been powerless for too long. The heavens descended three layers of powerful national gates to protect everyone, but they also blocked everyone. People couldn't get out, and so one by one, they could only stay in the back, being a spectator. Now, they were finally able to personally guard their own country. Although in the past, the odds were that they would really just be killed indiscriminately. After all, the killing power of frontline weapons and the like had all been shielded away. The main body that could cause damage to the races was the bonus chi. And they, the supporters can get very little bonus. However, even if they are killed indiscriminately, if you can get one more person, you can definitely delay the opposite side for one more second. And as long as there are enough people, you can always wear down some of the 10,000 races. For example, that blue tentacle lion. If one person can't beat it, then 10, if 10 can't beat it, then 100. If you really can't, 500, everyone 500 for one of him is fine. Die, just die. The Disya's military peoples were sprightly. They were not afraid of death. Only afraid of not having a single bit of themselves. Raise the national flag, play the national anthem, salute. Familiar music rang out as the red flag fluttered in front of them. Dots of light fell from the sky. It fell onto the first 40,000 Dasha soldiers on the field. In the next second, all of their bodies began to vaporize. They knew that they were going. Some of them didn't move at all, and their expressions didn't even change. And some of them were saying their final goodbyes to the air. Either with their friends, or with their family, or with their loved ones who were waiting for them. Bro, I'll go first, Hana, no, we'll wait for you, can't die. Mom, my son is going to defend our country, my son will keep our country well. Little boy, dad is leaving, you must be obedient at home, do not let mom worry, sad. Wife, you say I can't say love words, before I always refute, now I realize, I'm really a fool, all to this time, think and think. Finally even can only come up with the simplest sentence I love you. The first day of the fourth baton of the 10,000 races invasion, the rear 40,000 DCA soldiers, collectively rushed to the front line. And after that, the soldiers over the strike, then it is also the people. At midday and early fall, the sunlight spattered dappledly on the road through the sparse clouds. The breeze blew by, bringing some coolness. The trees on both sides of the street, whose leaves had not yet completely faded, were yellow and green, as if they were telling the change of seasons. Time seemed to have stopped at this moment, and the birdsong outside the window became shrill, as if reminding people that the world continued to spin, while they fell into stasis. Soon they would begin to be randomly selected, behind the great summer, and the people's hearts were heavy. Going to the front line was death, and this was something that the people in the rear had basically been clear about. Therefore, at a time like this, if you say it's easy and cozy, that's also completely impossible. Being selected cannot go to the front line, do not go also no one knows, people are ultimately selfish, Dasha this wave, I'm afraid that there will be a lot of the public are secretly selected to refuse it? At this moment, the people of other countries at the back were also paying attention to Dasha. When Dasha had chosen the power of support, these people had all praised Dasha's perseverance. However, when they realized that behind this power, there were so many detailed branches. The most important thing is that the selected people can refuse on their own, no one will know if they don't go, and they won't be affected in any way, but only by the front line and those who are rushing to the front line. The people at the back of the countries, but directly on the support power can really play a huge role in the front line of the summer and have a deep skepticism. In this world, everyone is selfish, since you can freely choose not to go, then it is very likely that the power of support will therefore, instead, become a wrong move. If it's me, I definitely won't go, the big deal is to merge into another country before the country's gate shatters. Pretty country, a very majestic man, bristled. He wasn't an exception, almost all of the people in the back of his country felt the same way in their hearts. Similarly, they felt that the populace in the rear of Great Xia would all be the same as them. Are the populace in the rear of the Great Xia afraid of death? The answer to this question might really be what the populace of other countries were thinking at this time. As far as modern people are concerned, there are really very few who are not afraid of death, most of them still want to live, right? So when the long road of certain death comes before them, what will the people at the back of the Grand Xia choose? You've been chosen to go to the front line for support, do you want to go? Yes slash no. Mom's cooking is so delicious today, isn't it? Fried chicken fried chicken fried chicken giant delicious. A small, ordinary home. Noon time. The sunlight poured through the half-open window, spilling into the cozy dining room, forming dappled light and shadow. On the dining table, plates of delicacies with excellent colors and flavors were neatly arranged, emitting a tantalizing aroma. The man sat at one end of the table, the woman and the child sat opposite to each other, the man picked up chopsticks, picked up a piece of braised pork and gently put it in the child's bowl, his eyes full of doting and tenderness. The woman was careful to serve everyone a bowl of soup, the soup was clear, with a few bright green cilantro leaves floating on top. 
On the dining table, the family of three talked and laughed, sharing trivia and anecdotes about each other's lives, their laughter and conversations intertwined, very sweet and beautiful. It's Woon's turn to wash the dishes today, isn't it? The woman looked over at the child as the meal was finished. The child nodded and was about to get up. However, it was directly pulled by the man and stayed on the chair. Wife, there's little Hoon. Daddy's leaving. The man lowered his head with a complicated mood. The woman and child froze at the same time. A few seconds later, a tear streaked down the woman's face. The child, on the other hand, cried straight into tears. Daddy don't go. Little Hoon doesn't want daddy to go. The child pulled hard on the man. In the moment of being pulled, the man also cried. However, he still broke away from the child's hand. Perhaps, daddy can't be the dazzling son in this life. But now, dad is the one who has the chance to go and be a star. The man got up and gave the child and his wife a hug. He didn't want to die, he really didn't want to die. He had a beautiful family, a wife and children who loved him. Yet, he also had a, a country he wanted to protect. Selfishness and fear of death are emotions that everyone has, and the people at the back of the Xia are no exception. However, the exception is that, unlike the people of some countries, the people of this Xia have a deeper love for the concept of country and home. This is a race of people who want to take the earth to wander even at the end of the world. Therefore, they can be selfish, they can also be afraid of death, but ultimately, they can also completely ignore the other because of patriotism. I want to guard my country, merging into other countries and what not, I am not willing. The man firmly chose yes, and then he gave his wife and child a kiss each. Not a moment after the man made his choice, a glow appeared on his body as well. Finally, he left. At the same time, along with him, there were also countless Dasha people who left. Among these people, there were those who, like the man, also wanted to make some contribution. There are also those who do not feel that they can play any role in going to the front line, but still choose to go, just because they feel that even if they do not contribute, they must not go to be a drag. They choose not to go indeed will not have any effect on themselves, but will let the people who go to the front get a lot of weakening. Sorry, the people of Dasha do not want to be a drag on this point, can also have enough to shock the world's strong obsession. Then, in addition, there are also their own entanglement, but family members are forced to go. Mother, I was drawn, how to do ah, uh, I want to go ah? Uh? Brat, how did you ask such a question, if you don't go, your father will have to run out of his grave to disgrace you little turtle grandson. If the choice of the power of support was placed on other countries, there might be problems. But in Disya, there might be a problem, but the problem is definitely a big one. After all, the people in this country really do have too many reasons why they must rush to the front lines at this time. Men, women, commuters, students, bosses, veterans, even the disabled. Even if the child is too small to go, there will definitely be an adult in the family to take his place instead of choosing not to go. Going to die can also go so frankly, such as seen before, I'm afraid that even the people in the rear of the great summer themselves will not think. But now after the choice came, the fact is this, in the national crisis, the people in the rear of Dasha perfectly demonstrated their unique belong to the Yenhua spirit of the Yenhua people. On the first day of the fourth baton of the 10,000 races invasion, the power of support had finished its effect. As a result, 40,000 soldiers collectively rushed to the front line. And the selected people? 40,000 should have gone. In the end, 39,963 actually arrived. 37 chose not to go out of fear. This is normal and abnormal. Normal because there were 37 people. And abnormal because there were only 37 people. This, how is it possible? After the effect was over, the power of support placed the results in the minds of everyone in the entire rear. Upon realizing that Dashia had actually used the power of support so completely, in the rear, the people of the other countries were all dumbfounded. In their understanding, this was an impossible number. Or, even the populace at the rear of the Grand Xia itself felt that it was impossible. But right now, such an impossibility just clearly became a fact. What exactly is the reason? Is it because of the popularization of their patriotic education? Or maybe it's because they are such an outrageous country from the bottom of their bones? The people in the backwaters of his country pondered variously, thinking that both of these points were very likely. And beyond that, eventually, they also found a bigger or rather the most crucial reason. That is, the perseverance shown by the forefathers of the first two batons of the Grand Xia in the Battle of Defense had deeply infected their rear as well. This kind of infection was not just an invisible emotional infection, but rather, their resolute will might have actually formed a special chi that was transmitted back to the rear of the Grand Xia, physically giving the people in the rear of the Grand Xia more firmness in their wills and the courage to overcome difficulties. In that case, it should indeed be so. My fear of death and making choices is really bad. But again, I really wanted to come. Then a wind blew by, and my fear was much smaller straight away. On the front line, the people from the rear of Disya who came to the battlefield at this time also realized this. 
The corners of their mouths were all tinged with smiles, and it was clear that they were very thankful that their forefathers and ancestors had helped them, not letting them become a drag on the entire country, as well as those brave supporters who dared to come to the front line, because of their shameful cowardice, there were some who didn't come, and the bonus we got weakened a little more. However, since the number of people who didn't come was really small, this weakening isn't considered serious. Being able to have more power to deal with the 10,000 races was an absolutely good thing. So after realizing that their own families were able to use the power of the lower support so perfectly, the people of Disya who had come to the front line were all very happy as well. Although, this is just a process that has not changed from week to weaker. Support has come. Seeing the people from the rear who rushed to come, the defenders of the Qing dynasty were also hopeful. The will that had been brought up by the backbones had risen even higher at this moment. These descendants of ours are here to support and get very little bonus. That's why they'll all mainly be placed in the rear, on shooting missions. And we're going to be in the front, any comments? Guardian station number 3. Zhang Woman, who had triangular eyes and a beard, made this arrangement after the support arrived. His voice did not only reach the guardian battle he was in, but also the other guardian battles. What can be wrong with this, even if there's no such added difference, we can't let them charge ahead. That's right, where would you let a child charge ahead and an adult stand behind? Wrong, it should be more accurate to say that there are people whose grandchildren are in the front and their grandparents are in the back, these are our children and grandchildren. If you want to say that, the grandchildren are not right either, but they are definitely the juniors, we have to be like the ancestors, and we don't even need to talk about protecting the juniors. For Zhang Buofan's arrangement, people on the front line of Dasha basically have no opinion. Even the twelve emperors who were guarding the battle, although they were a bit unhappy with Zhang Guofan's behavior of stealing the limelight, but in the end, they all supported Zhang Guofan's arrangement. Come on, let the battle continue. The power of support was displayed, and the front line of Dashia was reinforced. And after the reinforcement was over, the content of the front line that should have continued as usual continued. After about half an hour, a new round of invasion by the 10,000 races began once again. Although the gap in hard power still led to heavy deaths and injuries on the Grand Xia front line. However, because of the reinforcements that were added, the number of dead and wounded was ultimately less than before. Fight to the death, do not retreat. Next, the remaining rounds of invasions by the 10,000 races went on as usual. And the results were basically fixed in one area. In every battle, the deaths and injuries on the Great Xia side were severe though. But no matter what, in the end, they managed to hold on. The first day, just like this. Kyoto, hospital, inside the ward. When the last round of invasion on the first day of the fourth stick of the 10,000 races invasion ended, Winning Sky looked at the contents of the front line and slowly exhaled a breath. At the front line nowadays, the battle was undoubtedly grueling, and the sacrifices were undoubtedly huge, but if the sacrifices could be exchanged for ultimate success, then such sacrifices would all be meaningful. There is nothing I can do about it. Whether or not this bat can be kept down, all that can be seen is everyone. Lying on the hospital bed, now, Winning Day's situation is also quite marvelous. In the first two bats, he was the savior of the backfield, and after this bat, he could have swiped the ink to be the bridge builder for those glorious forefathers to reappear in the world. But, with this bat, he just couldn't do anything, couldn't play any role. The history of the Qing dynasty doesn't need him to restore, what can be brought back to life has already been brought back to life, even the martial artists of that time have actually arrived at the front line at this moment. As for his body, at this moment, his body is really not able to let him write another text. The sharing effect that the great summer consciousness had sacrificed itself for had ended at the end of the last baton, so winning Sky's writing of a text had once again turned into an exertion that was only directed at his ego. Although, according to winning Sky's own judgment, it would only take a month for him to completely recover as well. And by the time he reached the next month, he was even able to directly elevate himself to writing at will, calling out a thousand armies daily without breaking a drop of sweat, spiritual threshold was growing all the time. But, in a roundabout way, in this stick, when he should not be able to help, he still could not help. Feeling powerless? Inside the ward, the old man was also there. Winning Sky nodded and said, it feels like I've lost my role all of a sudden. The old man froze slightly, then a smile appeared on his face, how could you think so, still, without you, our Dasha wouldn't have been able to obtain the best performance bonus at all, then there wouldn't even have been any support that the backfield could give to the front line during this batting order, isn't that already a great role? I just feel a bit uncomfortable with the sudden idleness. Winning Sky cried and laughed. The old man shook his head and said, you still have things to do now. Winning Sky was a bit confused, what? The old man spoke, rest well, get your body fully recuperated, and then after this baton is over, recreate for our Dasya the crown of the world that you speak of. Winning Sky was silent for a few seconds, and finally nodded down seriously, I will. This bat will depend on everyone, you have to trust everyone. 
The old man exhaled deeply, although your kid's will is indeed rigid, the story within our Grand Sia can never be one of individual heroism. Those folk down there, they inherit the will of their forefathers. As long as they can ascend to the stage, then they too will surely create an epic that belongs to them. The old man's words were extremely powerful. After listening to the old man's words, Winning Sky was also humbled for a moment. Yes, they will definitely create an epic that belongs to them. He smiled, and after that, followed by a firm nod down. The passing time was like light smoke. It dispersed at the slightest breeze. The night seemed to be only an instant, and a new day soon began. Early morning. On the front line of Dasha, the war defenders were already early in the morning. As for the rear, the people of Dasha were also watching early. Winning day is also watching, very seriously watch, to say, since the beginning of excessive consumption of writing, winning day to the front line of the battle basically has not been very subtle, very serious, and is completely put down in the mind of the chaotic thoughts of the watch. Now all the messy ideas retrieved, completely not to think about how they want to go out and look at the front line again, when the sky is finally again see the front line of the countries on some very important content. As we all know, the front line battlefields of various countries, the recovered souls were divided into three levels, soldier level, general level, and emperor level. The titles here didn't exactly correspond to the deceased soul's past status. Soldier and emperor are fine. Soldiers are really all small soldiers or ordinary people, and emperors are really only emperors. But, the general level is different, the general level is not really just those who have been generals to reach this level. In addition to those who have really been generals, some of the higher degree of personal elegance will also be rated directly into this grade. In the end, as long as they were rated at the general level and above, they would also have some personal strength added to them. The bonus here was even something that would allow them to evolve the chi in their body into something similar to a skill. For example, on the battlefield before, that one is like a lance wrapped in lightning. Of course, this wasn't the point, as this was something that Winning Sky had known long ago. Now, when Winning Sky once again went to watch the frontline content without any other thoughts, the key point that he suddenly discovered was that these people's skill performance was actually not completely irregular. Just like the power of civilization in war, which allowed the civilization to gain power, the various manifestations were related to what they had done before they were born. The skills that these warriors above the rank of general had condensed with their chi were also related to their past lives. For example, Mr. Deng Shirsan, who said, this day is filled with tears, and there is a man who is strong enough to strengthen the navy's prestige. Mr. Deng Shirsan was an admiral at the end of the Qing dynasty, so the skills condensed from his qi after his resurrection at this time are also related to naval battles. And then add the most famous wave of his life, the Dai together. In the case of the enemy, as if dying, commanded the Ziyuan ship, directly hit the enemy ship. So when he was revived, his final skill became the following. People who do not die, but I hope to die well. With a wave of his hand, the Ziyuan ship reappeared and changed into a sea area out of thin air. The attack power of the ship was extremely powerful, and when it was about to be shattered by the 10,000 races, it would directly explode itself, blowing up all of the surrounding 10,000 races. Frontline Battlefield The moment Tang Shishan called out the distant ship and visualized the sea. All those who witnessed such a scene were stunned. Especially after the distant ship would also explode itself to attack foreign enemies. On the side of Grand Xia, the morale of the war defenders had risen by a large margin. A character that could be rated as a general. Even if the overall bonus of the era they lived in was not much. In the end. Yet, they were also able to play the role of one against a hundred on the battlefield. Their existence was undoubtedly another base for the human side to defend the battle. And then, besides Deng Shixiong, Winning Sky also watched the performance of many other Guardian Battle Lieutenant General level characters. The Seventh Guardian Battle. Mr. Lin Zexu, the first person who opened his eyes to the world in modern times in the Qing dynasty of Dasha. After he became a general level, the skill that his personal bonus allowed him to coalesce with his chi was related to his once most classic Tiger Gate smoke release. His skill is to release a lot of floating quicklime and water, and then the two together release a lot of heat as well as a layer of very special blue tiger-like ghosts, which won't hurt his own people, but only the evil spirits in the heaven and earth, that is, the 10,000 races on the other side. And the ghosts he released would stay in a place as long as they were released, lasting for at least an hour. Every time the 10,000 races invade, it will consume its divine sense to release countless tiger-headed ghosts at once, and after the ghosts, the 10,000 races that invade with low defenses will die directly, and the ones with high defenses will be consumed quite a bit. Then, there are some main melee characters. For example, Dorgan, Nianzang Yao, Ao Defeat, and so on. They were all good fighters and famous ministers in their lives. So when their skills are materialized, they are basically related to their melee skills. Basically, they are related to their own melee combat and the melee combat of their men. Aofei can become huge and increase his strength by 10 times in a short period of time. 
Ten times is a horrible number, that is, the era addition is too low, plus their own level does not reach an outrageous degree, otherwise, their own outrageous and then doubled by ten times, said that it is a battlefield killing weapon is not too much. Of course, even if it is not enough to lead to the final did not reach the degree of killer, but after doubling, ultimately, AO in the battlefield is also play a great role. And after that, Nian Wan Yao, Dorgan, these two people's skills are relatively similar. To the extent that they boosted their own strength, they were also able to make their men's battle power increase dramatically. This point is somewhat similar to the front of Dashia, some of the forefathers of the Republic of China during the war period. In those two periods, many characters that could reach the general level also had such skills. For example, Zheng Zuolin had such a skill. From the introduction, such a skill was much more common than the skills that other general level characters could produce with their qi. But on the battlefield, it was instead the most useful. After all, whether it is a long distance faction, or personal force faction, there is a person for the battle, a person you again strong, in fact, will not be too strong, after all, the number of 10,000 races is really quite a lot, you a person again how to kill cannot come, but this skill, but can increase the henchmen, henchmen are stronger, then the final battle is certainly much more than a person to kill 10,000 races. It was because some of the forefathers had such a skill that the two sticks of the great summer resistance and the republican period were able to hold out. They may not be able to be the savior, change the situation, but can be the cornerstone, so that both sides of the battle as much as possible to stabilize, so that their own side as far as possible not to be the opposite side of the 10,000 races pulled too far apart. With the existence of these general level characters. In addition, a new batch of reinforcements arrived from the rear. On the second day of the fourth baton of the 10,000 races invasion, Great Xia still managed to hold the country's gates. Then, the next, just like that, two more days passed. On the third and fourth day after that, Winning Sky observed many more people. If the second day he paid more attention to the famous generals and ministers category, then the following two days, he paid more attention to the literati as well as the martial artists of the Qing dynasty. The literati originally did not have much power on the battlefield. Even if their fame was enough for them to reach the rank of general, they would not be able to condense their skills with their qi. However, now with the existence of the power of literary battle, although they still can't use their qi to condense skills, they are completely able to use their works to transform skills. And the skills that they can produce with their works are also more abundant and varied, unlike other generals who can only produce one skill, and powerful ones who can only produce two. If the writers have enough works, they can release seven or eight skills. For example, when Mr. Lu Flood, he can pen and ink into a sword, pen and ink into a tiger, or even pen and ink directly into a blood mouth mother emperor. In the present baton, a lot of literati have also shown their power. Needless to say, Mr. Liang Qi Dian is ridiculously strong. A junior Dasha said out of the dry, the whole army fighting spirit and combat strength did not know how much to raise. Then, Mr. Chao Shuqin, who wrote one of the four great masterpieces, Dream of Red Mansions, was also outrageous. Once his work came out, many of the Wan clan's demonic monsters on the opposite side were directly all controlled and unable to move dare you believe it? Although, the 10,000 races side also had countermeasures afterward, and some monsters directly had the ability to lift this specific control state. However, even if you can only control some of the monsters, control for 3 seconds, but it is also enough to make the battle situation on the side of the great summer warriors, a lot better. After that, Zheng Banxiao, Gong Zizhen, Nalin Shurda and a number of other literati also had their own specialties, and played a great role on the battlefield. This makes the winning day as well as all the people in the rear of Dasha and watching is also once again lamented, when the choice of the power of literary warfare, is really extremely correct. After the literati have passed, the last ones will be the martial artists. Three days of watching, there were quite a few people who shocked winning sky, but to say that the most shocked, but unexpected instead, were these martial artists at the end. Prince Ping, Huang Fei Hong, Yang Luchan, Gui Yunshin, Han Muman, Hui Yuanjia, Wang Wu, Li Xu Wen. They had been rated as generals and possessed skills that belonged to them, making them even more powerful. But underneath being powerful, what really shocked Winning Sky was that their own various kinds of martial arts skills were surprisingly just about all true. In modern times, martial arts may still exist, but it's almost impossible to see, at least Winning Sky has never seen it with his own eyes, so in his mind, martial arts has become something very ethereal. But right now, seeing some of the martial arts masters that once existed reappear in the world, Winning Sky's worldview was refreshed. This has to be all true. Then the martial arts masters in the various dynasties further up the Grand Xia, their kung fu, they can't all be real too? One can only say that if this stick can survive, then the frontline battlefield might really be explosively exciting. Lying on the hospital bed, Winning Sky swallowed a mouthful of saliva. He had already imagined the picture of a certain man surnamed Zhang making his shining debut. Saints are also one, sages are also one, and all things in heaven and earth are nothing but one. 
a violent shiver ran through him. In the next second, winning Sky coughed and hurriedly shifted his attention back. And then, the center of attention was once again placed on the frontline battlefield. The story continued. Great Xia's frontline battlefield. The general level characters were still displaying their divine might. However, it was just like what I said before. The era bonus given to them by the Qing dynasty as a whole is still too little after all. And the strength of the 10,000 races really isn't weak, and it's still strengthening all the time. There are all sorts of abilities on the Dasha side, and all sorts of abilities on their side as well. So in the end, although the various general level bigwigs mentioned above were all praised again and again, in the end, they were actually only just barely able to lead everyone to fight the encroaching 10,000 races in a balanced or even slightly inferior manner. Of course, in the case of such a low era bonus, to be able to fight like this, everyone was already very satisfied. If you can always be so balanced and inferior until 30 days have passed, that is also really enough to make people cheer. Just, the opposite of the 10,000 races is not likely to let everyone just like this strong drag down. From the fifth day of the invasion in the fourth stick, the strategy of the 10,000 races changed. They began the ultimate targeting style, kill the leader. Previously, they had been targeting and killing the leaders of the Great Xia's war defenders. The purpose of this was to break the temporary backbone of the Great Xia's current batting order. But the targeting at that time was just ordinary targeting. That is to say, in the battle, prioritize the attack on the front line of the Great Summer of the General Polekeeper. Next, they became extreme targeting. That is to say, according to the different guardian battle of Dasha before the different ability of the general level warguards, they send out monsters that are specialized in restraining their abilities and are best at killing the opponent to attack. For example, Chao Shuichin, who was able to cast an illusion spell to make the demons stop in place and be stunned. The next step was to send a group of tier 4 chaos fox monsters, which were fully uncontrollable and could even bounce back from control, to attack the guard station where they were located. In addition, they also used mantis monsters that could quickly close in on him to decapitate him. With this kind of targeting, after only one day, the number of general level characters on the Grand Xia side was reduced by a lot. Defending the front line is never easy, and now, the 10,000 races have finally gotten their act together. Or perhaps the equalization they fought out with the Grand Xia front line a few days ago was even just a deliberate equalization on their part, in order to just probe in detail the abilities and weaknesses of Grand Xia's different general level battle defenders again. Sure enough, this national gate isn't that well guarded ah. On the night of the fifth day of the fourth stick of the 10,000 clans invasion, it was time to rest. At the back of the front line, the hearts of everyone in De Xia were once again tightened all at once. It was difficult for the Grand Xia side to have any response to such a machination of the 10,000 clans. It was because the reason for such a strategy was the same as what the 10,000 clan had done before. It was also the same as the magic sea tactics that the 10,000 clans had come up with before. It was the most basic, the final result of the gap between the strengths of the two sides being too great. Let the general level battle guards position themselves a little further back, and protect them with more ordinary battle guards. Let the general level battle guards replace the guarding battle they are guarding, and disrupt the position, thus making the demonic monsters sent against the style from the 10,000 clan side ineffective. After pondering for a long time, in response to the Wan clan's young plot, the Great Xia frontline side was only able to execute a series of tiny response strategies similar to this. But unfortunately, a hard power gap that was too large was a hard power gap that was too large. After the Wan clan side arranged for targeted demonic monsters, even if the general level guardian warrior was surrounded by more protectors, damned if he was, he would still die. And if you replace the guardian battle, not only will it be easy for the guardian battle itself to become vacant, in the process of replacing it, the guardians who are going to be shifted into position will also directly consume a lot of their minds for nothing. Of course, this is not the point. The point is, the plan of the great summer side. The 10,000 races side was like having a pair of eyes that could see through everything. It's always, always being watched by them. This makes it so that no matter which new guardian battle the general level guardian warrior on the great Xia side is converted to, on the side of the 10,000 clans, they would all arrange their restrained demonic monsters there on the spot. Is it the new unified juggernaut from the opposite side? The setting that the 10,000 races would change their unified juggernaut with every attack was also known to the human war protectors. Therefore, at this moment, when their side's countermeasures were all nullified, on the spot, the morale of the De Xia frontline warrior defenders fell again. Small changes and small methods are all useless, if there is no big countermeasure. Soon, we won't be able to hold out anymore. On this night, behind the front line, everyone in Disya took a deep breath. And then, extremely synchronized, in the next second after the deep breath was taken, everyone placed their eyes on the 12 emperors of the Qing dynasty period of Dasha. General level historical figures could all use their chi to condense extremely powerful personal skills after their revival. 
Then what kind of abilities would the emperor level emperors who were one level higher than the general level and had just had their restrictions lifted until this baton and revived to the frontline battlefield have? Emperor level is definitely too much stronger than general level. At the back, hope rose in the hearts of some of the populace. They were able to be so certain not only because of the difference between the high and low levels of both the emperor and general ranks. It was even more so because just today, on the front lines of other countries, content footage of emperor ranked characters showing off their skills just happened to appear. Characters that were rated at the emperor level had personal extra bonuses that were terrifying, and as a result, the skills that they could condense with their chi were basically earth-shattering in terms of how they could change the battlefield. Right now, De Xia's side was losing its way under the new changes of the 10,000 races. But what if those 12 emperors stepped in, could they instantly turn the situation around? Even if this era of the Qing dynasty pulled the crotch even more, even if everyone's era additions were low at the moment. Emperors, after all, were emperors. The personal bonus they received was hardly less. So, it's our turn so soon. In the seventh guardian battle, Yang Zhang noticed everyone's gazes. As a matter of fact, the current him was already eager to make a move as well. However, the reality was that at this time, he was still not allowed to make a move. There is a fundamental difference between an emperor and a general after they are revived. A general can fight as soon as he is revived. While the emperor's ability to condense with qi has a waiting period. During this period, the emperor's ability is blocked from use. Until the waiting period is over, it can't be used. And the length of the waiting period. The favoritism is again tied to the level of splendor of the entire era. Looking at all the war defenders in front of him, and at the same time looking at all the people who were concerned coming from the rear of the Grand Xia, Yongzheng helplessly and bitterly lowered his head. We still need time. Night. Da Xia's frontline battlefield was still eerily holy. Even after a few days of war baptism, it is still not stained with a drop of blood, not stained with a trace of dust. Flowers are still blooming. Butterflies, on the other hand, have been looking for a place to rest. And after such a beautiful scene, the people on the frontline battlefield painted a completely different picture. Wounds, blood, broken clothes, and sad faces. How much longer will it take? A general level battlekeeper inquired. Yang Zheng pondered for a few seconds and spoke, 15 days. 15 days? After hearing Yang Zheng's answer, the frontline, everyone was stunned. One should know that every period of war defenders only defend for a total of 30 days. And now, their baton had managed to defend for 6 days. Since the fifth day, the 10,000 tribes had begun the targeted killing of the leaders. On the sixth day, that is, today, they carried out some simple responses. However, it turned out to be completely useless, and they lost a lot of general level characters at once. Under such circumstances, the emperors even said that they would have to wait another 15 days before they could utilize the abilities they possessed after their resurrection. 15 days plus 6 days, that's 21 days, at that time, would they still need to make a move? Not to mention that at that time, it wouldn't be long until the end of the guard battle for their baton, according to the current situation, they simply didn't even have the qualifications to last until then. There's no way to go faster? No way, the waiting period is fixed. Lowering his head, Yang Jun felt extremely humiliated. At this moment he once again realized the importance of the era's elegance addition. It was a pity that their Qing dynasty had not succeeded in grasping this power. Fifteen days then, eventually, on the frontline battlefield, the spine once again stepped forward. The waiting period for the emperor's ability could no longer be altered. There was no point in bemoaning anything at this moment. So, hang in there, continue to hang in there. Use your life to hold on, hold on for these 15 days. At least for 15 days. It's better than just holding on until the end of the war. The seventh day of the fourth rod of the invasion of the 10,000 races. The invasion of the demons and monsters came again. On the front line battlefield, the guardian warriors fought with all their might to resist. While at the back, people were still continuously reinforcing them. The number of reinforcements available today is 160,000. The number of people that can be freely selected, which is 80,000. Serial number following yesterday and then after 80,000 sons and daughters of Dasha. For the sake of Dasha, for the sake of Dasha's children in the rear, we march to the front. At ease, stand at attention. Raise the national flag, play the national anthem. The opposite side of the national flag. The old man looked at the two generals beside him. After a few seconds of silence, he opened his mouth. Have you decided? The two generals froze. Immediately afterward, smiles appeared on their faces. Wasn't it decided from the beginning? Things like reinforcing the front line, all beings in the rear are equal. No one can rely on privileges. We are naturally no exception. Since we also went to draw the serial number, we must go on when it's our turn. A middle-aged general responded seriously. The old man nodded, and then looked at the other general. 
What about you? The serial number you drew is quite far back, right? Today, it's not your turn yet, is it? The other general was still laughing. That, old Zhang doesn't want to engage in privilege, I want to engage. Other people's privilege is to go to the front line or not to go directly. This one, but engaged in the privilege of first to go. Looking at its silly and happy appearance, the old man and the other general were also helpless. In the end, the old man nodded to the two generals, go here, don't lose my Dixia's face. There was no talk about going here safely, nor was there any talk about going here to kill more demonic monsters. After all, these, really all very ethereal. However, the point of not disgracing the face of the Grand Xia can be left out of the ethereal existence. Yes, the two generals raised their hands at the same time and did the standard salute to the old man. After that, the old man also returned their standard salute. Civilian. At the same time, countless small homes, countless ordinary de Xia folk were also experiencing their parting. There were fathers making their partings with their children, and there were also husbands making their partings with their wives. The majority of those leaving were males. This was because the populace that was randomly selected to go had an option that could be adjusted. That is, relatives who are related by blood can take the place of those chosen to go to the front. When some overly young children were selected, their fathers naturally took it upon themselves to replace them and head to the front lines. Similarly, when overly old men were chosen, their sons would directly replace them and go to the front line. As for the fact that they could have just avoided going to the front after they were chosen, they didn't have to go through the trouble of substituting? Sorry, the people at the back of Dashia don't understand what I'm saying. As the descendants of the dragon, the people of Dashia have their own arrogance. Not to mention, nowadays they have been specially infected by their forefathers during the war. They can't be cowards, even if they are too weak to stand up. Their forefathers who passed away during the resistance period upwards would also use an invisible form of chi to directly push them out by force. Professor Wynn, it's my turn, I should go. Kyoto, hospital, ward. Chu Chang'an was having his last lunch with Win Tian, as dining buddies who accompanied them. Winning Sky and Zhu Chang'an also had a certain degree of friendship. So now that Zhu Chang'an was leaving, he was a bit sad to see him go. However, he also understood that parting was bound to happen. And this kind of parting was the other party's honor. So he shouldn't be sad. At this moment, what should be on his face should be a smile. Go and perform well, as well as remember my words and live to the end. At that time, you will get an unrivaled surprise. Winning Sky's words made Zhu Chang'an a little confused. Professor Win, I still don't know what you're talking about. Xu Chengen shook his head, however, my mom told me that I must listen to you, you are the hero of our Grand Xia, and I myself want to listen to you, so I will definitely stay alive and live to the end. Winning Sky smiled, aha, uh -huh, it will be, your ancestors will bless you.